Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects, and we feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to crafting or a seasoned pro, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 1pm to 8pm, and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Huge thank you to the team at Sewing Street, and it is brilliant to be back here with you with Hobby Maker now. I'm Rosie, joined by James for our Creative Expressions first hour. How are you doing? I'm very good, thank you very much, Rosie. Good. I'm you? very excited about I this. I know, I am again today as well. It's fabulous, it's a great isn't it? To play with. It really is a fantastic collection, and we're going to tell you all about it in a moment's time. But first of all, I'm just going to give you a little bit of a rundown as to what is coming up on today's show because it is a jam-packed day. It's just full of brilliant, brilliant crafting opportunities. So take a look at this. We've got James here with Creative Expressions with the Dream Cart Collection. And this is genuinely for everybody. You're going to love this. It's really nostalgic. It's really vintage. It's just wonderful. So that's all going to be happening um, in a moment's time. Two o'clock. And we're actually going to put this on pre-order right now. Um, it's back in stock. This is sold out completely three times. It's the Gemini Stepper Card Dies Collection. Debbie Fisher is here to take us through. It's on the website right now. Don't miss out on this for a fourth time, whatever you do. Um, so go and check it out while you can. Three o'clock, we've got, and we've all been chatting about this upstairs, absolutely love this from Visible Image. It's the drink, stamp and die collection. Only my three favourite drinks, James. <laughs> Beer, wine and gin. Oh, it's perfect. absolutely win, win, win. What's your favourite? <laughs> we did actually, didn't we? It's a theme here, isn't I, I, I got, I there? Which like would you go for? I'd like something special. Oh. Oh, nice. Mm. Very nice. Have you got a speciality cocktail then? Pina Colada, nothing that special. Okay. Yeah. Oh, Tropical. nice though. Tropical. Yeah. Mm. Nice and sweet and fruity. Mm. Gets you in a party mood, doesn't it? It's fabulous. <laughs> um, so that is all happening with Visible Image. It's a gorgeous collection and it's the first time you've seen the stamps and dies together. So it's really, really exciting. Um, then we've got Debbie back at Crafter Companion for your cluster lift dies. These have been massively popular as well. Really, really beautiful. Very simple to use as well. Um, so Debbie will be talking you through that and showing you some gorgeous samples too. Um, and five clock back in stock we'll have james back here with creative expressions and the art deco collection from sue wilson six o'clock crafters is back with bold geometric 3d embossing folders um, which is another bestseller and then at seven o'clock you've got unmissable deals and inspiring demos with mark and visible image again so it's going to be a really exciting day as always, we're live, we're interactive. Get your messages in. And if you have any questions about this beautiful collection, um, then message in. James is here. Yep. He can talk you through. He can answer any questions. So, so yeah, message through. Um, now, there are four different ways to shop with this collection, actually, aren't there, there James? There is, yes. Because you've got yeah. three smaller bundles and you've got the I Want It All bundle. Now, we predict you're going to want it all <laughs> because it's amazing. But just as James is taking you through the different sets, Keep your eyes on the graphics because they will change and you will get those three smaller bundles there as an opportunity as well. But really, everybody wants it all. It's going to be good. Um, now, this is just absolutely amazing, this collection. I love it. Uh, what do you love about it? I think I really love the fact it's, it's something very, very different that Sue's done. Um, I've not really recently seen um, many really classic car dies and stamp sets for some time in the craft market mm -hmm. so to bring out a complete range of cars which match and work with the stamps which you'll see in a minute so you can stamp with them you can cut with them but at the same time they will work together so you can actually stamp them and cut them out and they line up absolutely oh. perfectly it's a really different style for sue and i think it's just really nice to have a set of really good working dies and it's i mean obviously we're thinking men and father's day but i know i was saying yesterday plenty of uh, female friends which love the minis oh and absolutely and saying oh it's my first car it's my favorite favorite car oh. or uh, maybe they're learning to drive or it's so many so many uses for all of those yeah just pass your test Bastard as well test. yeah Bastard absolutely test. um it's an incredible collection it really really is it's beautiful and, and I really do mean beautiful because actually the great thing about the dies and the stamps is you can make them very fun and bright and bold absolutely but you can also as you've done here go go for the metallic something a little bit more a bit more classic yeah like absolutely yeah. oh now before I forget yes. you've got three giveaways today I, and I forgot Yes, we have. Oh, yes. I did too. <laughs> Laura's just reminded us. I said before I forget, I had forgotten. Laura reminded me. <laughs> yeah, we've got three cards to give away. We have, yeah, all signed by Sue Wilson. So mm -hmm. She was with me a couple of weeks ago, so before she left, I got her to sign a few cards from this very collection. <gasps> yes. Um, that she designed herself. 
That's amazing. Mm. All you need to do is shop for the I Want It All bundle, okay? Um, either yesterday, many of you did, or today, and you can be in with a chance of winning. And the winners will be announced today with James at five o'clock. Okay, so that's going to be a really, really lovely really announcement good. to make as well. Nice. Brilliant. Um, right, let's get started and okay. show, um, first of all, this, this first smaller bundle, because these are just absolutely beautiful, aren't they? Yep, they absolutely are. So, should we go for Yeah. Oh, here we go. Do you want to do the car ones first, or should we have a look at the accessories? The car ones yeah. first. Let me grab those for you. Here we you. go. Oh, they're over there. So there we go. We've got them here, so let's Happy walk there. through those, and I can bring out some samples from the design team as well, then. Fantastic. Here we go. I love with the dies that you're getting that embossing detail Yeah, well. so the dies have got, as you can see, a lot of uh, embossed and debossed details that Sue's uh, designed into these dies. So even before you stamp them, there's a lot of detail there. You can pick yeah. out a lot of Cosmic Shimmer products. They look absolutely stunning. So that's our classic car collection. So you get the two dies in that set. Uh, and the lovely thing with all of these, the uh, windscreens cut out, but you can leave them in as well. Oh, nice. I've seen okay. This, you could even, if you had a little photo of somebody, maybe it's a birthday card, you could even put their little head behind the steering wheel. Oh, I love that I idea. That's a really, really good idea. Really good yeah. idea. Yeah. yeah. So our sporty supercars here. Um, so yeah, your fate sort of fate, and they're kind of generic, but at the same time, we can see it's a Porsche, we can see it's a Ferrari. Yeah. So you, know, you can have your classic red Ferrari and um, your, your blue Porsche, your white Porsche, your silver Porsche, whatever you want. Again, loads of detail in the die there, or uh, in. Boston debossed. I always wanted a red Ferrari in Beverly Hills 90210. Yeah, yeah, I can't remember classic. her name. The blonde girl had yeah. a had a red Ferrari, and I was like, I want that car. <laughs> Never got it. Never happened. And then, <laughs> oh well. I know. <laughs> With these, you can have every car. We can have every you can car have you ever every dreamed car, of. Every, That's every it. <laughs> Um, and then our classic or vintage collection that we've got here. Um, again, real sort of Americana at the bottom there with a sort of a real American uh, classic, um, yeah. almost taxi style vehicle there. And then at the top, a Rolls, or what I like to think is a Rolls Royce. But again, generic yeah. vintage um, a vehicle there. Again, loads of detail in the embossed and debossed. I mean, they are absolutely beautiful because of the detail. They're so lovely just in white, actually, aren't they, as well? But they really they come do. to life when you start to use your, uh, um, your metallics and things. They're yep. beautiful. Um, so that is your three die set collection. Okay, amazing deal for you there for $31.99. That's VI2859 is your code for that as well. Um, you will be able to get them on their own as well. But now here are the accessories. So I've got those back with the. Thank you. Very much. Are there. there we are. There we go. Here we go. Um, and these are just great, aren't they? Because they're so versatile. Very, very versatile with all these. So we've got the all important different sentiments. So we've got ones that are obviously going to work really well with Father's Day there, or maybe just for birthdays, all geared up, great oh, for love vintage it. and the classic vehicles, all sorts of different celebrations for that. And you're a real classic, That's which I think great. is a real nice play on words with all of these that Sue's done. And they're all two dies. So you've got the background and the lettering, which you can use independently. Brilliant. Which is really nice. This is genius, what we're I about to show you next. Yes. I really yeah, love yeah. this. It's, this is attention to detail here, <laughs> isn't it? Two, two different style tyre tracks. Yes. So you can actually match them in with a vintage type of um, tyre and then also a classic sporty tyre. It's really uh, cool. These are fantastic for your borders. They're fantastic even just for making backgrounds with. Uh, you'll see me use these uh, yesterday and again later on today as well. And they are brilliant for making up frames and borders yeah. and, and backgrounds with them as well. I love them. I just think they're absolutely fantastic. And you've got... Um, these gorgeous assorted tool borders as well, which are brilliant. Yeah, really popular these were yesterday. I'm not surprised. I, I think you can obviously snick in and cut away in each of the individual cogs there. You could even cut away at the individual tools if you wanted to. So it could be for carpentry or workshop. Oh, yeah. Lots and lots of different uses for these. Yeah. Um, but I think having the, the screw heads and nuts and the bolts there, I think it's a real versatile assorted tool board. It is. It's fab. And actually, with all the cogs and things, that could go into steampunk as well Absolutely. a little bit, couldn't it? A bit of mixed media work as well. There's an awful lot you can do with these but they obviously work so so well with the with the cars yeah it's fabulous um this is just brilliant this is your car accessories 34.99 once again for the whole bundle which is just absolutely brilliant and then we have another set for you um which is your stamp set and these work beautifully um with all of those so the dies and the stamps match they, identically they don't match they with the cars perfect. so this is as far as i'm aware i know sue uh, doesn't bring out stamps that often with her collections um but she has done in the past but what's really different unique with this collection i believe for the first time is these stamps are designed to work with the dies so you can actually stamp these images out if you're a bit of a stamper Maybe you've not tried die cutting before. This is a great way of going from one to the other because you can now cut out your stamp images and they match up oh, absolutely yeah. perfectly. Matches beautifully. Yeah. Do you know who this reminds me of? Doc from Cars. Oh. Yes. 
Do you remember? It's just, it's such a brilliant, brilliant car. I love that. He's my favourite character in this cars. Is the thing, as well. You do see slightly different, and, and I've, when I've shown people when I, when I was doing some samples, and people look at the, the Mini and they, and they see their Mini instantly. Yes, yeah, and, yeah. And I think that's the thing with these. They, they've, Sue has kind of captured that generic looking Beetle yeah. Mini. And uh, whether you've had a Union Jack or white roof or yes. whatever it may be, you can colour them how you want. My friend Sarah had a racing green little mini yep. when we were at uni together. We all crammed in there <laughs> many a time. Wheel. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. How many people do you get in a mini? Yeah. Um, this is lovely as well. Look at that. Just uh, great. They're brilliant. And I think all the sentiments we have kind of skirted over the sentiments, but they are, there's loads and loads of sentiments on these. And they are really, really clever. You've got the nice wheels. You've got your superstar, supercar, you've got supercar, superstar things. They're just really, really nice. And, they're great. Um, they are fantastic, speed. aren't they? They're really, really great. Yeah. Oh, pedal to the metal. Yeah. Like that. Like that. Really, awesome. Really, really, really useful. Really, really, useful. really superb. Um, and there's more. Do you know what? I mean, this just keeps that, on. That, that's the one. This is your one, isn't it? These are your ones. Yeah. yeah. Sorry. Yeah, Hands that's... off, Rosie. <laughs> <laughs> Those ones are taken. Should we, should we have a look at how the dies and the stamps? Yeah, <laughs> let's do maybe it. Maybe have a... Now, that's all of the smaller bundles. So there's three of your smaller bundles there. They're all on the web. All the individuals are on the web as well. But what everyone's going for, and this just flew out of the door yesterday, yeah. if you add up the value of every single one of the dies, of the stamps, um, that wonderful accessories collection as well, it should be £120.40. Today, you're getting the best saving here at Hobby Maker, and it is just amazing. Right the way down to 99 99 And yes... That is on a split pay for you as well. So you have that interest-free split payment, just again, making it more accessible for you and just easier to sort of manage that. 33 pounds and 33 pence, absolutely brilliant. It's so amazing. come on in and get it home. I know so many people are gonna be excited about this, James. Loads of you missed out yesterday. So it's, so delighted to have it back. It's a really nice first style collection. Of so what, what I've got here is a really nice uh, collection of all of the cars here. And you can see what the, the stamped image there is on the left-hand side and then what the die cut, um, item actually gives you there in the middle and then on the far uh, right hand side you've got bringing the, both the stamps and the dies together and exactly what you can create with those so you get the uh, best of both worlds there when you go for the I want it all bundle nice. so you can cut them out and stamp them out as well. Car, it just looks really fantastic doesn't it it looks amazing. It does yeah really, really beautiful really, really well. gorgeous <laughs> you can do all of this as well should we have a little look at some samples as well yes. um, because yeah. They just, they're so varied as well, these, aren't they, James? You know, you can do so much with them. Yeah. You, so many you, different styles. You can. I think it's nice to see what the design team have done with these as well, because um, I know uh, this one here by uh, Christine Smith, she always does some really different cards, completely different yeah. from what I would think of myself. Just using those borders to actually create a, a woven sort of background. It's great, and that, it's isn't absolutely it? Absolutely fantastic. And again, using just the stamps on their own to create that almost like That's a pyramage type effect. Yeah, it's lovely. Um, so, yeah, Christine's very clever from our design. Is this team. with the tyre marks? as well see that's so cool that is really different isn't it it just yeah. shows you what you can do with the dies in different ways and and, and the stamps it's awesome I think it's look really again nice. completely different and a quick shout out to the design team thank you very much for everything that you do because it really does help to share what all you know all your inspiration to they are to fab everyone. aren't they this is emma kemp's i love as yeah. well um this is is this one of sue's, one of sue's? One of sue's yeah. it's fabulous isn't it she's almost <laughs> look, made it look like an embossing folder it has and that's given me a little bit of inspiration for um one of my d uh, demos which i'll show you in this hour actually in the second one um just what you can do with the borders to create exactly like you say like an embossing folder yeah it's superb um every single one is just completely different as well look at that i love the colors on this one oh so sleek and then you get that detail again you do just in the dye itself yeah without, you, without stamping it oh my goodness it's so much inspiration here, so much that you can do. It's just fantastic. You've got a great big I've, pile I've there. Big are these pile, ones that you've been busy with uh, as well? No, no. Some of these are from Sue in the design team. I was going to share these uh, with you first. I'll show you a couple from um, that I've done yesterday, a, a couple of extras okay. in the moment as well. Brilliant. Just to show you. So this Nothing. one's by Sue. Again, just showing the uh, the all geared up to celebrate. Really like that, that <gasps> saying. And maybe to put in the classic uh, vintage Americana car on the road there or maybe you've got that classic beetle oh, that's love bug. I love that. I think that's great isn't it? Yeah that's really, very cool. I really like this idea of the stunt car coming out through oh the Oh my goodness. Just shows you all the different things you can yeah, do Yeah that could be the I Batmobile there yeah, yeah. couldn't it? And we've got some from our design team here this is uh, Siobhan um, that's Gorgeous. done that. Again I love just taking that metallic card die cutting it out and it, it does everything, doesn't it? It does. And then we've got a similar sort of take on the card I did yesterday. Oh, um, that is brilliant. Here on Hobby Maker. So this is a, like, the, um, the Italian job, isn't the it? The Italian job. What a film. And original or the remake? Uh, original, I suppose. Yeah. 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 
And then we've <laughs> got the two uh, tyre uh, tracks there as well that you can see how they're being used. And uh, one by Diane as well. That's I think that's gorgeous. really different again in the coppers. Just gives yeah, it really And then nice. you can go from that to something striking <gasps> like that. That's by oh. Diane as well. So you can see the same designer there has done two totally different style yeah. cards. With and, that's, and you can make it so colourful actually. It's lovely to see from Diane. Yeah, you can just completely absolutely. change it up. Uh, a real yeah. classic one. And then maybe even, uh, maybe you want to, if it's somebody going nice. on birthday, maybe you're doing a tour or something yeah. like that, taking a bit of map, something like that. Nice That's little idea. Brilliant. What's that trip you can do right the way through Europe and then across the desert somewhere? That's like a, I can't remember. You might know, yeah, my fr a friend of mine did it years ago. Don't you have know. to take it, you have to do it in a banger. You can't oh, do okay. it. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sounds good. Um, it does. <laughs> Sounds good, doesn't it? <laughs> Can I have a few gorgeous, of these as well? Because yeah. this one is absolutely stunning. It's Vava Vroom. So this is one of the uh, stamp sets that we've got there. And uh, you're a classic as well. So That's it's beautiful. using the stamp sets with the car. Really, really oh nice. Oh my God. I mean, look at that. And look at this. <laughs> Two completely yeah. fabulous, but totally and utterly different. It's yeah. just, you know, this is what's great about the whole collection. And I isn't love it? this one here as well. It's uh, by um, uh, Rachel from our design team. Oh, there we go. Oh, sorry, Jane. That's okay. So, real, oh, real and then we've got the. Oh, <gasps> that's great, cool. isn't it? Love yes. That. Oh my gosh, I think that's that is amazing. Really, really simple little um, sliding card there. It can even do it on a penny slider as well. Oh, yeah. It? But uh, that I really like brilliant. that idea. That's really, really nice. Fantastic. And I think this one's by Emma as well, using some backgrounds there with the, uh, the pixie powers. Again, stamped and possibly embossed there with the silver um, yeah. polishes over the top. And I'll finish off with that one from Diane because I think that's again completely different. Yeah. And for those of you that have spotted, that's uh, the embossing folder from the Art Deco that I'll be back on with at five o'clock today. Oh, yeah. So it just shows you how you can mix all these in. That's it. It's such brilliant. a such a brilliant collection. Loads of you coming through for this. And as we predicted, everyone's going for the I Want It All bundle because it just. Do you know what? You're, you just want every element of it, don't you? You don't want to be missing any of it. It works so. together so well with the yeah. stamps, the dies, and the sentiments in the borders as well. It's, yeah, That's absolutely. it. Amazing. Yeah. Well, do you know what? Do you want to give us some more inspiration, James, and show us what you can do with it? Yeah, should we have a look at a demo? Uh, yes, and, uh, that'd be go, fabulous. go through and show you some, um, some ideas. So I'm going to start off with this one today. Um, something a little bit different if you saw me yesterday. So I've gone for a real classic. We did a couple of sports ones. And this, the, the idea, sort of inspiration from this, was like the collectible tea cards that you used to be able to get. Uh, yeah. For like Brooke Bond and PG Tips. I'm showing my age now. Um, so is that <laughs> kind of... About that, oh, I know we no were. was looking at it because they glazed like, what? What are you talking cards? about? Tea cards? What, what are you talking about? <laughs> um, and it was that kind of idea of putting them on individual cards, creating a bit of a background and uh, really, really simple to do, but just really, really effective. And it uses all, all three of the sort of classic and vintage cards together, which is really, really nice. Love it. So Love it. So where do you begin? That. So we're going to start off bringing in our stamp set that I've got here ready to go. And uh, we've got one of the classic American uh, vintage vehicles there and some just normal black cardstock. I'm going to bring in my perfect medium to play here and also some of the silver iridescent mica pigments that we've got on today's show, which oh, we'll yeah. look at later. And we're going to use a combination of those together. So I'm just going to start off and show you where this is going to go with my anti-static bag, just to make sure I've got no fingerprints on there from before. Mm -hmm. And we're going to stamp up our classic American car here. So, so. you'd always stamp first, then cut? Is that uh, yes, yeah. I would, and then you can line it up. You could you could go the other way, really, if you, if you suddenly sort of change your mind halfway through design and you thought, cool, I'd like to stamp on there. Yeah. Um, but it's easier to stamp first, then die cut. Yeah, okay. good, good question, yeah. good question. So let's go in with that. I may go for a couple of stamps. I like to get on the dark card, make sure I get plenty of ink across all of here. And it comes out. I mean, that's all stamped out perfectly there, but I'm just going to go in for another... This is a great thing with the presses. You can line, it, line up. it up straight away. Brilliant. There we go. So that's given me that sticky design on my black cardstock, which I'm now going to go in with this iridescent um, pigment powder. So let's pop that one to one side. Mm -hmm. like Don't so. that. Oh, thank you very much. There we go. I'll cool. put it over there for you. And in here, we've got our iridescent pigment mica powders. Um, this is the, what I call silver. I may be wrong with the name. It's the name's, um, I can't remember now. It's gone, I bet it. Yeah. And I know where it's going to be. It's going to be on the bottom of the pot. Oh, yeah. And I'm not, I'm not <laughs> going to tip it up. Let me have a little look. Hold on a minute. <laughs> I think yeah, I've just called them gold. I am just You're right. right. So Never doubt yourself. There you James. go. You I should have I should have stuck yeah. with it. So I've just <laughs> gone over there, just lightly um, put a little bit of that over the top, and now I'm just gonna brush that over the top of my design. You can see there. Look at that. See how that's starting to and that's just stick it's so so fine this powder, but it's actually leaving a metallic film over the top of that perfect medium stamped image. So you've got that perfect metallic car. 
That is beautiful. In any colour that you want, in, in the fact of all the polishes that we've got, all the um, pigment powders we've got on today's show. Uh -huh. That looks great, doesn't it? Look at that, it's come out like that. So we just Beautiful. pop that excess back into the pot or onto there, like so. And I'm just going to brush off the excess. That's so go. clean, that's isn't that. it? It's yeah. such a clean line. It just gives a really, really nice effect. You can see how, how metallic that actually mm. is. It's absolutely striking. Then we're going to go in with our die set. So you can see here with the... Uh, dies that we were looking at earlier on the white boards but you can see here all the detail that Sue's got there in the mm. the lines which are cut and also the deboss and the emboss yeah. so we're going to use that and line it up now a little trick um, you can line up with these really easily because Sue's des deliberately designed it in such a way so you've got these cutouts for the wheels oh, and, the, and the bumper or the fender I should say, fender, I guess. Yeah. the American car I should say fender um, I can drop that on there and if I just show you I can just I'm already lined it up. It's there. It's wow. done. So it's dead easy just to line up. But a little trick that you can do if you want to. I don't mm -hmm. know if I've got this one cut out. I haven't here. But what I've done, I'll show you the example here with the mini. Is you can cut it out. Use your cutaway if you like. Use that. Put it over the top of your stamped image. Ah, and then you know it's perfect. perfectly lined up. Then yeah. put your die into that stamp, that cutout, and it's going to line up perfectly. That's but a brilliant That's tip. kind of what I would normally do with stamp and dies. Yeah. But with these, I found because they've got these cutouts, I've actually just automatically kind yeah. of gone in there and done that, and it's worked perfectly every time. So she's made so it so simple. Let's take Great. that down into place. And the great thing with these um, pigment powders is that it's not a wet product, so it's automatically it's dry. You just yeah. go straight in and work with it and cut it out. So okay. let's pop that over and we'll run that through the machine. And we'll cut out our American Classic. I think that may have just moved then, just as I flopped it down. Yes, it did. There we go. I thought I felt it go. Oh. Happened I probably then, should it? take off the excess powder because um, the low-tack tape is almost too low-tack. There we go. Just run that one through. It's good that though, because it, I mean it's better too low tack than peeling away. It won't away. Won't yeah, absolutely. Hard. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm being naughty. I'm looking ahead. But it's just fabulous, <laughs> isn't it? It's great. So let's see what we've got here. So let's take that away from there and take the tape off. Pop that to one side for later, and then we can see straight away we've got our windshield starting to pop out there. And I can then take that car away from the die set. One go. There we go. Look at that. It looks stunning. So that's, that's just, so it looks so completely different, doesn't yeah. it? If I put in some white card there, just to see the difference between the black you know and silver. You know what? If I, that, that one that you did before. It's the same, but it just looks, same, but yeah. just cut out. And I think what the other thing is, it's now added that emboss and deboss. It matches in with yeah. the stamp. And it just looks absolutely perfect. It looks it just looks more three-dimensional, three doesn't yeah, it? It does. It's just it looks really, really three-dimensional. For you, it's such a beautiful collection, this. Well done to everyone, by the way. Um, over 20% of our big bundle has now gone. That's of our remaining stock, of course. So do make sure, if you want to grab it, today's the day. We haven't got any more scheduled shows. No. Today's the day. Grab it and do make sure you check out your basket if it's in your basket on the app or on the web. Um, beautiful. Brilliant. And I know it was really busy yesterday, so... Yeah, it's looking, looking the same today, yeah. yeah. So I've just got some um, card here that I, uh, a couple of different foundation cards, very, very subtle difference, but it's just a coconut white and a milk. Oh, okay. And it's just to create that sort of classic looking um, mm. uh, collectible tea cards that we were talking about. Yeah. I mean, it's not designed to look identical. It's just what I tend to do when I do a card is just come up with a bit of an idea and just something gives me a bit of inspiration. And then you I can just make a whole it. box of them. Couldn't you? You could actually. You could do like a little, you could make up a little box with a car on the front. It's almost like the old artist trading card size, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. A little bit smaller, but it's almost going back to the artist trade card. I remember, you used mm. to do those. Cool. Definitely. There's still trade cards in school. Hazel's all about the football cards. Really? Just, yeah, yeah. Yeah. It's, it's always popular, isn't it? Collecting cards yeah. and things like that. So, what I've done, I uh, just had a little bit of detail around the out here. I've got a uh, dye based ink pad. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm just going to put a little bit of shading around the edge of this which I should have done before I stuck down the border but it's okay because you'll get the idea and I'll show you the one I've done earlier mm. and it's just going to create two different ways of doing it there is really. you can do it two different no. ways because this will create a slightly subtle effect around the edge anyway yeah. so which is really, really quite nice so I'm and just going to create color. a very subtle sort of halo because mm. I want to keep that card in the middle still clean um, what's that the called ink. is it like a vignette when you have vignette. the yeah yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. it is a bit of a vignette that's a photography term, isn't it, I think? Yeah, I think so. Hair. And when you have all the vintage photographs, you'd always have that mm. centre part. 
Yeah, you would. So I'm just going to go ahead and stick this straight down onto that frame that I've built up there. Really, really simple. Around there like that. And pop that into the middle. And you can see that just sets that off really quite nicely there. So great. With that lighter shade behind it. Really and I've just gone ahead and done one of those slightly earlier with a couple of pearls on them. So I'll show you what I've done there. The idea with this is just to make it look almost like, I'll show you where I'm going to go with this, is just curl the edges. Oh. Oh, and yeah. the idea, because this is quite two layers of thick card, you can curl the edges quite a bit if you want to do this style. Yeah. Pop a couple of your black 3D pearl accents, and then you've oh, got like is little, that what this is? yeah, oh, little, little tiny pinheads ready to oh, pin onto that's our card. Fantastic. So that just that creates really one cool. little topper, and then all I've done is I'll pop that to one side. Just cre recreated that three times mm -hmm. using our three classic and vintage cars. And Gorgeous. I've also gone ahead there and just added in the um, the text there from one of our sentiments. Yeah. So you're a put them around the right way. Real classic. That's just so wonderful. that's what I'm gonna gonna work up now. How have you done this one? If you don't mind me asking, because this one you've left out some of the powder is that right? oh is that no that's the embossing it's detail it's, it's just embossing detail so Gosh, again it's, it's just so every single one of these is exactly the same it's just stamping yeah. then die cutting and then the two would do all the hard work for you and it will line everything up so that's i've just gone so for the, the copper the silver mm. and the gold in the um the powders that we've got yeah. exactly the same Gosh, because it does, it makes it look like you've painstakingly gone in there with the detail. Yeah, it's so clever. It's beautiful. So I'm just going to curl these corners because that's kind of like the, the sort of finish that I like to go for. Because I'm going to make it look like they are sort of attached to the front of the card. Mm -hmm. And I'm just going to, I want them to look like they're pinned down in this yeah. design. Obviously, you can do absolutely anything with these. This is just my take on a different. So if you saw me yesterday, it was two completely different mm. designs that I did. That's what's so gorgeous about the collection, isn't it? It's it can be very modern, it can be very contemporary, yeah. it can yeah. be really, uh, really beautiful like and nostalgic. That. So we're going to yeah. pop those to one side for safekeeping. Fab. And I'm going to come in with some craft card just to keep that same sort of theme going. And we're going to go in and stamp a couple of different car images onto here using the perfect medium. So I'll grab my stamp press there. Ah, there we go. Thank you, Rosie. And I'm going to just do a couple and then I'll show you kind of how it's going to fill the rest of the page. So what I want to do here is just actually create my own uh, background papers mm. using um, some of the stamped images. So if we just, oh, I'll tell you what, we've got this one on here, so let me stamp it and just show you. Because this is something that I think sometimes, and I, I'm, a, I'm one for this, I almost forget sometimes these uh, watermark type mm. ink pads. That's exactly what they are. They are for creating a watermark. And yeah. we always think of them for embossing folder when we, um, embossing powders when we were talking earlier, uh, or uh, pigment powders like I've done here. But ultimately, it is a watermark mm. um, stamp. So if you get the right card stock, like your craft card, and you stamp that down, and you can go in there with, again, a couple of stamped images if you want to, you're going to create something yeah. like that, which is going to create just a very, very subtle watermark. Now, as that dries, that. it will darken ever so slightly. And all I've done is I've replicated that same concept right the way across the design using all three of the cards that I've mm. used on the um, the cards that we just made. And you're going to get something that looks... Oh, cool. sorry, Dennis. That's right. I love that. Like just, that? You could make wrapping, wrapping paper. paper. Yeah. It That's looks wonderful. really, really effective. So it's not black, it's not grey, it's just something different. It's using that same uh, ink pad that we've just used. So yeah. it's only one ink pad for the whole project. And look at the totally different thing. Brilliant. Paper. And so this will become that. So as it, it will, dries, it, it will, will get it darker. It will darken it. If you want to make it That's darker clever. again, you can turn around and go in with a, exactly a... If I to, let's have a go. Could wallpaper a bit, a section of your house with that. I mean, you could make your it, own wallpaper with it. It creates a, a bit, really nice sort of background. So yeah. just go in there. Uh, this may have moved while we were talking, I'm not sure. If I just go in with another stamp, mm. see how that's now a bit darker again? Uh, yeah. So it oh, depends on it. what you want to create, how, how dark or light you want to go. That is so clever. It's and just I'm just thinking, technique. you know, if you're doing a craft show, I know we've got angel policy with all of this, so of course you can make to sell. Absolutely, yeah. But with things like that, imagine making up your own little um, pack of papers, of backgrounds for people you, to you use. Can do, but can you, you do, do that? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. You could do that. You could make boxes with it, couldn't you? You yeah. could do so many different so um, good. projects with that type of concept. And this is the thing with the stamp sets. If that were yeah. just dies, you couldn't do that. But bringing the stamps into play gives you so much Would more that work? Um, just thinking about MDF and things like that. So, you know, if you're making your MDF boxes, Ooh, um, would that work as dark? Would it go as dark on that, do you think? Or you can it? definitely stamp onto it with a perfect yeah. medium. I don't know. That's a good question. If it's un uncoated and unsealed, then potentially yeah. it should darken it ever so slightly. Yeah. But I know uh, craft cards are great... Um, I was going to say, great. It's a bit great. more porous, I Yeah, suppose, it is isn't a it? bit more porous than normal uncoated cardstock or coated cardstocks. Mm. It just gives the ability to go in there and add... I love that. 
that sort of thing. It works really, really well. Yeah. Awesome. So let's work that up a little. Oh, I'll just throw this in, just because so, I know we've got a couple of embossing folders. Uh, very, very different, but if you want to really take it another stage, there's nothing stopping you taking that, embossing it, going over the top, something yeah. else. Nice, so, lovely. Okay. Brilliant. Right, so I am going to um, take a piece of black cardstock that we've got now and go in with some of our um, metallic... Uh, I was going to say pigment. It's metallic gilding polishes. That's a weighty pot. It's That's a very, it? very weighty pot, Lovely. yeah. So this is the copper. So mm. I, what I've done is I've matched all these colours up so your pigment micas and also these work in perfectly together. So oh, we had okay. the, um, the copper powder there, which we haven't used yet, but you can oh. see how the colourways work together. Beautiful. So I've done all the kind of the, the heavy thinking for you to make it all work together. Now, if you haven't seen these before, they come with a sponge on the top, which you pull out the top, just mm. pop it off. Uh, you've got your applicator. This is just like a working with a mousse, really. So what I'm going to do is charge up the sponge, create a little ramp on the side, charge up the sponge with some of the product on there, nice. and I'm literally just going to swipe it over the oh, edge wow. of the card. Because what I want to do is just go around and create a border. Now, you may have seen me doing this yesterday. I've done it on white card, mm. dark card. Uh, so the same product will give you a different take. If you're going with yeah. the um, golds, the coppers, and the silvers, and you do it on a white card stock or a light card stock, you will get a very, very heavy pigmented, almost mirror card finish. Yeah. If you go on black card stock, like I've done here, you instantly get what I would call a, a vintage or a tarnished look yeah. because the black's still coming but through. But look at that so it's, shine. And there's wow. hardly any product used, and you've instantly got uh, pearl or metallic, yeah. depending on how heavy you go in with your product. That's um, so stock. versatile just as well because really, any of really your snippets, any of your little bits of card you've got left over, yep. you just instantly make them pearly. That is yep. gorgeous. Such amazing pigment. So all you've got to do then is mm. I've got my card blank there. I've got one I've done earlier which has just dried up and it dries very quickly. I mean, that is already wow. completely dry. Oh, yeah. There's nothing Gosh, on there. Yeah. Yeah, very, very quick to dry. And it's just water-based. So that then gives me a border because I'm going to go over the top there with our papers that we've done, which I'll mount up in a minute. You can see there, I haven't wasted the product. I've just wanted that nice metallic copper border. And yeah. that's what that allows you to do. Fantastic. So let me it's just gorgeous. pop that onto one side and pop the lid on. Just a quick tip, uh, when you get these home, mm -hmm. um, I'm using these day by day, but if I'm not going to use them for maybe a couple of weeks, just yeah. give them a little spritz of tap water inside because it's only water-based. Okay. And all that does is it just means that when you open that back up again, it's all good to go. Oh, perfect. They don't, okay. they don't dry out, but if you left them there for maybe six months or, or longer, yeah. it just means they're going to stay there nice and moist. Okay, and they're absolutely perfect. perfect to go. Okay, just great. You've got to get those. We will go through all of those colours, by the way, after the first demo. We'll take you through and show you all your we different are, options. We are nearly there. Now. I'm going to bring in all of the bits that we've already made and bring it all together. You're a very clean crafter. I know. Dave Always says very organised. Yeah. Very good. <laughs> <laughs> I aspire right. to be like that. <laughs> I can't say I am though. <laughs> if, uh, the trouble is, I'm working on so many different things at the same time at home. If I don't work on. Um, if I don't work like that, it kind of gets a bit out of control a little bit. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, you can't see the craft desk at the end of the day. <laughs> yeah. So, all right, let me go in with that. And it's lovely. I mean, you're t using the tiniest amount of glue, aren't you? you yeah, don't need I don't much. tend to. This, I've got, what I tend to have is, I know this is going to sound almost over the top, but I actually have two or three of these, and I have them deliberately cut different sizes. Oh, okay. So some are very, very fine and yeah. some not so fine. It just means that I don't get too much glue on the cardstock, that's yeah. all. So all I've done there is just going to mount that down like that, and you can see where that's come together. So we've got our copper border, we have got our uh, lovely backing paper there that we've made ourselves. And this is a lovely thing, you know, you've made it all of, so even with the paper, the backing paper, yeah. everything yourself is great when you can craft everything. That's it, and we were saying, and Laura's just saying as well, you can make wrapping paper with that, you could do your bag, um, your sort of gift bags with mm. that as well. You could just yep. make so many things with that, actually, couldn't you? Yeah. I know so many people are car enthusiasts uh, in one way or another, and if they're yeah. classic cars, it could be uh, hill climbing, it could be rallying, it's just so many different uh, areas where it pops up. So Definitely. all I've got here is a couple of dies, which if you were lucky enough to grab these yesterday, this is just to give you another couple of ideas of how you can it's use quite them. Quite a cruel tease, this one, James. It is, I'm sorry. I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna use them very, very quickly, just to finish it off. It, I, I think it's worth saying as well, you and Laura did try very hard to bring these back, we but did. It, there was literally we did. nothing we left. Did. So, so I'm, all, I'm, all I'm, and you can obviously do this using maybe the border dies. I was gonna um, say, could cogs? you snip into them yeah, and sort absolutely. of, yeah, yeah okay. You could, you could do that. 
So I'm going to bring back in our car, and this is where I love the, doing things like this, making all the bits and bringing them together. Yeah. Uh, I can now turn around and start mounting these up. So I'm going to go in and mount this one down first. I'm just going to glue that one straight down onto the cardstock uh, background. And I know you may think it's a shame to cover it over, but I think it's more about what you're showing. I think it's yeah. it, you need to be able to sort of cover the whole area. But you just make work. some more to use, just, you know. It's only stamps, isn't it? That's it. it. You'll be able to do it in no yeah. time. So. Um, this one's got a little bit of uh, one mil foam tape that we're just going to go over there. And then the next one has got some, I think it's three mil, just to raise it up a little oh, bit more. Nice. And you can kind of see how that comes into play then. So you've got so cool. your a real classic, and then if you wanted to, and I won't do because I would be teasing, but you can do things like that <laughs> as well with it as well. But there's lots of options to sort of add yeah. little flourishes into it. It's think, just yeah. fantastic, isn't it? It's such a beautiful card, and you can do this. You can do so many things with this collection. I'm just going to hold that up, actually, yeah, sure. well, so you can see. Um, as I move around the metal, the metallic shine it's that you so get. so shiny, that you think that's just powder. It looks like you've cut them out of Muricard or something. You haven't, it's you know, just you've just used the, the, the polishes and the powders. It's beautiful. Yeah. Um, everyone is wanting to get their hands on these mica powders. So, oh, um, now, you've got these wonderful uh, boards done for us as well. There's three different sets, aren't there? There are, Now, yes. is this the right one? I want to make sure I'm bringing up the So right this one. is okay. the one with the uh, the golds and the silvers. So oh, this okay. is one of, uh, I've used both of these on this card you just saw. So we've got here the um, the, the gold and silver collection. I'll let Rosie go through the colors. Fantastic. Um, it's just lovely. So you're going to get the mica and you're going to get the polish as well. So I'll, which side are you on there? There we go. There we are. So you've got the iridescent mica pigment in the pale gold. You've got the pearlescent here as well. Okay. And then these are your uh, metallic gilding polish. This is your tarnished gold. So just slight difference, which is really lovely. And then you've got the uh, silver dream there as well. That's the metallic gilding polish here. So amazing collection all four of these and you're going to get them for 19.99 so it's a brilliant brilliant saving and they go very far don't they James so a little goes a long way both you know, of these products last you for a long time. Are, are something that will last long those pots um, will last an extremely long time yeah, powders, yeah it's, really, it's really brilliant um, come on in and grab it so this is for your silver and gold it's JL2848 is your code there remember anything you put in your basket just please remember to check it out because every single day we have people missing out because they've just not quite checked out soon enough so don't leave it a chance make sure you're checking out as you go along um, then we've got these fabulous really Ruby flames and metallic dreams. Look at this. We're going to be playing with these oh, ones these in the next demo. Oh, stunning nice. So this is, uh, when I put this collection together, I was thinking, obviously, your Porsche and your Ferrari here. Oh, nice. They're so, gorgeous. Yeah. Um, so this is your ruby flame, your mica pigment, okay? This one here is your marine dream, and that's your mica pigment as well. And they really change as you move, don't they? It's fantastic. This is the rich red metallic polish, okay? And um, this one is your blue wave metallic polish. So you're going to get all four of these CP2838 and again that's just for $19.99 today these are flying out the door um, as is of course the great big bundle so please do make sure you're checking out as you go along I'm just going to say as well on our screen we can still see the Liberty York fabric bundle can't we yeah, um, it looks lovely it looks like a lovely bundle, <laughs> yeah, like a good bundle. <laughs> very lovely bundle there we go um, now your third set is um so that's the one that's got that copper, amazing copper. Yeah, that's right. Here we go. Look at that. Oh my goodness. It's just striking, so, aren't they? Yeah. So striking. And the nice thing I should have pointed out there was they're busy setting up, but you've got the, the light card uh, on the right hand side and the dark card on the left hand side. Ah, so you can see the nice. coverage that you get with both these products. A little bit unique because not every product will always mm. cover on dark card. This does. Yeah. It covers perfectly. It's wonderful, isn't it? I mean, this one, you could almost do sort of lizard scales. Look, I love so that technique, that. actually, yeah. how you've done yeah, that. It's nice. lovely. Um, this is the mossy green, okay? This is your mica pigment. Then you've got the copper shine. This is the metallic polish that we just saw James using in his um, right. fabulous demo. And then you've got the fern metallic polish as well. Again, really striking, really vibrant, absolutely beautiful. Um, and they both are dry instantly, aren't they? It's the they, great thing yeah, about the it. The powder, you can actually, as I'll show you on this next demo, you can mix it with water as well, but as okay. a dry product, it's, it's dry, dry to work with all the time, and the, um, the metallic power polishes are dry within seconds. Amazing. Um, oh, to work with, yeah. So wonderful. That's your three different sets there. Mm. They're all out on the web for you as well. Um, now, I know you're going to be doing a little bit of embossing in this I next am, hour. Yes. So I don't want to interrupt you while you're demoing. We so what we'll do is have a little look at them now. Yeah. Let me um, grab them We can give them all to you. 
Oh, thank you. That's okay. There you go, is it? There we go. Thank you very much. Now, the tumbling blocks yesterday absolutely threw out the door. This is what you're going to be using here today as well. So we have got limited stock left on this one. So if you're wanting the tumbling blocks, I'd get in early, okay? It's ZG2801 is your code. The savings on these, James, that's amazing. They are great because they're 3D embossing folders as well. So wow. there's loads and loads of depth on this. Just a couple of, I know we're going to have a, a bit of a play with them in a minute, but there's a couple of ideas that you can use. So, I mean, you normally pay ways. more for 3D embossing Oh, yeah, they're, they're, yeah yes, definitely. Mm. Yeah. yeah. So already discounted there, definitely. Fantastic yeah. saving. That looks great. It's a great background, background. Yeah, and obviously that's uh, on craft cards. So just to show you how that can look, it almost looks like um, tie dredge. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? it? It's yep. gorgeous. Um, the other one, and actually, I just love this. Do you know what? Um, I don't know why, because it's not actually the same in any way, shape or form, but it reminds me of Tetris. For some reason, it's oh. got—it's just that geometric feel, that geometric I pattern. I haven't thought, see, I've used it as basket weave, and I've used it oh, before. Oh, nice! I've used it like I have in this collection for for metal um, sort of tread and things like that. Oh, but yeah, of if you did it in bright colours, it could be, couldn't it? Could well, that's again, it could be so many different things, couldn't it? Really versatile. Yeah, yeah. it's fantastic. Love the idea of it being in basket as well. Um, five ninety nine there for your HB twenty eight twenty nine, and, and then look at it in action. Gives you a little bit of an idea what you can do there, Beautiful. just to make that, just using a couple of polishes. If you caught me yesterday, that's the same technique, just went over the top with some of the gilding polishes. I know what it is. It's when you when you go to the garage and it goes, your, your wheels go on the ramp. That's right. That's that, it, that isn't that it? I, I want to say it's like, they call it, called? I, I want to say, I could be wrong with this, but I think they call it like Bigfoot in the trail or something like that. It's something oh, weird, it? like it's to do with the grip. Yeah. Oh, okay. Just the grip. Yeah, no, it is. And now it's in silver. I totally yeah. see that. It's amazing. Yeah. Um, right, so, these are flying out the door as well. I'm not surprised. Five ninety nine for a 3D great, embossing it? folder. Amazing. And it's always amazing. good to have a good stock of embossing folders, isn't it? Because they just... Especially, uh, as I said yesterday, when I have an embossing folder, I like to have, a bit like Sue works her dies really hard, I like to have an embossing folder that I can just use it in so many different ways. And yeah. straight away, I think, basket weave, met, big metal plates, uh, can you Tetris, like you say. It's this as well... I mean, this is just my gemstone stuff coming out. But oh, yeah. again, it kind of looks like tum it could be coloured as tumbling gemstones. It could as well, be, couldn't it? Little diamonds. Yeah, beautiful. Um, fabulous. So versatile. So let's see them in action, shall we? Um, so what are you going to do for us this time then, James? Okay, so we're going to have a play with some of the supercars. So we're going to have a go with the, um, the Porsche that I've got here. Now, I've gone ahead and die cut some of these out and also stamped them um, just to move a few stages ahead. But I just want to show you a couple of different ways you can treat these. Um, using the dies and the stamps together. So what I've done here mm. is I've gone ahead and used the polishes over the top, which I'll show you, mm. dead easy, and it lets all the design in the um, the, the dies really come out. Yeah. I've used the powders there, where I've actually mixed them with water and gone in and painted the details. And you can even stamp with the metal, uh, metallic gilding oh, polishes as well. Great, isn't it? So you get all that detail there. But if I show you with the blue first, just mm. swiping over the top of this one that I've got here, mm. So again, I'm just going to take... Oh, it's a great colour. It's a stunning colour. Again, if you put that on white card, yeah. um, this is only a piece of copper, copy paper, but you can see how bright that looks. Real yeah. sort of ocean blue. Yeah. But let me show you how that looks over the top of this one. So just take off the excess. And I'm just going to literally just swipe that over the top. Oh my gosh, it changes completely. You can see the instant detail that jumps mm. out of that die that Sue's designed in there. It looks amazing, doesn't it? And then it's brought in all that detail that we've got, but also you can see that different shade that you've got compared to the white card. So that's yeah. what I'm about the dark and the white card, how it creates that different tone. So you've got a real lovely racing blue there. As it well. is, it's beautiful. So that's all I've done to create different ways. So it's just to show Fantastic. you how you can do that. So I'm just going to pop those to one side and we'll come in and I'll show you how I've actually done our finished one that we've got here. So this is the one that I'm going to mount up and work with on our card project. And all I've done with it is gone ahead and stamped the designer and then die cut it just like we did earlier on. Yeah. And then I've gone in with some of our mica pigment powders and I'm going to use the smallest pinch and it is a pinch mm. of this. If I put it on the black, you'll see it a little bit easier. Oh gosh, yeah. Just take mm. that out and I'm going to go in with one of our water brushes that we've got here mm. and just mix it with a little bit of water. So I've now got a metallic paint in effect. Wow, that's Brilliant. That's all you've got to do. And now I've got a paint that I'm working with. There we go. You can see it change instantly. It just yeah. goes into a lovely... So obviously the more water you add, the thinner it gets. Just like normal watercolour paint. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you can change so the, sort of the, the tone of it. And then I'm just going to go in and pick out a little bit of detail. So if you can do this with the silver or the blue, and I'm just going to put the bonnet in. Mm -hmm. And it just allows you to go over the top and it matches in with that metallic 
And you can be quite quite rough with this and quite mm -hmm. quick because the, the dye uh, design's got those embossed areas, so it almost sort of keeps your colouring within the lines anyway quite easily. Yeah, it almost acts as so like a resist. Go, it does, yeah. So you can go in, add a bit of detail into the grill, and as that dries, it will really come out. It will start to become more metallic. Mm. So just adding a little bit of detail like that works really well. And then you can go in, use the gold. Um, that's the copper. Let's go in with the gold. And we're popping a little bit of the gold. And going back to what you're saying, how long these last, I mean, these are really large pots as well. They're larger than our normal size pots okay. for um, mica powders that we do. So they really do last a long, long time. So I'm just going to add a little bit of detail. And it's almost like having the lights on in a house. It just brings it to life, I think. As soon as you turn the headlights on. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And it just brings it together. That's beautiful. It's so clever. It's it's I love these that. kind of, I love products that can be so versatile. You can use them for so many different things. You can, yeah. That's and wonderful. Then this is exactly one of those products. So just doing that, it brings it together like that. And I can go in with a white gel pen as well and just add a little bit of the highlight to thinking the car's metallic and just add a little bit of detail to all of these panels on the cars just to make it look like mm. it's... Uh, all glistening and pick catching up all those light traces that you would see on the on the bodywork. So that's all I've done for there mm. to just finish that off. It's just, just with the wonderful. Gel I love it. Yeah. Really so let me clever. pop those to one side and we'll take that car and work it up a little bit, a little bit more. Take okay. up the excess. Um, I will just give you a bit of an update as well. So now over 30% of the stock for the big bundle has now gone. Um, remember, any one of you who comes in today for the I Want It All bundle, which is on screen right now, it's UP2891, you will automatically be entered into a competition to win a Sue Wilson signed card giveaway. There are three to give away. James will be announcing the winner today in the five o'clock hour. So come and get involved. They're beautiful cards as well. Um, and it's just such a fabulous collection. You're gonna love working with this. And like you said, James, you know, male, female it's it's ageless as well actually yeah. for young kids young older kids generation yeah. it's going to be brilliant definitely. yeah definitely fabulous should we have a play with the embossing folder? yes please so Great. i've got the tumbling blocks here that you were having a little look at mm. and it's a repeat pattern so what it means um is i could run it through the machine and actually then move it on one and it will join on and it will be re repeated oh, so you can join okay. them together so anybody that caught me with sue a couple of weeks ago you saw me do this a couple of times so you can look back yeah. on youtube on hobby maker Fab. you'll see how i've done that um, but i'm mindful of the time and i want you to be able to uh, see a couple of these samples together so have a look at how you extend that i showed you last time but i'm going to go in with our metallic gilding polish the blue mm -hmm. onto the blue cardstock so this is some dark denim foundation and i'm actually going to go in quite heavy now I that doesn't mean i'm using an awful lot of product it just means i'm going in with um, a heavier hand. So I'm not okay. wanting to drag it over the tops of the raised areas. I'm actually wanting to color most of the cardstock here. With I this. love that. I can't believe the difference in oh, color huge difference, over this yeah. to the white as well. I tell you what, let's, completely different. Let's just do half of this area. So this is the whole area that I would need to sort of trim down to make my square piece. If I just okay. treat half of that card and you can see where we're gonna go with this. Mm. So when you finish, like I said, you can give it a little spritz of water at the end of the day. Pop your sponge back in. So clever, and, it all comes it's, together. It's almost semi-airtight on the top, so I find that that actually stays quite moist. Oh, that's Certainly good. for the week yeah, uh, yeah. while I'm working on it. I'm going to go in with the silver colour that we've got now. Is this Silver Dream, I think? Yes. And uh, it's part of that collection. Yes. So this is the metallic gilding polish again. Again, you can stamp with these, and you can also add water and build a paint, paint. as well. Beautiful. So form your little ski ramp like that. Put the um, product up very, very small amount and a very, very light pressure now, because all we want to do is just kiss the tops of our tumbling blocks. Oh, so you almost that. get that metal tread effect again. So what I'm actually getting is a bit of a two-tone effect. I'm getting that metallic glue with a metallic silver on the raised areas over the tops. Quite subtle, oh, but it sort of gives you that effect of, sometimes you see it on the super sports cars, these sort of um, treads yeah. on the edges of the doors and things. Oh, definitely, yeah. So it's kind of taken a little bit of inspiration from that. that you can looks see amazing. how different that looks between the car, just a yeah. piece of cardstock using two and you think if you wanted to do that you well you couldn't because if you just had a metallic piece of cardstock you wouldn't be able to achieve that effect without those so yeah, it shows you the different things that you can do oh, so I, I would trim that down into a square and that's mm -hmm. going to give you something that looks a little bit like that when it's all finished and we're going to use that to uh, start to bring together the car in a minute as well so i'm going to show you where this is going to go um i've got here my card base and again using that same silver um, metallic gilding polish mm -hmm. just around the edges of the white cardstock gives us that 
almost pearlescent, completely different finish again so because it's on white cardstock. Yeah. So it's really, really different. Cool. So I'm going to mount that onto there. Let me get my other glue, put a bit more glue onto this because it's three dimensional. It'll go on there a little bit quicker. So anything like this, I tend to be a little bit more heavy handed with my glue because there's so many areas that are raised it's going to fall into. I know I can coat that up, make sure I get a really good coat all the way around and you won't have any problems with your folders to do that. And then I'm just going to mount that into the middle. And then that starts to bring together our mats and layers. It's such a cool background. So. Yeah, I know you're right, Laura. It's I was saying it's yeah. very, tactile. very tactile. Yeah, it's very, very tactile. Yeah, Love it that. is very tactile. So then I can just go to the top with some um, black and white cardstock, which I've got here. Ooh. So what I've done here, exactly that same technique, going over the top with some black cardstock, which I've coloured up with the metallic gilding polish. Again, because I just want to get that edge around the area. So I'm not too worried about the centre because we're going to come in with another piece of cardstock in a minute and frame that up. Okay. Brilliant. So I'm just going to pop that to one side with our car and we'll come back to that in a moment to finish that area off. And let's have a look at some of our border dies because what we've got here are a really amazing collection of these tools from Sue. And I absolutely love these. There's so much. This is from the these. accessories. This accessories is from the accessories, collection. yeah. So we've got the tyres and we've got these as well and the nuts and bolts. So what I've done is I've gone ahead and cut out a, a series of these. Uh-huh. And then I've just glued them down onto some cardstock, very, very simply, just using uh, some of our fine glue applicators. And it, this is creating that sort of background effect of the embossing folder like you talked about. Yeah. So I can just go ahead, pop those in like that. Little miniature tools are great, aren't so they? So great. You could snip them up and put them in a little tool bag as well, couldn't you? Yeah, and just yeah. Yeah, or shake a card oh, for like tools. That. That's I love a that great idea, idea. Yeah. yeah, good one. I like that. Nice. Yeah. I'll be using that next time. <laughs> <laughs> it is just such a great collection. The more you look at it as well, the more you get different ideas. Because I'm yeah. sort of thinking, you know, a kid's bedroom. You could decorate with a lot of this as well. You could decorate yeah. toy boxes. You could create little banners and wall art as well, and stickers really, for the wall, really things nice. like that. Amazing. So all I've got on this is just going down through, gluing each one, and I just uh, repeat the pattern. So I'm going to go down through and alternate and just change where it is. So I've got that design there, and I can go in there and alternate backwards and forwards, backwards and forwards. And when I've done that all the way down through, hmm. I'm going to end up with something that looks a little bit like that there, which gives us that sort of background of the embossing folder that we're talking about. Now, I'm going to bring in my silver metallic gilding polish once again to play here. Hmm. And this is where, again, just the smallest amount, I probably almost had enough on the sponge anyway. And I'm gonna go over the top of this with mm. just a little, a very light touch. And you look at how that design just oh, pops yeah. off that card instantly. Hopefully that's showing up. Yeah, so it really, the more is. You can, it really oh, is. Oh yeah, it Beautiful. does look good, doesn't it? Yeah, uh, yeah, it looks great. I just love that sort of finish that you get and it really does look like, and that's instantly yeah. dry, so. It's just fantastic, and, and that is, I can't believe it. And that's why these pots are so brilliant. You're so versatile. Any dry time This is all. why I, I absolutely love Cosmic Shimmer. I think probably mm. one of the things with, with Creative Expressions when I was working for them, I've got the opportunity to, great, I'll get to play with Cosmic Shimmer, <laughs> because it's just so, so versatile, yeah, it really, really is. It is. So you just trim that down, and then you get your little background panel like that. And I've added in a couple of screw heads. Oh, they're great. How did you do them? Do you know, I was hoping you were going to ask that. <laughs> now, I, Imagine if I just did that. <laughs> I was just you, like, oh yeah, that If you good. just went, that looks good, I would have gone, do you want to know how I did those? <laughs> so I actually used the 3D Pearl Ascents. Oh, now, wow. um, this is going to be a little bit of a, you know, sh probably probably shouldn't try this because it's live TV and it will never work. But I did these ooh, about about an hour ago. I okay. Just before we went on air, I squeezed these out. You want to do them about an hour ahead. Okay. Grab a, uh, a ruler or a stamping block, something like that. Yeah. And what you need to do is you need to catch them before they dry. Ah. But not... This is genius. If once, once they're dry, you wouldn't be able to do this. If they are wet, uh -huh. you can imagine the mess that yeah, we're going to make. So you've got to catch them in that pliable form. So if you so can go over the top, so anything from about half an hour to maybe two hours, after mm -hmm. two hours, they're solid. So I've done a load here thinking, you know, if I did those a little bit, no, nope, they're okay. So that's good. about half an hour. Can I have a go? Hours. Yeah, have a go. Sorry, it just, I mean, it's, it's so really clever. It's really, yeah, it is. It's like, and you don't have to put too much pressure on either, actually, do you? No, 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 not at all. That's a genius idea. It's dead simple. Did you come up with this? I... 
I haven't seen anyone else do it, so well, I'm gonna, I'm, go, you are a I'm gonna take the credit. I'll say You take I'll the credit. Yes. I'll say it. Absolutely, don't be modest. So I love it. Let's it's finish Rosie. Idea. Let's finish Rosie's ones off. So what you can use like rivets. Uh -huh. um, I've done I've used these pearls for so many different things other than pearls. But if you go in with um, it doesn't want to be a knife, it wants to be the edge of a ruler or a spatula or something fairly yeah. blunt. Just go in, push it down. And oh. That's I, can so I, can you, if I hold that up there to camera too, you should just be able to see that. There you go. That is. I know it's. I know brilliant. it's very, very subtle, but no, but it, it makes it a difference. It. Because look, I'm just going to show you that as well. Because I mean, it it does make a massive difference on the card, doesn't it? Yeah. It just makes all the difference. I yeah. love that. So it's just another way of using it. And of course, you could maybe put a crosshead yeah. in there. You can have the other type of screws. Oh yeah. There so you go. just go in there and then go in the other way. And then, bang, you've got your little crosshead screw as well. So there's a couple of different ways you can do it. It's just genius. So using the, the white, the black, the silver, you can do it in all ways. So I think they're brilliant for that. Really, really clever. And actually, this is a ridiculous deal. You're getting all three yeah, colours. Yeah. I didn't know that, actually. I didn't That's realise really that. Now, this is the one you've just used. It is, yep. OK, there it is. I'll make sure I line it up. There you go. That's the black pearl 3D accent, OK? So you're going to get that one. Um, you are also going to get the silver okay and you're also going to get the white so you'll get all of those absolutely amazing for 9.99 oh you could spend just a That's little an afternoon thing. doing loads of those and just you pop can... a big line of them i've done them in That's so many eight. i'm trying to think over the year i've been here already I, I, you can put them onto a craft sheet let them dry overnight you get like little candy dots because you go flat oh, yeah uh, i've used them as doing coconuts on a tree. You can use them with pearls, Gosh. obviously. I've probably used them everywhere other than pearls, and now screw heads as well. Yes, I'm trying to yeah. think what other things you could do now. I mean, it's brilliant. What else could you press into them to create that little texture? Yeah. Oh, it's yeah, nice. very clever. Could you do bigger ones and make buttons? You can. Ah, the, bigger, the, bigger, the bigger they are, then obviously you just got to allow them to dry a little bit longer. So I did try that. You can certainly go up to a couple of hours. Beyond that, they then get so solid that you can't, you think you've pressed them. You go back five minutes later, and yeah. they bounce back up again, which is great, because if yeah. you want a pearl, that's exactly what you you wanted to do that'd be great so you've got um, to catch it at half an hour dan's so. just asking as well really good question yeah. could you do a relief of it so if you had um, a screw head mm -hmm. could you do like an imprint of a screw head in it as well so you'd get it would mean it was the opposite way around oh, if that makes sense but i wonder i wonder that's a challenge for me Dan. there you go next time next time we shall <laughs> see that here um only on hobby maker um <laughs> brilliant so this is all just coming together so it's coming together quite nicely now so we've got our background that we've made up uh so this is all using the metallic gilding polishes and everything else and then we've got our uh, car that we did at the beginning um uh, i'm just going to take off the foam tape i've just popped on there so that's using all the little elements that you saw me do with the white gel pen and the stamping and also the um, pink likers. And finally, one of the sentiments on today's collection, I thought we'd go for the die base one, world's best dad. And that's wow. my Father's Day card done, isn't it? Well ahead it of time. It is sorted. Well, it's in June, <laughs> isn't it? That looks amazing. It looks um, I'm going to turn it up that way for you as well so Levi can get a shot. Just beautiful. Look at that. It just it's looks like fabulous. I, do you know, when I was doing this, I kept thinking, whenever you go to get, if you're fortunate if you're going to buy a new car, you think you always got to get that metallic paint. And right at the end, they go, metallic paint, oh, that's an extra mm. yeah, hundreds absolutely. and hundreds of pounds. Definitely. You have all the metallic cars you want here for. Yeah, you can. Mm. Um, it's such a beautiful collection. I need to let you know as well, over half of the Big Bundle collection has now gone. Not surprised at all. Massive congratulations to all of you. And welcome to our brand new crafters as well. It's lovely to meet you here on Hobby Maker. Remember, if you've got any questions, James is, I don't know where this hour is gone it's got very quick, um, it? but james will be back at five o'clock with your art deco collection so keep on checking out if it's in your basket it's not going to go to you automatically if it's in your basket on the web or on the app you really do need to check it out and actually once everyone's checked out who currently has this in their basket we're down to single figures now so mm. Don't leave it to chance. Um, I know you want it because why wouldn't you? It's an amazing collection and you're going to be able to do so many fabulous things. Um, we'll see you at five where Excellent. competition winners will be announced as yes. well. But right now, um, we have another back in stock moment here at Hobby Maker. This has only sold out a casual three times already. <laughs> um, and thankfully, Debbie Fisher is here to bring it back. We're so excited about this. I know you are too. So don't go anywhere because there's more to come on Hobby Maker. See you at five. <laughs> Never miss a show by watching on the go with our brand new Hobby Maker app. Head over to your app store now and search Hobby Maker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favorite presenters and guests. 
Click on the Today's button to shop all of the products that are featured in today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's best sellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click the Schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking here for our social media pages. So never miss a show by watching On The Go with our brand new Hobbymaker app. Not only is Hobbymaker available live from 1 until 8pm on Sky 670, Freeview Channel 73, YouTube and the Hobbymaker app, now Virgin subscribers can watch on Channel 754, which means there are more ways to watch your way with Hobbymaker. Every day our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and we feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to crafting or a seasoned pro, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 1pm to 8pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Our call centre is based in the UK and available 24-7. Just call 0800 001 4433 or email help at hobbymaker.co.uk. Are you having trouble finding the perfect gift? Then why not treat them to the new gift card from Hobbymaker at hobbymaker.co.uk. Simply scroll down to the bottom where it says gift cards, click and you'll be taken to the right place. Decide between posting the card or delivery by email and then decide how much you want to add. You choose the value. So what do you get the crafter that's got everything? Why not treat yourself or them to the Hobbymaker gift card? Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobbymaker. I feel like this needs a bit of a drum roll, you know, Debbie. Shall we do it? Oh. Back in oh. stock! <laughs> <laughs> it is, oh my goodness, this is such a genius collection. It's sold out three times here at Hobby Maker already. And we have got a good stock for you today. I still think it's going to sell out again, you know. I, I really do. Um, because it's one of those things, it's word of mouth as well. Everybody's been talking about it. Everybody's been showing the cards they make. You've got the ultimate stepper card collection um, from Crafter's Companion. You can make your own. You think of your stash, you think of your stock, you think of your Christmas, you think of your birthdays, your anniversaries. These stepper card dies work with everything um and it's just genius all you got oh do you know it's just wonderful so please get yourselves ready because we say we've got a big stock we do but is it going to be enough I, I really don't know if it is so make sure you're dialing early as soon as the graphics are on your screen lots of you were shopping throughout our last hour as well as soon as they're on the web they were there debbie they were yep. just like oh yes please i missed out on it three times don't miss out on it again, whatever you do. Um, it is here, it is back, and you can get yours today. Graphics are going live right now. Already so many of you there. Um, and just talk us through, because I mean, you've got a stack there of all the dies that you're gonna be getting. I have got a stack. And what's brilliant about these, you'll see them on the screen now, that these make your cards. Yeah. These make your card bases, which are absolutely incredible. They're dies that you're gonna use all year round, Rosie, which I absolutely love. Yeah. You know, whether you're making Christmas cards, whether you're doing your invite card invitations, whether you're doing your birthday cards, Mother's Day, yeah. Father's Day, anything, these are gonna work with. Whatever collection you've got, whatever paper pads you've got in your stash, these are really 
really big dies and we've simplified them. We've literally given you one die that cuts out and structures that incredible card base. And then we've given you all the mats and layers to go oh with it as well. So nice and simple. You don't have to do any measuring. You don't have to, you don't have to worry about all of your no. score marks are there as well. So yep. you don't have to do anything. It's all done for you. Yeah, they absolutely are. Let's have a look at what you're actually getting in here because you're getting a lot of dies for your money here and it is incredible. Um, and don't be put off by this price because I know that price is going to go right it's down. Um, so you've got, now this one is what I would say is your traditional center stepper card um, that we all know and love. And that's going to create cards like this one where it's just literally your card base with your side steppers. Now the next one we've got is a little bit different. So this one is giving you that side stepper, but it's also giving you almost that column effect at the top there, which I absolutely love. And that will give you this type of card as well. Uh, we've then got this one, which I love. And I'm going to say it throughout. I love this one. And then I love this one. And then I love this one. <laughs> we love I, I, the reason that people buy the full collection is because you can't pick and choose yeah. unless you have to, because they are all beautiful. Love this one here. It's such a beautiful design. They're all a little bit different, a little bit quirky. Um, this one probably is my favourite. I love a kinetic card, something that moves. This is a rocker card with a deckled edge and it's beautiful. Try and hand cut that, Rosie. Oh you just wouldn't be able to do it. And it creates this incredible, I mean, in fact, if I put it there, look at this. An wow. actual rocker we know card. It's uh, yeah. it's, yes, absolutely. I love that. Yes, be perfect. We're still going. There is lots in here. Um, love this one. This is very Art Deco. Looks absolutely incredible. It also reminds me a bit of a perfume bottom as well, a bottle. So you could trim these down. You could also elongate these as well. Because if you cut two of these, just add each one to that one, you'd have two lots of columns. So you can nice. actually create amazing ones. Uh, still going, guys, still going. Still going. Um, this one is our grand center step. So absolutely love this one. Look at the bottom of this oh. die. You just couldn't cut that out by hand. So that is beautiful to have. And look at the, I'm just showing you these in basic white cards, but these are incredible. That is just a beautiful so concept. Lovely. And then the last one in this collection, we've put something a little bit different. Now this one is what we're calling a triple stepper card. Uh, and this one actually opens a bit different. So you have these sort of panels that come like this. It's absolutely, I think it goes that way and let's go that way around. And again, it's you could double that up, couldn't you? You could absolutely you could double it up, yes. Yeah. So there's lots, you could do that with lots of them and you yeah. can sort of elongate them, make them bigger, snip bits out of them. Snippability is incredible with them yeah. as well. So uh, I'm not surprised these are sold out three times and uh, I think we're getting super busy for It's going to be selling out again in no time. It, it's just a genius collection yes. because, you know, when you buy your ready card, we all do, I've got lots of ready made yep, cards at home. We yep. all use them, they're fantastic. But how brilliant to have these different shapes. I mean, look at this rocker. Um, we've just, I mean, take a look at that. Absolutely fantastic. Is that Charlie who's just stepped into the, is it Ollie in there? Hi, Ollie. I always get, you You sound very similar, you know. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but Ollie just had a really good idea with this one. It's like you could have a person on each side, like a little seesaw. Oh, I love that. That's <laughs> brilliant. Really That's good. so cool. Love that. Um, you know, all of your stock, like Debbie said, you know, whether it's Mother's Day, Valentine's Day, um, you know, teenagers, Scottish, just married, wedding invitations. I mean, just look at the different things that you can create with them. It's fantastic. Imagine that being your wedding invitation. I mean, any invitation. Your any kids' invitation, birthday yeah. parties, they could oh. help make them, couldn't they? Yes. But yeah, wedding stationery, they're going to look so It's effective. also, do you know, if you want to have a bit of a craft party with your kids, yes. how lovely to just make up a load of different stepper yep. cards and then just let them go. They can decorate Absolutely. them and it's going to be fantastic. Oh, now this... Um, you can be doing with your uh, oh, with an image actually yes. coming up later as well. Love that. Well, we had and that Cheers to You collection that's been used on that oh, one. Yes. We had on on Tuesday. Was that so, just um, oh, oh no, you're, yes, say Monday. I was okay. here Monday with the Cheers to You collection, that's and which just shows you whatever collection you've got, it's going to work with yeah, your guys. That's it. It's a lovely way as well to use up sort of any. If you keep all your die cuts, you keep all your bits and bobs Absolutely. as well. Just yep. a great way to use them up, isn't Beautiful. it? Oh, look at this with your acetate as well. Right, listen, hold on. I'm running away myself here because we haven't dropped the price yet. I know we haven't dropped no. the price. No. Um, <laughs> okay, we are going to match the launch price. Oh, it's getting very, very busy. All of it together. These are massive dies. You see the size of them. You're getting 64 individual dies. 
each individual set um, is $34.99, right? So you can buy them individually for $34.99 if you wish, okay? It's absolutely fine, you can do that. But in this bundle, you will get all of them. The value is £244.93 if you add them all together. Today, we have got a massive saving. We're matching that fantastic launch deal for you. Maybe you've heard about them, maybe you've seen the cards your friend's been making or your mum's been making and you're desperate to get your own set. Maybe last time they just sold out before you had the chance. Look at that saving. Rosie, that's over, over 100 pounds. <laughs> I was thinking that, that's over 100 pounds saving. That, right, do you know what else is ridiculous, Debbie? Actually, if you think about it, it's on a four-way split No. Day, so oh. you're gonna be able to get all of it home for the price of one die. That I is mean, amazing. That, that is incredible. Oh, um, that's incredible. Isn't that you know what? Thank you, Hobby Maker, because that just makes it affordable for people. Yeah. And everybody's going to want these dies because everybody wants to make a concept card that they can then create something yeah. with. So that is so good. It's so yeah. brilliant. It really, really is fantastic. And with the split pay as well, again, it just makes it that, much, that little bit more accessible for you. It means you can split the cost completely interest free across four months as well. It is getting very, very busy indeed. Please do doff. Through, 0800 001 4433. You've also got the website there, hobbymaker.co.uk, and of course our app. Just remember to check it out, okay? Um, lots and lots of you coming through. Now, what a lot of people might be wondering at home is are they as simple as they look? Are they, as a beginner crafter, as somebody who's just got my die cutting machine, will I be able to do this? Will I be able to have a go? So, anybody, and I genuinely mean if you are new to die cutting, you've just got yourself a Gemini machine or a die cutting machine. Uh -huh. Anybody can use these and do them. They're super easy. Every single one of them is super easy. So I've just took the uh, scallop stepper rocker so you can see how big these dies are. I mean, they are absolutely huge. So your outside one is always going to be your worker die. So your worker die is the one that's going to make the actual card. All these other elements for me are just added extras yeah. that you can cr be creative with. So all of these, and you can use these sort of nesting die shapes on any project oh, that you want. Idea. Yeah. So even if you just want this, maybe you want, you've got some animals at home and you want to make some fuzzy felts. This could be your oh, Noah's Ark, couldn't idea. it? So you could cut the inside pieces out, do the Noah's Ark, and then yeah. they can have all their little animals. So lots of different ways. So we'll pop that to the side and let's cut the first one out. Now, the only thing is you do need a Gemini A4, well, you need an A4 die cutting machine. Okay. Um, they're not gonna fit through your smaller die cutting machine, so you do need an A4 cutting plate. These are big um, dies. They're this really big it. dies. I was gonna actually use um, the, some white cardstock, but I have some pads that are on the show, so I'm gonna use one of them to cut one out. So this is the lovely know. versatile thing, isn't it? You're not gonna have to spend hours cutting card to fit your card you know you're, yep. you're making the card out of all the stock that you've got at home as well it's absolutely brilliant. yeah which is so amazing yeah let's do a nice colorful one with oh, this one that. so all you're going to do is place it on your card now the, the way i do it is my die my cutting plate is there mm -hmm. i'm putting my die face down into my card stock then place on your plastic shim your magnetic and then your top one over the top uh, and then cut through so all you're going to do is pass it into the machine that's going to do all the work that crunching is just because it's a really big outline die so it's just catching all those spots in your cardstock and that's going to cut out it's a great sound actually it's a lovely it sound really i love it it's a very yeah. satisfying sound yes uh, and that is your card now while i've got that i'm going to pop that to the side and i'm just going to cut another one um so we can see and rosie i'm going to get you in because i'm <gasps> going to get you to come and oh. fold it because i you were just asking how easy it is okay. to uh, do i'm just going to grab myself a piece of white cardstock just to show the differences so that's um, so clever. all the embossing's done for you. All Everything. the embossing's done for you. Now, the thing to remember with mm -hmm. these is oh. you always start, always, with a, a, a mountain fold. Okay. And that's the easiest way. So mountain valley, mountain valley, through all of them, whatever you're doing first. That's like it, that. so the middle one. And your first line would be a valley, a, a okay. mountain fold as well. And then cool. you just do all the opposites. Okay. Oh, it so kind really of, do you know easy. what? It really helps you along because everything's mm -hmm. already... Um, already scored for you yep it kind of just just so bends. It just, just bends, bends for you, into shape. Really yeah, absolutely. I'm not even sure which one I pick now. An opulent side stepper card. They have nice names. They do, they don't well. they? There we go. Is Look that at right? that. That's it. Oh no, you, oh, well you done. haven't done the rest of the folding. Oh, oh silly me. <laughs> Here we go. 
She's missed Such the, an she's amateur. Missed, missed this is why we have the experts on the show. But <laughs> it's great because Rosie's not done these before. No, and I, I love the fact that I can just pass it to you. I have no problem with knowing that Rosie can do this because it's just following those score lines. There we go. There you go. There we go. It. And you fold them in ah. and it's done. And how pretty is that it's in the cardstock? So stock? lovely. Mm. I love the idea with all your patterned parts. So nice. Uh, and the nicest thing about the uh, pattern cardstock is it's double sided. So oh. it, you're showing that on the inside as well. You made a card. Oh. Uh, right, <laughs> this one exactly the same. So we're going to start off that first line. You're literally going to fold. So that be your mountain fold, valley fold, mountain fold, valley fold, mountain oh, fold. Right. And look at that. And then all I'm going to use, that that's a thinner cardstock and actually works really well because that's a 250, I believe. Yes, 250. Yes, 250. This is our 300 GSM. Just give so it an extra all bone. I'm going to do is just, yeah, absolutely. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> just uh, use your bone folder, yes, to, to score it. <laughs> uh, there you go. But look at that. Uh, in no, I mean, how long does did that take to pop That's those just two through? Great, isn't it? You've made your card blanks. Imagine so you batch clever. making. Oh my goodness! But that's it. Invitations. It's totally. Just absolute yeah. Genius, totally. Isn't it? Now all of these are going to fit. So if I give you some of the uh, measurements, they will all fit. So this is a seven and a half by sort of five and a half envelope, okay. um, and I believe. They're all about the same. Yes, so five and a half by seven mm -hmm. and a half envelopes. So they're all going to fit through those envelopes. Oh my gosh, I've just seen the phone lines. Do you know what's happening? Is we've got a lot of people watching and seeing the demos. Oh, in your basket, right? Please make sure you check it out. Um, I think this is going to be selling out again today. So whatever you're doing, do not leave it in your basket, OK? It's the only other scheduled show that we have of this today as well. So the chances are this is your last time to get it, your last chance to get it. So once the stock we've got on today's show is gone, that will be it. Um, we're approaching 33% of the stock already going. <laughs> oh um, I know, we've got loads of brand new crafters joining us as well. Welcome to you. I mean, this is the lovely thing as well. Since they were last on, mm -hmm. yeah, we've had hundreds of new crafters joining us. Uh, here I was, uh, Liam was telling me how many we have each week and it's yeah. hundreds of new crafters, which is yeah. just incredible. And I absolutely love that. Um, so yeah, all these ones we can see here, you need to check. Yeah. Two bids, so people maybe are buying them for um, presents for yeah. somebody, putting them away. Can can I also just say, so you might be thinking, oh my gosh, like Debbie, I just love the rocker card. I just want to come and get the rocker yep. card. What I will say though, is if you come in and just buy the rocker card, that's $34.99, okay? You can, with the four-way split pay, you can get all seven of these home for that same price. Yep. So just think about it because actually, yes, Every single one of them. Look at all of the different styles. Think about the cards you make through the year. Think about the parties. Think about the different styles your friends have as well, your family have. You know, if you were to pay $34.99, um, you're going to be looking at those four on the bottom there. That comes to £140. The top three are basically completely free Never today. I mean, like the, the saving you're making, you're buying four, you're getting yep. three free. It is phenomenal. Yep. Um, loads of you coming through. Well done to every single one of you. Don't miss out. This potentially is your last chance to come on in. Um, so we've made the rocker. We have. We've made the lovely art. We deco. have. And just to say that you're getting all of those extra dies as well. So the dies that you oh, see here are all for your mats and layers. So once you've got this card, mm. you pick those those special papers that you want to use you pick the range that you want to use you die cut them out of these you, you literally they're going to fit perfectly onto your card blanks which See, is just incredible I love that because I hate measuring things Debbie. yes I'm really bad at sort of mm -hmm. line you know I just want it all to be done now Mandy's just messaged in Debbie um Mandy has um, asked the question she says hi Rosie and Debbie could you please show the die for the center stepper card thank you center stepper center love stepper that card. if yeah, you've got any go. questions and there's any you one, want to it? see yeah let us know oh, let me go and, I'm gonna go and get the samples as well yes no, definitely so this is the center I'm just gonna card. stay with you Debbie because you know oh I love that nice as absolutely <laughs> um let's choose another bit of our card shall we I'll have another pattern one let's do this sort of um the uh, the background of it so let's say the b side we call it the b side actually there's such lovely papers we need to call them the double a side I think don't we? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
Uh, but this is a great one because you are getting, again, if I bring these in so you can see them, you're getting the two different sizes for the different so size clever. steps that you're getting. So you can see on here, this is a bigger step to this one. And then Perfect. you're getting this mats and layers for them. For me, this is a game changer in yeah. card making. Yeah. Uh, because if you was to buy, let's just say, for instance, you buy eight card blanks, which they normally come in a pack, you'd get the envelopes as well. You'd be paying anything from 10 to 12.99 just for that one pack of cards, yeah. for eight cards. Yeah. This one pack of die, if you're buying the whole set and you might be getting this one free, imagine how many card blanks you can make oh out of them goodness. all year It's round. infinite, isn't it? Infin this is years and years. None mm -hmm. of these are ever going to go out of style. Never. They're never going to go out of fashion. No. So for as long as you are able to craft, you're going to be able to use this selection of dies yes. again and again and again and again and again and again and again. And every time you make them as well, they can be completely different. They are going to look completely different. Mm. Yes, exactly that, Rose. Especially when you think that these aren't just, and we're talking about collections, uh, what about genres as well, you oh, know? Yeah. So, Mal cars, we've got Father's Day coming up. We've just seen uh, James uh, with his range oh, that's yeah, just come out. With the cars. Those cars are going to fit beautifully be on here. Actually, so, just they? so lovely with all the different ranges, all the different brands that you've got in your stash. Yeah. And of course, we'd love you to use all of Crafters Companion, but we know that there's some really amazing brands out there. Uh, so, yes, use them with them all. And I love the fact that this is done so easy for you. I'm going to bring my, that and back I mean, in so you can see. That's gorgeous. So you've got this two here. So mm -hmm. again, you literally, it's that mountain fold, valley yeah. fold. That's all you're doing. Mountain fold, valley fold, mountain, valley, mountain. And it's always the mountain first. So if you remember that, you're never, ever going to go wrong. So literally, mountain, mountain valley. valley mountain valley and for any newbies out there that aren't sure what that means it literally means when you think of the shape of the mountain mm. it goes up and down a valley goes down and up yeah. and Just that's think of all a song. you have to do yes ain't no man high, high enough <laughs> ain't no river low enough <laughs> ain't nobody wide enough to keep go. me from you <laughs> <laughs> karaoke, karaoke. <laughs> absolutely <laughs> there we go as quick as that look how amazing okay. that looks uh, in oh. no no oh time whatsoever. So I don't know who asked that question, but all you've got to remember, Mandy. Mandy, Mandy. So all you've got to remember, no matter which one you've got, if that's the one you've got, you just start with the mountain fold and then valley, mountain, valley, mountain, and that works on all of them. That's so fabulous. that's my biggest tip that I can give you. It's, it's just brilliant. And then look at what you can do. You can decorate it any way you like. I mean, that's just great, isn't it? Really it's lovely. It's just so beautiful. Yeah. Um, oh my goodness, mate. Right there. Are so, <laughs> so over half the stock has been allocated. Wow. Um, it's really important to check out your baskets. There's loads of you coming through on the web, on the app, people dialing through as well. If you've got any questions about this collection, please do message in. Debbie's here, she can answer your questions. We're live and we're interactive till 8 p.m. every single day here at Hobby Maker. Um, you can message live into the studio as well. So you just go studio at hobbymaker.co.uk and your message will come straight through to Laura and she'll pop it up on the screen like she's just done with Mandy's message just now. Um, you can, if you've got any questions about the split pay because remember that's totally interest free ring our call center okay 0800 001 4433 any questions about split pay starting your order coming to join us and also i just want to add because people are flummoxed by this every day yes because you see that price it was meant to be 244 pounds and 99 pence 44 pence that, yep well, yeah there we go 244 pounds um there's a big cross through it and it's now 139.99 people watch and think do you have to be a vip then for that or do i have to be a special I member know, do i have to amazing. pay a subscription everybody gets that saving okay it always breaks my heart a little bit in one of the supermarkets it's got like the club price oh yeah normal price and i'm yep. like oh well, i'm not a mm -hmm. member um but you don't have that here um so here it is it's just absolutely brilliant oh there you go you got laura involved in that um i know i, I mean i like them but you're right though rosie because not everybody knows how to join those clubs or how to get into them yeah. or they've got to do something out of their comfort zone and go and ask somebody or they need to go yeah. to customer service i love the fact here that there's you literally we put those savings onto you yeah. um i love our partnership i think crafters companion and hobby maker the amount of saving that you give us yeah. um oh. and and actually it's the split 
pay, isn't it, as well? Because yeah, it makes it affordable to everybody. So regardless of what your uh, amount is, if you can only go for one, your split pay is that amount this yeah. time, which makes it so affordable for it people. It really does. Um, and it's, uh, what I love about this, I'm just looking at this card thinking, if you don't like the, the, the one that you've done, we could just turn it round and oh, fold yeah. it the opposite way. So we literally yes. go then mountain, valley, so mm. you just literally do them all the other way and we can then just uh, completely alter that. So if you're going to use your um, your different uh, papers, uh, have a play with that and yeah. just uh, turn it around. And I absolutely love that. So It's just great, isn't it? I mean, think about all of those different beautiful card packs that you've got at home and how you can make cards out of them instantly. That's just absolutely wonderful, isn't it? It also means your cards are going to really stand out at any craft show. So if you are someone who makes to sell, be it for charity or be it for your own business, mm -hmm. I mean, actually, that 34 99 you're going to be making that back pretty quick, aren't you? Oh, absolutely. Oh. And, and, and they're seconds long as well. Mm -hmm. We were saying the other day about if you've got your Gemini MIDI and you want to personalise things, you could literally make these cards on the, on the spot you can then personalize them because yeah. you've got your handmade die cutting machine and literally your crafting is just going up to a whole new level yeah. and it? it's so professional every single card looks finished looks professional looks really expensive yes um so it's just going to elevate everything you do listen 60 percent has now gone and <laughs> um, we had a bigger stock today i know we did have a gonna... huge stock oh my goodness we had a big stock here today what we're going to do we're going to let the call center catch up because it is incredibly busy um, so we're just going to show you how to join us and just let you know how to how to play, how to get involved. We've got another return to screen. We've got another back in stock. These Duo ink pads, oh my goodness me, they've sold out. Uh, well, I know, they? another one of my favourites. Several <laughs> times. Well, we've got them back in stock for you today and they're going to be coming up after this. So don't forget to check out, but we'll see you on the other side. Never miss a show by watching On The Go with our brand new Hobby Maker app. Head over to your app store now and search Hobby Maker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favorite presenters and guests. Click on the Today's button to shop all of the products that are featured in today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's best sellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click the schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking here for our social media pages. So never miss a show by watching On The Go with our brand new Hobby Maker app. Oh, well, it's all a little bit busy. It's, it's very busy. <laughs> very, very, very busy. Congratulations to every single one of you who's coming in for your stepper die collection. I mean, it's just brilliant. We were just saying again, weren't we? Yep. If you're going for one, go for the bundle because on the split pay, 34.99, you're going to get all of it home straight away. And actually, I mean, basically, you're getting three dies completely free today. It's Absolutely. I mean, if you think you got, you're got you paying £34 this month, then next month, you've only got four of those to pay. Yeah. And you're getting seven of those <laughs> packs of dies home. That blows my mind that yeah. you're getting three, those top three, for absolutely no pennies whatsoever. And yeah. these are big dies, <laughs> big cards. They're yeah. not like small little dainty cards. These are really big make-an-impact cards mm. that you're going to be able to use with all your different uh, collections that you've got. It's amazing, isn't it? I mean, you've got 64 dies in total. I know, so it's, it's a lot of dies. It is. Uh, it and is. when you think about a lot of the dies, a lot of them are um, square dies and uh, rectangles. Yeah. So you can use them in all your card making. Um, and they're, they're nesting dies as well. So you've got two or three of those nesting die shapes. So if you've never had nesting dies before, a good chance it's to get perfect, those as well. It? Yep. it is. It's one of the most versatile sections. Actually. I mean, over 60% has now gone, by the way. So do be quick with checking out. If it's in your basket, if on the web or on the app, 
go for it. Yeah. And if you're dialing through, speak to our call centre. Now, these are already going as well. So yes, we do, they are. They're amazing. What do you love about these? Oh, um, so, um, if you know anything about ink pads, we have a collection of different ones. We have our water reactive, we have our, um, uh, we have our pigment, mm -hmm. we have our quick drying. They all have a place on the market. Now, if you haven't got any of them, mm -hmm. boy, are you in luck because these are the ones that you need because they do everything. Ah. So they will stay wetter for longer to give you your heat um, technique so you can do your heat embossing. Mm -hmm. They will also um, blend together effortlessly. So all yeah. the things you can do with water reactive ink pads, you can do with these. Uh, their colours are completely different to any of the other colours that we've had um, out before. Um, there's just also, um, they're opaque, so they're layerable. Oh. So like our pigment, you can layer them on top of each other. They will blend together effortlessly they will give you that sort of distress look mm. when you uh, blend them together they're absolutely incredible and some amazing colors that you're getting here really you're just gonna just gonna colors. love them all yeah absolutely beautiful so incredible so we've got 11 different of uh, duet ink pads as debbie says they are completely exclusive colors as well but just have a little look and say they're five ninety nine each. Is they are right? five ninety nine each, ordinary. That's what yeah. you would pay from five ninety nine. And I have to say, that's a brilliant it's price for amazing. an ink pad. Yeah, yeah, a really, really good price. Yeah, because you're effectively getting two. Ink oh, pads you are one, absolutely. You? Yeah, brilliant. I mean, look at some of the colours. We're going to put a clock on your screen. You do not need to wait for that clock. You can go ahead, as many of you are doing, checking out straight it's away. A good price. Um, really, really good deal at sixty five eighty nine. But we are going to be taking it lower today for every single one of you. Um, and I can can tell you the, the saving is going to be phenomenal. Yep. Loja is saying on Saturday um, these sold out in seconds and yep. there were over 50 people who missed out on that deal. So yeah. don't miss out today. Okay, really, really important. Seven seconds and we'll be taking you down to your final low they price. They are amazing. Now, this is, oh, there might be another surprise, you know. Did you hear that? Well, I did hear it, but I'm, I'm waiting to see if it happens. Wait to see if it happens. Let's wait and see. <laughs> 49 Oh. That's absolutely incredible. And it is. It's and it is pay. on split pay as well. Oh love that. Goodness, that is super. Mm -hmm. It is so good. Yeah. Oh, I love this. Look at the colours you get. Yeah, it is the colours. Striking. Yeah, wow. if you wanted some different colours to what we have in our colour families, these are the ones that are going to fill those colours. They're absolutely amazing. Uh, they've almost got like that chalky uh, look yeah. to them because they're opaque. They're absolutely beautiful. Um, these are our Debbie Robinson's absolute favourite ink pads. Yeah, Mine are the gorgeous. pigment ink pads, but then these come, well... They might be on par with them now oh. because I do love our duets. No, mm. that would be amazing for them to even be on par with yours. Yeah, yes, definitely. Fantastic. Yeah. And, really and that's heat embossing there. Look oh, at that. Okay. So literally stamp with them. Yeah. Stamp a second generation. Well, that's actually through a stencil, but you have that second generation really light and then mm. you can add your clear embossing powders and make everything super shiny. They're just incredible ink pads oh to gosh. use. You will absolutely love them. This is lovely. And well. uh, you can stamp with them. This. So stamp with them. You can use them as letterpress in your uh, um, embossing folders so lots of lots of any mm. techniques that you can think of that you can do with ink pads you can do with these ink pads these mm. are like your magic ink pads they're just fab what do you mean by when you say you can use them with your embossing folders as well yes. just put the ink on yes yeah, so like a letterpress they used to call oh, it a letterpress okay. technique years ago so you can do that or you can do dry brushing with it so you just mm. put the ink pad directly over the top once it's embossed you can mm. paint mm. with them so oh, put it onto your glass mat mm. use your clear sparkle brush and you can paint with them use a normal water brush you can paint with them oh they're my. just incredible ink pads and uh, everybody i know that has the duets uh, want us to do more and more in fact we've just recently brought out the color bloom ink pads um so yeah love these it's just genius um how would you do a background like this i mean is this sort of just activating it with water and yeah so basically or? you put the ink pad onto your glass mat you spritz it with water and just dip your watercolor card on the top and that's it and that's all you do beautiful. yep so it's many so techniques gorgeous. Mm -hmm. You're gonna have. I think that's the joy of things like this. Is it makes you experiment. It makes you play. Yes. It makes you just have fun. Mm -hmm. And you can be sitting there one afternoon with all the rain yeah. crashing down. Doesn't seem to stop. At yes, moment, I know. <laughs> and, and you can just create all these gorgeous, colourful backgrounds. Yes. And that's experimenting. But mm -hmm. then you can use them in your card making. Oh, so much. You can cut them so. straight out with your dyes. You can. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, yeah absolutely. So many things you can do 
with is them. Is that Nina cardstock? So no, this is, uh, so the cardstock that we've got on the show is our uh, all-purpose cardstock. Ah, okay. So literally, it's great for everything. You can even put water onto this cardstock oh, nice. and it's very good, yeah. I was just thinking about these, you know, mm -hmm. you could ink up on your, and you can use these on your cardstock. Can absolutely you? use them. And in fact, and then let it dry. Can, and can I just show you, oh, when yeah. you use them direct, the mm. colours that you get on Ooh. here. So if you literally just rub your colours onto here, they're mm. just incredible. I just love them. They're just beautiful designs. And you can see you've well. got that sort of chalky sort of one here. If I just bend these up so you can see them. There we go. Look at that That's vibrant fabulous. colour that you've got on there. Uh, and the other thing is that we haven't talked about is mm. the um, shape. Oh, the teardrop shape. So yeah. ergonomic in the hand. It means that you have a really big surface to use here, but turn them round and then you've got that small. So if you want to get into tiny yeah. little detail, you want to be creative with them. You can uh, make that you little can do wave. That. Oh, look at you. Well. Yeah, yes, absolutely. So See, that's because Rose has been to art college. <laughs> <laughs> very long time ago. Very long time ago. <laughs> but they, they, but they instinctively are. make you want to play. They do. You, you totally. pick them up mm -hmm. and you immediately they feel good in the hand yeah. and you just want to. Yeah, you do. Cracking, uh, and, you? and who doesn't want an ink pad that you can do every? Let's say we yeah. want to make a card and we want to use a stencil on there. We want to do some stamping. We also want to do a bit of painting. We also want to do some blending. We might mm. want to put a background of an embossing folder. One ink pad can do all of that, all of that which is incredible. Just lovely. They're yeah, such I love them. Beautiful colours as well. They're colours that are going to make you feel happy, yes, aren't they? They They're are. They're just gorgeous. Really, really lovely. Um, your code on this is CB2082. Um, just make sure you're checking out, okay? I know I keep on saying it. I'm like a broken record, but it is important. And we do have a lot of people missing out every day. So check out, check out, check out. Alice, Medina, Lee, Monica, well done. Uh, Marjorie, Janet, well done. All of our brand new crafters joining us today as well. It's just fabulous Lots today. to meet you. Mm. Yeah, I know. It's wonderful. Um, right, now we've got... Um, Let's bring those paper pads in that you were using, Debbie, because these are just so beautiful. They um, are beautiful. Oh, oh, you've got some there. I've got some here, yeah. I'm oh, sorry. Got yeah, these ones here. are open as well. Um, what, so, and everyone knows this, that wherever you see me craft at the moment, these are my go-to paper pads. Yeah. I've been using them on absolutely everything. In fact, to the point, I'm going to have to get myself some more because what I love about them, you've got the big florals on this one, which is your botanical garden, um, and it's got the most vibrant colours in here, going from your purples, to your blues, you've got greens and oranges and yellows and reds. Oh. I mean, look, they are divine. They're gorgeous. And they have they? this, they're not pearlized, but they've got a sheen on yeah. them. That is so beautiful. They're can absolutely you, can you lovely. Still stamp onto you can, so you can stamp onto them, but what I would say is you need to heat emboss them to set okay. it. Um, right, because yeah. unless you've got like a stays wow. on ink, which will um which will which will stay on, uh, which is amazing. I want to frame some of these. I know. Really funny, but can you imagine a really bright oh, absolutely. And of They're this. so incredible. Stunning. Your scrapbook pages for the summer is going to be amazing. Oh it's just uh, incredible. Uh, and with these ones, you've got this one in your big florals, and then you've got a rainbow pad, which is your solid colours to match every single one of these oh colours in word. here. And then you've got a ditzy floral one, which is a similar one. With oh, it's, in fact, it's exactly the same colour, so same colour system. But you've got these small flowers on this one. So it's, it's so just beautiful. I love them. I mean, I'm definitely a flower girl and I love any flowers in card making but these are amazing. They really are gorgeous I mean imagine the gift bags you can make the boxes, I mean 250 yep. GSM mm -hmm. it's an amazing bundle so you've got three of these huge gorgeous 12 by 12 inch and they should be 21.99 each yep. right? 36 sheets on each, so that's all your gorgeous ditzies, let's show you the rainbows too. They're also 250 GSM and you've seen me cut those dies out as well, mm. so they're, they're a nice weight for all your card blanks <gasps> as well as your mats and layers, I know, and every single colour of these matches the two cut two pads that we've just seen. Wow. I just, this, I mean okay. you can tell why this is my favourite at the moment. That is beautiful. I mean, that's like proper sapphire oh, blue, isn't so it? So nice. It's lovely. So lovely. Emerald green. These are, and, and really, the quality is just off the chart, isn't it? Um, people are already checking out. I love that as well. Orange. I just don't think, I mean, I know you will, but I think if you didn't know what paper pads to go for, because there's so many there on the market, these are the ones you need in your yeah, stash. Yeah, oh, definitely. Um, the beautiful thing is, you get all three of them. So yes. you're not having to make a choice. You get all three of them. Should be £65.97 and pence for all three. Um, people are already checking out. Now, we're going to put a clock on screen. What does that mean? That means we're going to drop the price. 
Um, so, do you have to cancel your order and start again because you want to get the better deal? No, everyone gets the best deal here at Hobby Maker. Doesn't matter if you're first to check out, if you're the last one on the phone lines, you still get the best deal. I wouldn't want to leave it that long. Though. Oh, absolutely um, not. <laughs> um, definitely come in now. There's a free number 0800 001 4433. Your code for this is PE2056. Um, this is about to make for the finest quality pearl, beautiful 250 yep. GSM papers. Um, but there's card, really, isn't it? Mm -hmm. I mean, that's, you can you can. Look at the price, this. Rosie. Oh, <laughs> hey. what? That is amazing. And it's on split pay. Debbie. That is incredible. I mean, what is that? About £18 a pad, I would say. Yeah, it's, it's phenomenal. Uh, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16. Wow. Ollie's in there going, why are all these on split pay? I thought we're not allowed to do split pay under £50. Oh, yeah. We're not meant to, Ollie. Don't tell anybody. He's going to be going back I so I think there's street. a glitch in the system <laughs> yeah. because we're doing a lot of split pays at the moment. But I love that <laughs> because it does make it more affordable. So, exactly. uh, And you will, honestly, so. if you get these pads, you'll get them home and I promise you, you'll want another lot. That's it. And the beautiful thing is because they're all raised rainbow colours you can go with your new dies you can go oh that's right actually isn't it there should be 21.99 today you're going to get 24.99 and you get all three of them um home and for this quality of cardstock 46 pence per sheet wow it's absolutely yeah that's incredible, incredible isn't it i mean all of these colors you can get your brand new dies that you've got on the show today you can cut them out in different colors a rainbow collection of your mm -hmm. beautiful rocker cards or your stepper cards um 20 of this has now been allocated what's really nice rosie is you mm. could cut your rocker cards out <gasps> of the pattern and then you could use all your mats and layers for the solid yes. colors that is brilliant. Maybe, oh, do you know what? Try to do that in a mouth. Yes, let's because do it. couldn't we? Let's oh, shall it. we? She's putting you on the spot there, Debbie. Sorry. <laughs> Um, that would be great. Phil, Christine, Linda, we've got Cynthia there. Brand new crafters coming through as well. Um, absolutely fabulous. There you go. Use ours. Okay. Yeah, use ours. Are I they think, yours or are no, they? I th well, I'm not sure. One's that. mine and one's yours. That's why there was two lots. Ah, <laughs> well, you can use ours if you like, Debbie. <laughs> That's all right. <laughs> are ours the closed ones? That one's open. That's ours. Yes. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> uh, right, yours, pick one. Pick a pick um, a step ooh, up. Ooh, never ask me to make decisions, <laughs> especially if it's regarding food. Right, there we go. Oh, I love I this one. Oh, I lovely. think, yeah, I, I mean, I keep saying, I mean, the, I think the um, the rocker one is my favourite, but I absolutely love the deco one because it has a really beautiful shape. And if I just bring this in as well, so you can see it. Look at these pillars that you've oh, got on yeah. the side. Now, I think you could also so use these as candles. Oh, that's a good idea. Yeah, so another. So you'll find yeah. that with lots of the dyes. You'll get them home and think, oh, I can use that for something else and I oh, can put them onto other pieces. Um, um, it looks like a mirror I've got at home as well that was my mum's that, um, that we've got. And Hazel now has it in her bedroom. It's like a vintage mirror. Um, with sort of a... Oh, you know, yes, a yeah. I know what you mean, yeah. Really, and Ollie's say it looks like a theatre. So you can, you know, you can go down so many different routes with it all, can't you? Amazing. Oh my goodness, look at what's going on. Uh, <laughs> so many people. So busy. I, I, and I'm going to be honest, I didn't think it would be as busy. Uh, not because I didn't think people would love them, but because they've sold out three times before, yeah. Rosie. So you sort of, sort of think everybody's got them now. Yeah. Um, and then actually not everybody's got them. And not it just shows has. how many customers there are out there that, um, or crafters that just really want to get organised with their card making yeah definitely and I mean you know this is a testament as well to you at home you watch you join in and we've had so many new customers since the last time these were on as well so yeah. it's really exciting there's always something and this is what I always remember there's always gonna be somebody watching they've never ever seen this before so it's really amazing yeah it? definitely I've got some scraps here Rosie I'm gonna okay. let you fold that because okay. I'm gonna cut some mats and layers out I'm gonna go for my mountain so mountain let's valley. do this one and let's just take another one of those out so we can actually do our mats and layers and pop this one into a card. Okay. So let's use this one here. Oh, I do love these papers. They're so yeah, beautiful. Yeah, they're fine. just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. If you love your florals, you are going to absolutely love these papers. Uh, so we'll do that one there. We've got three layers of this one. So what we can do is do another one. That would be the smaller one. And then have we saved enough? Oh, can we be that frugal? Look, I think Ooh. we can just, just fit that oh, on amazing. there. <laughs> there you go, my darling. Lovely. So I've we've got that those. Right. Yep, yeah, perfect. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. So you followed that rule, haven't I did. you? I did, I followed the rule. Mountains <laughs> first, then the valley. That's it, yes. 
Right, let's pop those on. And I am just going to use a little bit of tape. Mm -hmm. Oh, I've lost the end of my tape. Oh, no, I hate that. Oh, you need one of those little tins. Have you seen them? No. Oh, did we have them? Who brought, was it? I think um, Carla brought them on. There are these little tools and it's just got a little hook on it and you drag it around the outside of your tape and, um, and it finds the end of your set of tape for you. That's it's amazing. <laughs> I think it's a We Are Makers thing. Oh. Do you know what I mean, Laura? Yeah, it's really clever. Oh, I'm going to have to ask Carla. I know. I think I might see her. She might be in on, is she in on Friday? She on might Friday. be. Are you in a Friday? Yes, I am in on Friday, Friday and too. Saturday. Oh, hooray! Yes. Oh, weekend. that's good. Yes. Yeah. Are you yeah. Saturday as well? I am indeed. Oh, yeah. well, there we go. Oh, oh Laura's, Laura's not. not. Laura's not. <laughs> right, so. You'll be here, won't you? You'll be here with us. <laughs> right, let's pop those to the side and let's mat and layer these onto our card base. So I'm just going to burnish that. So oh, we've sorry, got, I No, no, that, no, that's I? absolutely fine. I'm slacking, Debbie. <laughs> Half a job. I know, I need a, need a new helper. <laughs> <laughs> and sacked never, already. <laughs> never, never. So I'm just using my tape pens. So if you haven't got any, make sure you stock up on those as well because these are going to be ideal for your mats and layers. So literally, oh, I haven't done my pillars. I could have done the pillars as well, but let's just pop those right in the middle. So you can see just how beautiful wow. they look. Gorgeous. I mean, what about a vibrant card like this for a sort of, uh, um, I mean, I know Easter's gone, but Easter, your Mother's yeah. Day, weddings, anniversaries. All these summer birthdays. Absolutely. Just going to be Congratulations beautiful. Congratulations as well, you know, things like new job. And also, actually, some of these would be perfect for sympathy cards as well, wouldn't they? Love you know, that. They really yep, do work definitely. with every single. Um, yeah. Oh, look. And there we go. And we haven't done the... Let's just do the pillars. So we've okay. got them to put on the side. So that's our last ones there. And the great thing yep. about them, even though they're still the same die, we've actually put two in there for you as well. Yeah. So we haven't skimped on anything. Definitely. And I can actually use that one because we can just pop them each side like that. I just, then. do you know what? I genuinely, every single one of you is coming through there for your dies. You have got to go for these paper pads as well because they're yes. like a match made in heaven, aren't they? Um, right, oh, little update on your stepper card die collection as well. 70% has sold out. Wow. That doesn't include everyone with this in their basket, people who are currently dialing through, people who are currently thinking about it as well. Is as far as I'm concerned, it's one of those things. I don't think there's really anything to think about with this because no, not you're going to get the entire collection home for thirty four ninety nine. That's the cost of one die, your one die set, I should say. You're going to get all seven of them home straight away. That's sixty four dies in total. As Debbie said, all of those nesting dies you're going to automatically get with that. All of those little details as well. All of the card shapes. I mean, technically, you could be buying this set. You might never have to buy a card blank again. You know, I love your get... thinking there. That's it's... and actually that is very true. Yes. And you you find I think especially us Brits, we are creatures of habit. Once you mm. find a card that you like, look at that. Hello. How that. nice that. is that? I think uh, Laura was right. If you're going yeah. for these, you need to go for those card those uh, um, <gasps> paper pads. And then all of the all of the leftovers, you could just cut out some petals and make oh, flowers. Oh, make your flowers. The absolutely. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. So it's so gorgeous. simple to do. Yeah. Mm. I mean, I mean, I mean, look how quickly, and those, they're all that paper pad, yeah. which is amazing. Oh, 100%, whatever you're doing, add your paper pad into your collection. Um, okay, once, oh. Every, oh, no, right. once <laughs> everyone's checked out, we're only going to have 14 chances left. Okay? Wow. Um, and there are still people thinking about it. There are people right now picking up the phone. There are people right now putting this in their basket. Um, so, Jill, well done. Just bear with us on the phone lines, Jill. We are getting to you, I promise. Brand new crafters on the phone line as well. We will get to you. It's a completely free number. Um, so, do stay with us. We've got Judy there, Pauline, Patricia on the web, Margaret on the web, Sarah on the web. Please make sure you're checking out, okay? They're not safe in your basket. And I don't mean to sort of scare with that. It's just genuinely yep. people miss out every single day because they just don't quite check out fast enough okay we don't want that to happen to us. Sarah's done it well done um Pat's there as well Lancashire now the minimum amount of dies that you're going to be getting free with this incredible collection is 21 dies wow um so if you took any three of the dies that are going to be your three sets 
Um, the most is going to be 34. Yeah, Steffi, absolutely. Yeah. Minimum 31, 21. It's absolutely sensational. It's, it's got to be one of, look, and let's just say straight away, because if you're just tuning in, you're saying 139.99. Do you know what? You know, it's a considered purchase. Absolutely. You look at it and think, OK, can I do that right now? But actually think about what this is going to save you over the years, what it's going to save you when having to buy card blanks, OK? Not having to buy um, all of those other elements, those nesting dies that you're going to be getting in here as well. You yeah. think about the fact the years and years and years, the longevity that you have with this yes. collection. It's going to make massive savings to you over the years. You'll make that back in no time. You know. Absolutely. Oh, what would you want to do next, my darling? And also, um, if you make cards for a living, so yeah. you sell them, mm. I mean, you're going to cover the cost of that in no yeah. time whatsoever. Abs oh, do you know what? Can we do this one, darling? Oh, yes. I love yes, this. Yes, is that yes. right? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, this is a beautiful one. This has been fast um, uh, becoming lots of people's favourite. I'm seeing this one uh, everywhere at the moment oh, because okay. people tend to love this one because it has a bit of a, a different sort of step on it let's use it let's do another one of these i can't help but use these it's pads. just lovely so it? so nice to use uh, and the nicest thing about a double-sided pad as well is the fact that when you turn it over and you can see it you can then you've got that beautiful uh, b-side of the pad as well so let's place that just like so just give that one a trim down I also think, you know, when, when you hear, as a crafter, whether you're new or whether you're... You know, when I first heard about stepper cards, mm -hmm. because I wasn't a crafter before I joined Hobby Maker, yep. I sort of thought, oh, gosh, that sounds complicated. You know, is that going to be really difficult? Is that going to be really hard? I just get a piece of card and fold it in half. You know, that's yep. my, that's my yep. crafting. Mm -hmm. um, but what's really, really fabulous is this is so easy, isn't it? Yeah, so easy. Mm. Um, and for anybody to do. So if you're crafting with the kids, if you're crafting with your nan, it doesn't matter how you're doing. That's the card we're going to be doing right next. So you can see how beautiful that is. And to have, if I just bring those matte and layers out here, to have these mm. extra ones, these are going to go for lots of different things. You might mm. just want to cut this out on and have like, um, you know, like you have a purse, you make a purse out oh, of a yeah. card. Oh, where you just literally nice. fold it in half and have the purse bit coming overneath. So you, that's a so you're gonna, idea. yeah, you're gonna. Oh, oh I'll grab it. It's all right. We've, it's all right. right. We've uh, cut them. It's already it, cut. It's Thanks already you, cut. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Michael. Um, right, this one's pretty much the same. It's harder to see. In fact, can we see it? Oh, it doesn't matter. Oh. oh <laughs> so, right. Once everyone's checked out, we've got single figures left. Okay. So these are pretty much fully allocated. You just wow. got to make sure you actually go go through. So with this one, I'm going to do all my steps so they go inwards. Can you see? They sort of yeah. go one, two, three. See, oh, you can see it perfectly there. And then we're going to do the opposite way. So in fact, I'm just going to make sure that we're doing that right. And then it's just a bit difficult to see because it's patterned, but I can see it's just the lights in here. The fact that it's embossed it for you, though, um, scored it for you rather, it does make it so much easier, doesn't it? It certainly of... does, <gasps> yes. Look at that! So I'm trying to think which way right there we go. So this way, this way here. Go either, there we go. Yeah, go yes. any way you want it to go. Mm. Yeah. No, it goes. The step goes that way. Yes, that's the way. That's the way Love it goes. That. So you've got that amazing shape that folds, and actually you can then fold that into. That would fit into a four by seven and a half inch envelope. Yeah. So actually your um, your DLs. slim line, your DLs. Yeah. Yes, absolutely. DLs that would go in there. So beautiful mm. design and just makes such a lovely card. And then using your um, your mats and layers on top of there they're just going to look incredible so uh, yeah love you know those as well ones. you know you've got all your beautiful flowers at crafters as well i mean yep. you could almost do little pop-up elements couldn't you as well have flowers tucked underneath so when you open love it up, that yes bloom yeah out. that's going to look nice. so nice have i just stolen your idea ollie is that what you said as well <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> <laughs> he had the thought. There we go. Eight minds think alike, Colin. There we go. Have we got any left? Have we Ooh, done them all? I'm no, not I think sure. We could do. We could do this. Oh, we, we haven't do. done that one, have we? There's so many to play there, with. Yeah, absolutely. There There's seven. Seven. Seven, which is amazing. I wasn't sure how many week. we've done. Yeah, absolutely. So. Uh, let's do another white one, so you can see just in a white okay. cardstock. So uh, this is a heavier weight. So this would be our um, uh, multi-purpose cardstock, okay. which is 300 GSM. Brilliant. Um, okay. So actually, it's what it's the one card weight that we say. 
say you should use for most of your card lengths. But because of how clever these dies are in how they're cut, the rigidity of these cards really allow them to stand yes. up as low as a 250, which is what we've been doing with the pads. So I love the fact that you can use your bigger cards, uh, your heavier weight card, but yeah. you can also get away with using your uh, pads as well. And no matter what pads you have, most of our pads are about 250. Mm. So they're all going to fit through there. Oh my, I mean, literally think about that. Think about mm -hmm. how much card do you have at home? How many of those heavyweight 250 GSM papers do you have at home? And just think of the fun you're going to have for sitting yep. and cutting and making all these cards. You're just going to make that stack there for your thank you cards, your birthday cards, your just because cards, thinking of you cards. It's just... Just so many. Yes. Everything you can think of. Christmas cards yes. as well. This would work brilliantly. I was thinking that actually. just yes. for that one. Yes, we lovely as a Christmas card. Absolutely. Um, mm -hmm. Right, again, so if anyone's just joined us, any line, whichever, whatever line they are, it always starts with the mountain fold. So so this line in the middle I'm going to do as my mountain then we're going to do our valley and then we're going to keep doing it like that so that then becomes our mountain fold and then our valley fold and I like to sort of continue that so you've got that ah, and okay. then your middle section because that's our first line is that is it's mountain done then, again isn't it? Um, and actually done so if you just bring that into place like so and because it's cool. a die cut it's perfect every single time I love this one this is so it's lovely really gorgeous yeah isn't it? really gorgeous i'm just going to turn that over now this bit on the inside just this piece mm. just put your um uh, scoring tool inside and just flatten that and i okay. say that because you don't want to put any ridges on this bit here oh, but look how beautiful that <gasps> card is but look at that's fine do you know what because you just said christmas as well you could pop a head on there they could be your Ooh. um I'm and what are they called? Nutcrackers, thanks, Ollie. Yeah, they could be the nutcrackers to either side of a little fireplace in the middle. Ah, oh, yes, Can I they? love that. I'm actually going to cut another one out of this and show you what I was <coughs> saying about early. Oh, we've got time. I'm doing oh, this. Yeah. Oh, lovely. Um, we're going to cut this again, and I'm going to show you how we can uh, make this one bigger. Oh, nice. Okay. So, um, yeah, what you would call a mantle top pleaser. What so, do you call it? A mantle top a mantle pleaser. Top pleaser. 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 <laughs> I think a leader. Wow. A, a mantle top pleaser. Mantle top pleaser. Yes. There you go. So let's do another one because it's exactly the same shape on the left and the right hand side. Ooh. So when you do this, you mm -hmm. can literally. So we're mountain valley fold, mountain valley fold and then mountain on the end. I mean, I'm doing mine really quickly, but you don't have to go so quick, but you can see how easy they are to put together. Oh, now <laughs> Ollie's just said, what would happen if you did swap them over and yeah, do the well, valley? Well, it wouldn't work. <laughs> it wouldn't work because this then would be the opposite. Well, oh, I yeah. suppose actually it would just be the opposite way around. A different concept. So if you pop that across the top there, oh and stuck that together. Oh. <gasps> where's, oh, your little, where's your little candles? <laughs> where are your candles. little candles from before? Oh, I've packed them away, but they they, I've stuck uh, them on. But little you candles. Put candles. Yes, little candles, candles on the yeah. top. Yes, a candelabra. Um, but oh you can God. do that with most of them. Um, so if you've got different shapes that you can do it. So like this mm. one, possibly, okay. you could put into the middle one. So you'd have another one across. Um, wow. I'm not sure. Oh, that one you. Oh, that one you could probably do and have two columns on each oh, side. Yeah. So just do it the opposite way. But yes, all you would do is stick those pieces together, and you've got yourself a nice long elongated card. Isn't that fantastic. You could do that as a picture frame. Oh my gosh, you could. On the side, so each one you could have mm. pictures of the grandkids or a new baby oh, or anything that like idea. that. So, yeah. uh, but actually, just two cards. Look how quick they were to do. It's brilliant. <laughs> oh my goodness, it is just such a genius collection, and you can use this with absolutely everything think about the hour we had before with creative expressions all your beautiful vintage cars and classic cars um you could use that with this oh just wait we've got five left oh okay please check out Make someone's got three sure oh no out. three new crafters yeah that, two new i know crafters. oh my wow. goodness me it's just fabulous isn't it we don't know. Will we ever have them back? We Can I just say today. something? Yeah, mm -hmm. this was not a planned show. No. Um, it was supposed to be a brand new launch today, but the, the stock hasn't come in. So we're having that show on Saturday. So this show was just thrown in. So we wasn't even meant to get it. Uh, 
<laughs> so we've no idea if we're going to have it back again. Um, do you know what's really exciting as well? Like we said, you can use all your cars with this. We've got visible image up next as well. Mark's got some fabulous demonstrations coming away with your favourite tipples of beer, of wine, of gin and tonic. Which would be yours out of those three? Oh, gin. Gin, <laughs> gin every, every day of the week. Gin all the time. A gin, so or, always gin, gin or a Bailey's. <laughs> gin or a Bailey's. <laughs> always a gin o'clock. And I just, do you know what? Um, do you like gin and tonic? Just the gin. Yeah, just the gin. <laughs> just the gin. Um, it's just a beautiful, beautiful collection. This is so useful. It's so versatile. You can use it with literally everything in your stash. Don't forget to add your papers, okay? Because they are really limited now as well. And if you haven't yet got your duet ink pads as well, um, half of the stock oh, has wow. gone on the ink pads. I'm not as surprised. Well. Oh my goodness! Now you're back with us in an hour's time. I am in an hour's time. I need to go and relax for an hour now. <laughs> <laughs> I know what, what an hour. It's been incredibly busy. Well done. To every single one of you, we've got four left. We've got about 50 if you're trying to check it out at the same time. We might have to bring them back at some point if we're able to, but I don't know if we're going to be able to. Um, but do not go anywhere because we are going to bring you your favourite tipples next. This is a beautiful collection. We're all having loads of fun with this upstairs as well. You can create so many fabulous cards. The, um, we've got, not the drinks. Not <laughs> <having fun. laughs> um, we've got the stamps. We've got the dies, all from Visible Image. Coming up next, Mark's got some gorgeous uh, demonstrations coming your way. So it's all to come on Hobby Maker. See you soon. <laughs> <laughs> Shopping with Hobbymaker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.hobbymaker.co.uk where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your craft room essentials to paper, tools, cutting machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Hobbymaker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Hobbymaker. Alternatively, you can call our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Hobbymaker. Not only is Hobbymaker available live from 1 until 8pm on Sky 670, Freeview Channel 73, YouTube and the Hobbymaker app, now Virgin subscribers can watch on Channel 754 which means there are more ways to watch your way with Hobbymaker. Never miss a show by watching on the go with our brand new Hobbymaker app. Head over to your app store now and search Hobbymaker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favourite presenters and guests. Click on the Today's button to shop all of the products that are featured in today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's bestsellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click the schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking here for our social media pages. So never miss a show by watching On The Go with our brand new Hobbymaker app. Every day our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and we feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to crafting or a seasoned pro, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 1pm to 8pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Our call centre is based in the UK and available 24-7. Just call 0800 001 4433 or email help at hobbymaker.co.uk. Are you having trouble finding the perfect gift? Then why not treat them to the new gift card from Hobbymaker at hobbymaker.co.uk. Simply scroll down to the bottom where it says gift cards, click and you'll be taken to the right place. Decide between posting the card or delivery by email and then decide how much you want to add. You choose the value. So what do you get the crafter that's got everything? Why not treat yourself or them to the Hobbymaker gift card? Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide, 
This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobby Maker. Oh, do you know, this is just the most joyful day on Hobby Maker, oh, yeah. isn't it? It's <laughs> Definitely. brilliant, really fabulous day. Welcome back, Mark. It's Thank fabulous you. to have you here. Nice How to be here. Yeah, great, thanks. Yeah, we're all ready for this. We were all <laughs> chatting away about this upstairs. Which one's your favourite? What drinks for different times of, you know, life and occasion? Yeah. When you've walked up a mountain, when you've finished the school run? What? Yeah. Hard <laughs> day's work, yeah. Yeah, exactly, <laughs> exactly. Um, this is a genius collection. You're going to absolutely love it. And, you know, all your friends, all your friends, family you're gonna be able to make cards galore um with this you all know someone who loves beer or you can turn the beer to cider or your cocktails or your gin and tonic or your wine your whiskey you've got it all you've even got the ice cubes and the splash to go with it as well you've thought of everything we try to, you know, we've come up, this is what we call it a timeless collection. You're going to want this all the time, aren't you? Yes, yeah, 100% you are. It's just fantastic. We've got lots of wonderful demos coming your way as well with Mark. Um, so just get yourselves ready. Um, it's, it's fabulous. And do you know, I think we're all ready for this as well. It's spring. Come yes. on. Go away, rain. <laughs> yeah, go away, rain. Give us the sunshine. Give us the beer gardens. Um, right, we're going to bring this, this bundle in, and it's a big bundle. You're going to get all of the stamps for all of your favourite tipples. We're going to give you all of the dies to match exactly with them. All of this from Visible Image. Um, and £118.90 pence is the value. We're not stopping there, but let's have a little look through and show you what you're getting. Um, and then we're going to give you a massive saving. Um, this is just wonderful. So... Um, you've got, we're starting with the wine and then we'll be moving through. So you've got the cork, you've got the glass, you've got the bottle, and then you've got these terrific stamps to go with yeah. it as well. I mean, that's got everything on it that you need. Yeah, oh. I mean, you've got great sentiments. You've got those dramatic splashes that look amazing on your cards. And I'll show you exactly how to use those as well. Yeah. Um, and you've got the dies to cut everything out as well. So easy peasy. Oh, it's brilliant. Today's forecast, 99% chance of wine. Yeah. Um, love it. So that's your wine. I'll just show you a couple of examples on this as well. I'm going to start with the one I've just taken a photo <laughs> of because this is, you need to make this card for all your friends and all your family who are adults. Look at that splash, isn't that fantastic? Why? It's gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. Because being an adult is hard. Mm. Yes, it is, it can be. Yeah. Can't yeah. it? It certainly <laughs> can be. Um, so yeah, you need to make this one for everybody, you know. Um, look at this as well. Absolutely fabulous, yeah. again, just gorgeous. And those, you know, with the corks as well, it just, it, it just finishes it off. And yeah. um, what's important about this whole collection is that across the range, all the sizes are relative to each other. So that if you wanted to put a beer glass with the wine glass, ah. they're all the right size. You know, you're not going to like have a mix and match and it's going to look really awkward. You're not going to have um, a giant no, wine no. bottle and a tea They're all relative so that we will all work together. Oh, that's brilliant. So you can have a whole bar made up yeah. of... Um, and do you know what? Even for... There's, there's a lovely world right now as well of non-alcoholic beers, mm. non-alcoholic wines. Sure. So you can be mixing up the labels and, yeah. you know, it's fantastic. Now, this is your beer, the best beers the ones we drink with friends. Yeah. How true is that? Lovely. And it's great. You know, you've got three different size bottles there. You've got cheers. Uh, you've got the uh, bottle cap as well, so it's really nice. And you've got those lovely bubbles. Yeah, and they all match, don't they? So the die matches yes. the stamp perfectly. Yeah. Really, really fantastic. Again, let's show you just some of the samples you brought with you. Just really wonderful. You're going to have so much fun. Um, lots of people checking out. What's this lovely, shiny... Um, glossy glossy accents ah, or there glossy we go. highlights depending on, on whether it's Craster's Companion or, or another brand oh, fantastic. Um, but again you can put that on your on your glasses or, or your bottles and it's gonna look it's gonna look amazing oh, you yeah. know you can't buy a card like this no way no you can't and that's the beautiful thing isn't it you, you no. make it yourself and it just makes it so much more special for you and for the person you give it to as well and um, so that's your gorgeous beers um, lots of people's favourite. James was saying he is a cocktail man through and through. Um, so, lots, yeah. Pina, pina colada yeah. is James's favourite. What's your favourite? Um, 
I don't know. I would say sex on the beach, but it's not. That's not the case. He went anything, there anyway. <laughs> anything that I'm non-alcoholic for me. No. Um, but yeah, it, again, cocktails, great lot. There's the, an amazing amount in that that set. You've got three different kinds of glasses as well, so you can make up different cocktails if you yeah. wanted to as well. And all the different fruits too. You know, yes. so clever. The olives there for a nice martini mm -hmm. as well. Um, just fabulous. Look at that. Yeah, your different shaped glasses. It's yes. all those elements of detail that mm. you've put in this. It's, it is, Laura's absolutely right. And producer Laura's just saying, it feels like you're on holiday. Oh, yes. You know, it's <laughs> Yeah, great. definitely. I, I, I would, yeah, I would drink that on holiday. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Um, this, I just, I mean, look at the lemon. It's fabulous. Absolute gorge and all your ice cubes as well that you yeah. can use here too. So just everything's been thought of. Everything just works beautifully together. And you're going to have so much fun with this. Um, loads of you are coming through. Loads of you are checking out already. Remember, this is not your price. It, and actually, dare I say, it, I mean, it's nowhere near your price. We've got the hugest saving for you here today. Um, this is my favourite. I know, I know. <laughs> <laughs> this is genius, and um, well, we'll get so to that clever. in a second. Yeah, it's so <laughs> clever. Um, this will be Ruth Lynette's favourite as well, if she happens to be watching today. Our gorgeous Ruth. Um, your gin and tonic, look at that. I mean, the glass, the eyes, you can always feel the condensation mark dripping yes. down the glass. Um, you've got some nice little elements, extra elements in there as well. You've got the drips, um, you've got the cubes. You've got these kind of like great sentiments where you can, um, you know, keep, keep your... And then there's a, another stamp called Up, and then you've got gin, so you can stamp gin in a different colour. Oh, it really works nice. together. It's been thought out. It has, hasn't it? Every single element, every single detail is just beautiful. Um, here we go. We can show you that now. I love this inky background on this, uh, on all of these, actually. Look at that. Keep your gin up. Yeah. Um, yes, please. That's fantastic. And actually, the very famous gin brand make, you've got all the colours on this oh, one. Oh, definitely, you? yes. Really fabulous. But isn't that, that the glossy accents really it's make it? Beautiful. Um, and then, are you ready? Are you ready? I just think this is absolute genius. Who did this one for you? Did you say? Oh, it's Leanne Harris. It's genius. Sure. Yeah. So she, Leanne has used just the dyes, um, not, not the actual um, stamps themselves, the dyes. And she's actually die cut it from a real gin uh, can. It's just superb. Isn't that amazing? And that's a work of art. You Love know, it. You can easily hang that on the wall. Oh, definitely. I want this in my kitchen. <laughs> um, Leanne. I might be in touch. You've got a commission. I would really like, yeah, it's brilliant. Um, so fantastic. So that is your gin. And then, almost took your demo away. Then we've got your whiskey. So, I mean, this is such a brilliant collection. My hubby is a big whiskey fan. My dad mm. adores whiskey. Mm. Laura's dad does too. Um, Father's Day on its way. Yes, I mean, lots of, lots of women drink whiskey as I well like, now. I quite, it's like quite whiskey, a, actually. Yeah. yeah. Um, I actually found out recently that uh, Andy's, uh, he, he's a whiskey, he collects whiskey as well. Oh, really? Yeah. I did not know no, that. No, I did not know that yeah. either. So, yeah, yeah. Pi collects it as well. It's, it's lovely. Um, we've, my mum my, my and dad live up in Scotland. Mm -hmm. is next to the smallest distillery in Scotland. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, it's Edward Hour, I think. There we go. The older you get, the more I like you. Maturing well. <laughs> I like that. It's very good. Um, and then take a little look at the cards you can make as well. Really beautiful. I love that. I mean, that's all that gorgeous stencil used in the background there. It's almost yes. like... Um, the yeah. scent. It's, it's called really Fibres, and I do believe that is on the show, possibly Ooh, later. Oh, fantastic. It's really lovely, that. Mm -hmm. And then, look at how simple. How pared yes. back, how classic. I just think that is fantastic. And, you know, you stamp the glass, then you go back in and stamp the... Uh, the splash in a different colour. Yeah. Amazing. Absolutely. I mean, you, and Laura's absolutely right. You go and find a card like this in the supermarket, simple, classic, very, very stylish. Mm. That's going to be £3, £3.50. Easily. At least, you know, put the envelope with it too. It could be more. Um, right, there's people put oh. it in their basket. Nearly 10% has gone already. Can I show this one as well? Yes, please. So, this is one I, I created. Just oh. So, we have this maturing well, and mm -hmm. we just slide <gasps> the door back. What? And then we open it up. <gasps> and then inside. Oh, so this is the first ever on. gatefold card I ever made. So that's um, that is brilliant. Oh, that's a... so again, it's something a little bit fabulous. different. I think so. Yeah, I do try and, and give people ideas as what you can do with it. So. It's wonderful. I'm going to have a look at that <laughs> in a moment as well. Do you know what? Um, we've got your saving coming in. Well done to everyone who's already checked out. Ten percent's already gone. Look at. Look at the saving you've just made. That's fantastic. Oh, wow. <laughs> 69.99. That's 48 pounds savings. Nearly 50 pounds you've just basically got back there. 
That's six ninety nine per set for oh, wow. stamps and dies. And it's it's on a and it's split. on a split. Oh, and it's on a split pay as well. <laughs> well, you're going to get it all home for thirty four ninety nine. That is absolutely brilliant. Some of these sets on their own are twelve ninety nine. Yes, Mark. Um, they're six ninety nine today across the board. How fabulous is that? Come on in um, and get through. Nearly twenty percent's gone already. I predict these are going to sell out. Um, we want to see more cards like this, please, uh, Mark. Let's have a little watch. What are you going to do for us today? I'm going to do something with the beer, I think. Oh, nice. Okay. Okay. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to use the Seeing Star stencil, mm -hmm. and I'm going to get some Distress ink. This is the uh, mustard seed, and I'm just going to go through the stencil to create my background. So again, the Scene Star stencil is really cool, but the nice thing I like about it is it's like having two stencils in one. So we're just gonna blend through the ink through the stencil, and we're just using this lovely bright color, which will work well with our lager, I think. Nice. Or beer, or whichever, yeah. or it could, could be a, you know. Could be a pint of cold cider, couldn't it? Or it could be yeah. a stout, it could be a Guinness, couldn't it? It could, oh yeah, yeah absolutely. So. Oh, no, I like a Guinness. Laura, Laura's not a fan of... No? no. There's, a, there's a new one as well by Brewdog, which is a, um, called, what do, called Black Gold, I think, which is... Oh. They said it's a bit like Guinness, but lighter. So, oh, OK. Yeah, it's quite... Oh, yes. My granny used to love good. Guinness. It was her favourite. She used to have a little <laughs> glass of Guinness. Right, so we'll leave that now, and we'll just reveal this. So this is how we create our background, which is a lovely mild background oh, and the like next it. thing we want to do is we're going to do some stamping so I'll just put this here for a second mm -hmm. and I've got my beer glass now there's a different ways that you can ink this up to create a kind of realistic beer mm. now what I want to do so, cool, isn't it? so the first thing I want to do is I'm going to use three different colors mm -hmm. which is you know it's not normal but this is I'm using versifying clay ink so I'm going to first color I've got to go over is with um, I think it's called morning can you read that Oh, it's called Joyful. Ah, oh, and it is Joyful, isn't it? <laughs> it's Gorgeous, a great colour. So I'm just going to stamp that first time. Did you hear that as well? Dan's just said apparently, like racing horses, the really big horses, they don't get enough iron. And so they get given a pint of Guinness every day. No. Is that right? Is that really right? Gosh. So the next colour I'm going to go in with, so I'm, I'm trying to create that kind of lager look, that, that mm. kind of beer, that real kind of beer glass look. Mm. So the next thing I'm going to do is get my distress tool and just go over it with a little bit of orange. Nice. Not too well, much. Well, look this. You're layering it up almost like you're doing a yes. woodblock or a yes. lino. That's right. And, you know, sometimes people do this with, with like, multi-stamps. They'd have, like, three different stamps to create the one, the one design. So now we're going in with a slightly darker colour. And we'll finish that off with the third colour, which is a brown. Mm. And this brown, we're just going to be very light with that. And it's just going to go more around the edges. Yeah, this is very clever. We're all, yeah, shading with stamps. Yes. This is really brilliant, really novel. And we'll just mm. go over that. And that's how you start to get the real kind of beer colour. Wow. It also gives it a lot of depth as well, doesn't it? Wow. So, so that's how you get that colour. Now, all wow. you need to do is clear emboss that, and then you will have something like this. I'll show you one I've that already done. Great. Just move that to one side. Mm -hmm. So the one I've done yeah. is this one here. Let me just show you. So this is what it looks like when you've finished oh, it. Oh, my goodness. Now, the only difference with this one is that on the top, I don't know whether you can zoom in there. Yes, that's so brilliant. If you can that see that close. Stuff. That's the fluffy stuff, yeah. So lots of people have got this kind of fluffy stuff, but look how cool that oh, looks. Now, great. I haven't... This is just clear embossed. Now, I haven't used glossy accents, but you could go over that with glossy accents mm. if you wanted to create something, like, really gorgeous. So that's how you create the beer. I think that's beer. really gorgeous, though, as well. <laughs> Thank you. you. Know? I mean, it's lovely. So the next really thing we want to do is we're going to create our background. So I'll get my background that I've just inked. Um, just peel this off. There you go. Oh. And we shall place that down right way up. Not doing an Australian card today. <laughs> just line that up. So there's our background. Now I've also uh, inked, and sorry, I inked in black and then just coloured in one of the oh, beer bottles. Lovely. Very easy to do. Oh. So, uh, and there's, on, I think on my YouTube channel, you can find how to do that, that okay. way, the way I coloured it in anyway. Yeah, because it looks so real. Is that with alcohol markers? That's just with alcohol good? markers, yeah. Just yeah. basically you go in with maybe two or three colours and it's a really easy process yeah. to do. It's not hard at all. Brilliant. So, um, I need to give a little bit of a stock update. So um, 
yeah, half, half, once everyone's checked out, over half the stock is gone. We've still got a lot of people just picking up the phone. We're only 15 minutes oh, wow. into the hour. <laughs> um, so it's one of those things, I know that you love to sit and watch the demo and just sit back, but if you check out, then you can relax and you can watch. We've got more demos coming up in the hour as well. I'd hate you to miss it. Um, so please do make sure you're checking out um, as you go along, okay? So um, this is the... This is just the, uh, the 3D uh, gl glue gel. That's it. Lovely. So I'm just using that on there to give it that raised look on How your card. How long does that take to dry, Matt? Probably about an hour. Okay. Yeah, it's not, not too, too low. It's, it's, it's weightable, isn't it? Yeah. So I'm just deciding on where I'm going to place that. Again, it's great to you can wiggle it around and move it around yeah. up into the time until it's dry. So the next one I'm going to get is the, um, the bottle. Very easy to do. Sad. Now, I prefer using this stuff to uh, the phone pads but I know lots of people use phone pads that's good you know yeah so you could um, use both you could you use either or in, yeah entirely whatever you're more comfortable with or what you're used to or yeah. what, what you've actually got it's nice to combine so just but you definitely want to elevate it don't you just give yes it just little... to give it that raised look yeah well that drop shadow looks fantastic as now, well yeah it? again that's now that's looking really nice but we're going to put a sentiment on there we're not finished yet now what i could have done was with the with the family definition sentiments mm -hmm. we've got things like brother and son but i've actually used one of the other ones which is father oh i love this so which is a great definition so that's that's brilliant i'm glad you've just talked about this <laughs> because today these are back in stock they sold out very, very, very quickly last time they came to air. And we do have them back in stock today, so we'll be visiting them. Are they on the web at the moment, Laura, if anyone wants to go and... Um, they are... Oh, have... OK, people have already started shopping before we've even mentioned <laughs> them. Um, so we will get to them after the demo, OK? So, yeah, the, so the, you've got six different definitions. Mm -hmm. Obviously, most of the family in there. Um, but I thought this one here, because it says father... Well, I'm having one of those moments just thinking of saying that now. Protector, provider, taxi driver, yeah. giver of great hugs, DIY expert, so, spider catcher, teller no. of bad jokes, unique dancer and hero. I love that. Uh, that's good. It's a great... It's really each of them, you know, Helen wrote all, all, the, all the sentiments out. Mm. So, you know, I think they're very original yeah. and, and, and heartfelt, you know? Really lovely. It does actually give you a little bit of a lump in your <laughs> yeah. throat, doesn't it? They're beautiful. So, and also, did, I think it did a little something inside as well, because obviously... Doing the front of the card is only half of a job. So I did it on the inside. I've already done that for you. So again, you could have taken this to the outside if you wanted to. So on the inside, oh. we have this. So I've used the bottom part of the stencil. And oh, then I've yeah. put two bottles in there. And then obviously with the, oh, with, the, with the bottle cap as well. And the best beers are the ones we drink with friends. It's just fantastic, isn't it? That's gorgeous. What a beautiful, beautiful card. Um, and you can have a go at doing it yourself. I think just... Whatever you're doing, you want to get this collection home. It's so fun. It's so bright. It can be so many different things, depending on how you colour yes. it, depending on how you work with it. That card, though, look at it. It's so clean and crisp. And then that lovely drop shadow from the mm -hmm. glass in the bottom yes. as well. It's, again, just so professional. So, I mean, you make to sell, and everyone can do that, can't yeah, they, Of Mark? course, certainly. I mean, you know, I personally like having the things like putting the foam on top of the, on, on the, on the glass. It, it, it just finishes it off. It does, yeah. and it gives it that kind of tactile element as yes, well, doesn't it? Yeah. You want to touch it. You say, when you give it to somebody, yeah. they're going to open it and just have that real wow mm. moment. And, I mean, and you've got these things like... Um, just putting a little bit of white, a white pen on there and just rubbing it with your finger just to oh, take yeah. the sharpness off the white pen and that gives you the highlights on your glass as well. It's just, it's incredible, isn't it? I mean, it does, it looks real. It is fantastic and just, do you know what, this is one element of it as well. Now, half the stock of this has gone. Keep on checking out. We're going to revisit, okay, but let's bring you that gorgeous star stencil that you just brought us mm -hmm. as well. Because we've got... Well, Laura and I checked this quite a few times upstairs. Um, we had to ask you, because so, the same thing you're making on this is, is ridiculous, actually. How much, is, how much is it? Well, I don't know. Do you want me to say or do you want me to... I don't know. I, don't, I haven't got a mattress here to fall down. <laughs> do you want me to show you on here? Go on. And you can, you can tell me if you think this is right or not. I'm not going to say it out loud, just in case I am wrong. Do you know what? I think that is... I think I heard that upstairs. That's right. It is right. It is right. It's crazy, but it's right. <sighs> Okay, shall we just do it? You're flying in for this already. You want it anyway? We could say, what is it? Fourteen ninety nine? That'd be great, wouldn't it? Oh, three ninety nine! It's wow. just brilliant. Um, such a fabulous, fabulous stencil. I'm going to show you the card that you've just made with it again, so you can see 
how you can use that as a wonderful background. And then we've got some more samples here as well, just to see how you can use it completely differently. Cake is always a good idea. Absolutely agree. I mean, that works brilliantly with birthdays, doesn't it? It does, doesn't it? And again, how you can use it completely different. It's so fabulous. You know, this is a brilliant, brilliant stencil for 3 99 You've absolutely got to come and get it. And then this part, of course, is on the inside. And um, you can see there as well. And actually, that could be, do you know, it occurs to me, you could use that as kind of like a checkerboard for a racing theme. You know, like Yes, you could, like cars. Or, yeah, yes. yep. absolutely. Um, if you've got James's collection earlier on, you could team it with that. Maybe Gary, Alison, Hilio, we've got Lisa and Sue, Michelle, Jane. Laura is in Arizona. Karen is here. Hello. Ruby's in Glasgow. We are posting to America as well um, with a visible image. It's just $12.95 for the entire day posting packaging, which is incredible. I sent my brother in Singapore a tiny little thing. Um, and it was £16 to post that, oh, 15 or £16. Pounds. Postage these days is crazy. It though, is, it? it's not here at Hobby Maker. It's no. absolutely brilliant. So come on in and take advantage of the saving you're making today and take advantage of that one P&P as well. Um, we have, right, we've got more stencils coming up, okay? We've got to bring those fabulous um, family sentiments. These stamps are just brilliant. I think um, they're on the pack shop. They are, aren't they? Yes. They're all here. For, thank you. <laughs> Thanks, Mark. They're all here. Um, as Mark's just said, Helen... Just, do you know what? For anyone who doesn't what? know about Visible Image as yes. well, Mark, just explain, because you and Helen, obviously, um, partnership for many years, yes. married, kids... Married. Um, yes. and, and you both have a massive sort of amount of passion for what you do. Oh, so definitely. I mean, the thing is that, you know, it's the design for me, mm -hmm. and then Helen is the wordsmith. She comes up with all the words, all the, you know, and sometimes she comes up with words and then asks me to create something to go with it. So it, it works both ways. Yeah, it, it's fantastic, and it works so well together. It's the most perfect collaboration, and it's why we're so excited to have Visible Image here with us at Hobby Maker. You know, it's just yeah. perfect. Now, they're currently £35.94, um, so that's 5 99 each. You've got father, you've got son. We'll read these out for you as well, because they are just really lovely. I mean, this is it. Helen's taken such care yeah. thinking about this. They yeah. are very meaningful. <laughs> um, brother, I've got three of these. Um, often annoying, can be noisy, tell embarrassing stories. They certainly do. Always have your back. Part-time superhero and a friend for life. Oh, that's, yeah, that does, it gets you. <laughs> Um, it's really lovely that, isn't it? It's just gorgeous. You've yeah. got that for sister um, as well, son, mischievous, fearless, adventurer, can be messy, brave, funny, loyal, handsome, charming, protective, always there for you as well. Um, you've got, I, I honestly do feel a bit choked up reading <laughs> through them. They're such beautiful sentiments, these. They are really lovely. Yeah. I've never seen anything like it anywhere else either. You I know. think it's probably why they, they were such a good seller and people mm. just just love them and that was it. Oh, they, that's the thing. Everybody watching, everyone, everyone who, um, who wants, if you're making to sell, these are really going to stand yeah. out. But also making personal cards for your yeah. own family, you know, they all, they just touch that sure, little nerve. Yeah. They're really beautiful. Um, we're going to get a clock on screen. Um, we're not stopping at 35.94. People are already checking out. Well done to each and every one of you. Trust us when we say it's going to go. These have sold out before on Hobby Maker. They are incredibly popular for very, very, very good reason. It's taken us two months to bring them back to you after their first launch and their first outing here. They sold out. Um, we are about to do something sensational for you um, with the saving today, and they're worth absolutely every single penny at thirty-five pounds and ninety-four pence. It's huge. Um, Laura, I can tell Laura's excited. She's she's holding her breath. No way! Wow. That that sounds that's... unlike a. Hold on a minute. Is that that's not meant to be happening? <laughs> kind of. A, oh, okay. That, that's like, well, yeah, that's amazing. <laughs> that is amazing. It is absolutely superb. Um, ten percent of a huge stock has already gone, okay? Um, you need to be dialing right now. These are going to sell out. Kate, Michelle, Annette, Wendy, Trudy, Judy, well done, Alison, Tina and Debbie. Baskets on the web and on the app have gone absolutely berserk here today. Um, it's just amazing. Shall we read through some of the others for you as well so you can see them all? We've read son, we've read brother. Um, have a little look at this. Which one would you like to read? We've read father. What about, read uh, what about sister? Sister. Oh yeah. Let's have a little read. What does it say? She knows your story. 
keeper of secrets, a good listener, gives great advice. Oh, not sure. Sometimes. Personal stylist <laughs> and forever friend. I mean, isn't that just gorgeous? Yeah. Um, you've got daughter there as well. Adorable, determined, challenging beautiful she lights up your world oh i am i'm gonna get oh. all <laughs> thinking about little hazel oh. there you have to meet the others <laughs> <laughs> a little one did you finish it off a little girl who oh, grows yeah. up to be your best friend it's lovely That's amazing, isn't it? yeah it's gorgeous i know i'm such a baby <laughs> oh dear there we go <laughs> Levi's looking at me like she's <laughs> crazy. Um, really beautiful. But this is the thing they do, they touch a nerve. Yeah. They're gorgeous. Right, you've got to read the other one now. <laughs> There's one last. Oh, I won't get through it. Yeah. Selfless, <laughs> loves unconditionally, creator of precious memories, multitasker, oh, yeah. shoulders to cry on, she makes everything okay. Oh, they're lovely. Oh, <laughs> Dan, did you hear him? You haven't got a tour. Have you got a tour back in? Dan no. just said, my mother's not a multitasker. <laughs> she can't do anything more than one thing at a time. Now, now, Dan. Um, Karis, Karen, well done, Gillian. Right, 20% um, is now gone. Listen, if it's in your basket, you've got to check it out. This is happening very, very quickly. It's an amazing collection. And actually, what's beautiful about these is the simplicity. That yes. can go on a card just as it is. That could go on, um, you know, your favourite photograph of you and your brother or you and your mum or you and your dad or, oh, definitely. you know, or the whole yeah. family together. You could even put all the definitions on the bottom together. I mean, you can create things you know. like um, bookmarks as oh, well. Yeah, you know, bookmarks are great. that's a great idea. Yes. Yeah. Oh, my goodness, what a brilliant sort of batchmaking yes. production. You could do loads of bookmarks. They'd fly out the door. Gifting at Christmas and on your craft stall as well. People are going to be going for those, like hotcakes. Mm. Absolutely amazing. Uh, Martin, John, Vicky's there. Glennis is there. Elizabeth. Loads and loads of you are coming through. Um, listen, I think we want to see more inspiration, Mark. <laughs> right, um, OK. Beautiful, beautiful collection. Here we right. go. Let's have a look. What are you going to make for us this time? Um, I think we'll do something with gin. Oh, yeah. We'll do something with gin. Fabulous. Some You've seen those gin lollipops as well you can make? You know when you, no. make, you, know when you, you know when you're a kid and you do your orange juice in the freezer? Yes, yeah. Gin and tonic. It's freeze ah. it. <laughs> That's not like great. a frozen, a frozen, <laughs> is that like a frozen, you know, cocktail thing? Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, be good. Oh, you could do a. Oh, then you could make it like a slushy, couldn't you? You could crush it all up. Oh wow! <laughs> I know. Tell you. <laughs> right, I'm going to use. Um, I'm going to do something with gin, and the first thing I'm going to do is create my background. Make sure I've got the right way up. And I'm going to use the Echo stencil. Oh, this I, is great. This is another great stencil, which is, you know, it's cool, but people love it because it's different and it works. Being ge geometric, it works with most kind of organic kind of ideas be that you create. Yeah. It's um, really fabulous, isn't it? Yes. So the go. first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to get my picked raspberry and I'm going to get my... What have I lost now? Um, where did I put that now? I've lost something. Never mind. We'll just, we'll just improvise. So, oh, there we go. We'll use this one. My picked raspberry and I'm going to go in with a blender and I'm just going to blend through and create uh, some kind of dramatic background. Mm, that's Nothing, a great colour. I love I love pick raspberry. It's it's one of my go-to colours, you know. That um, but I go through phases as well. I do I do kind of brights all the time, and then I do love a bit of monochromatic as well, you know. Yeah. That kind of black and white, just a pop of colour. That's beautiful. Do you know what we've just done with this, Mark? Uh, Laura's popped it on screen, and we've matched the price of the um, star stencil there as well. So it's just three ninety nine. No. Yeah. So Lovely. this is where you can just, just follow the stencil around, just creating the depth that you're looking for in this. You don't have to be too hard or too soft with it. Just take your time. And again, I'm going freehand here. I'm just holding it with my hand. I could have taped it down, but we're just going for it today. Yeah, So nice. we're just gonna create a lovely background here. Beautiful. I mean, you could, there's nothing to stop you using these stencils on home decor pieces as well, is there? No. On furniture and things like that. So, Look again, that. this is a gorgeous background. Again, you don't want it too much in your face because it is a background and mm. you, want, you want your card to be, you know, any, anything that you place on top to be the focal point yeah. of, of your card. Do you know what that looks like? You know when you sort of drop a pebble in water? Like ripples, like yes. Ripples. That would work so you could have, yeah. have that as like maybe dragonflies on there. Oh, that's a nice but, idea. Yeah, it would be a lovely yeah. idea, wouldn't it? Mm. Beautiful. So the next thing I'm going to do is I've already got my card blank and I've actually just repeated that on the bottom here. I did this earlier because I thought um, if I'm putting the sentiment here, I don't want it to be looking plain and white. So mm. I've already created that part. So let me just stick this to my card. Mm. 
How is it? Is that done with a glitter glue? Yes, some, I've all of yeah. I've just gone over with a pink card uh, with some glitter glue because I wanted to really kind of bling it up. Really. Yeah. I do like to bling it up now and again as well. Nice. I like I like a bit of glitter. You can't Absolutely. go wrong. Absolutely. So now we have our kind of card. Um, blank and next thing we'll do is we should really do um, we could go in with stamping now What I wanted to show you is um, the gin now. This is how it looks Let me just kind of wiggle that like that, Look at that. So this has just been stamped and colored in with your alcohol pen really easy to do and then all you do is Either use your glossy highlights or your glossy accents mm -hmm. over the top and that is how you create this lovely three-dimensional look to your... Looks so fabulous. Yeah. Do you know what I love about your stamps as well, Mark? Mm -hmm. Is you can see, you know, you can see your drawings, you can see that artistry. And that we like to put as much detail... We, we, like, we like things that look like they're very detailed. Yeah. Um, and, you know, if we can bring you something that looks amazing, that's even better. But they all look amazing. I mean, that's what you do. This is what we love about Visible Image. It's just every single stamp you work with, it you get that fabulous hand-drawn element. And actually, because not everyone is confident at drawing and not everybody is confident and, and a, you're a very skilled draftsman, you know, you, you're able to get that beautiful detail mm. and it gives us the ability to make cards with that gorgeous element, it's lovely. So again, now I'm complementing the pink with this lovely kind of like, um, like bluey uh, turquoise there for the, for the gin, which looks amazing. Mm. Um, and then also, I've already got my, coloured in my gin my gin glass. I can't remember what you call those. Is it co uh, Copic? Co Copic glass? I can't cope. Um, are they big? Um, are they fishbowl glasses? Or I don't know. I think actually. there's a proper name for them. Is there? Is, I think it's. Is it a copa? Co copa. Is it a copa glass? I have no idea. <sighs> I don't know. It's just a really nice glass. <laughs> <laughs> big glass, it's a please nice for me. Big glass. That's what we like. <laughs> What was your first legal drink, Mark? That's what oh, they're talking about in the gallery right now. Is that now. right? Legal? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Illegal would have been <laughs> cider, I would have thought. No, actually, no, or tell a lie. 2020. No, I, oh, I remember. Do they still say that? No, I don't think they do anymore. No. But that was. Uh, do you know, um, I think the first illegal drink I had when, was um, pinching some um, wine from my dad's. Because uh, my father used to make wine. Oh, did he? Yeah, yeah. So he had a oh, whole. Wow. And he, he didn't drink that much of it, but mm. um, he. Um, yeah, so he, he he made loads of wine, and he had, when I was a child, I was like going in the forest, like putting sap, getting sap from um, elderflower tree, trees and that bushes and that. Wow. Um, but yeah, he um, so anyway, he used to make wine and then put it in the sh in, in the shed. Yeah. And I did pinch a bottle of wine. Oh. And I drank up. it, and I was so oh, dear, <laughs> seriously ill. Okay. So that's I won't it, do that again. It? You're right, by the way. It's a copa glass. <laughs> it is a copa glass. All oh, right. Copa okay. Glass. Thank, thank you to the alcoholics in the gallery. <laughs> <laughs> right, so, yeah. so next thing I'm going to do is, I think I'm going to have a slice of lemon there as well. I think that'll just add that. Gorgeous. It's like this, that thing when, I'm a, when they say, do you want lemon or lime? And I always say both. I'm a bit of a lemon, lemon and a lime fiend. Oh, right, okay. Yeah, is that allowed? Or am I just greedy? Do, do they normally have, they normally have one or the other, don't they? Do yeah, sometimes. Or a, bit, or a slash. I mean, the lovely thing is this as well. You could colour them pink and have pink grapefruit. You could ah, yes, green you could. And make yes, of course you could. Yes. Or orange. You could make them orange as well. So what I've also done is I've done a sentiment, mm -hmm. which is I've done sister. Ah. Because I know that my sister-in-law loves gin. <laughs> so uh, this will be for her. Ah, lovely. So we're just going to finish that off. Great. This is it. I mean, you're combining... Obviously, demonstrating for us here, but also um, making your cards sorted <laughs> for the rest of the. Sorted well, you've for got June, yeah, you've got plenty, plenty of ideas, and this is, I think it's great to be able to share ideas with people. Yeah. That's it. Well, this is. I was going to ask you actually because this is something that's really wonderful. A lot of artists can be quite precious about their work. They want to guard it. They want to keep it, and it's sort of. But, but you've you're clearly an incredible artist, and you're sharing your you've work. Got, with yeah, everybody. you've got it. You've got to. Sh you've, I think you've got to share. If you don't share, then then what's the, what's the point? What's the point of giving ideas to people? What are you going to pass on to anybody? Yeah. It's, it's got to be sharing. So I think that's great. Yeah. It is. So I've got this lovely card now. I think that's I'm just fabulous. about done. I think I'm done. I might just no. I think we'll, we'll leave it there. I think it's good. I could have put a couple of sequins on there, but it's pretty good as it is. I yeah, think. Yeah, it is. It's that gorgeous. Looks really, really nice. It's fantastic. And inside, we've also done a little something as well. Not much, but. We'll get there. So on the inside, we've got oh. keep your gin up. 
Love and that. And I did the lemon like a smiley face. So obviously, yeah. maybe 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 uh, my sister-in-law is feeling a little bit down. She's actually is probably is feeling a little bit down. Actually, she's just come back from Australia, so she's probably got, oh bless she's you. She's still probably got jet lag. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you definitely need to keep your gin up then, darling. Absolutely. So, so okay. that is our. Second that card. is absolutely amazing. Isn't that wonderful? And you, I bet you're thinking already now, right, I need to do that one for my uncle. Barb, I need to do this one for my dad. I need to yeah. do this one for my... I mean, it's just amazing. It's such a gorgeous collection. Um, and there's so much inspiration. Mark's got his YouTube channel. You can go and follow along on there as well. Remember, if you have missed the demonstrations today, by the way, don't forget you can re-watch these um, for seven days on the Hobby Maker website. And um, after they're finished on the Hobby Maker website, they'll oh, wow. be on our YouTube channel forever. So um, you can definitely keep up with them there. And share your makes. We love... Yes. to see what you make here at Hobby Maker. And we love it so much that we give, every single month, we give um, one of you who shares your makes with us £100 um, into your Hobby Maker account. So if you would like to take part in that, all you have to do is send in your makes to studio at hobbymaker.co.uk. And the next winner is chosen at random and it's going to be announced on air during the 7pm show on Saturday, the 27th of April. And I believe that's going to be Nigel um, that day. So really, really fantastic. Studio at hobbymaker.co.uk. UK because he swapped with me because it's my friend's birthday that day. There we go. That's how I do. Laura, is that how did you know that? It's a long way in advance. Um, right. The drinks bundle here for you is FPX C95. This is absolutely brilliant. When everyone checks out, by the way, I have to let you know we've got five left, Mark. No. Five. Think oh, that's it. We've got five left once everyone's checked out. Please do not leave this in your basket, okay? There's people still dialing through as well. Um, so many of you um, coming in today. It's just been, it's been a really joyful <laughs> day. Um, do you know what I'm gonna do actually? Yes, I'll just show you, just while you get ready for your yep, sure. next demo, just show you um, each of the different sets that you're gonna be getting. So you've got 10 separate items in this, which is absolutely brilliant. So this is your wine. Um, you're going to get your dye with the bottle, the wine glass and the cork. This fabulous spray that you've got here as well. Um, the label, the stamps are just absolutely brilliant. You've even got the little um, wine mark there, you know, that you could, uh, you could place beneath the glass or something. It's beautiful. So that's your wine. Um, you've also got your beer. Um, but we all agree that, you know, you could turn the beer uh, glass. You could make that... Uh, Guinness, that's the one I was looking for. You could make it cider as well. Um, you could also, oh, that's a good idea. Dan's saying you could use the dyes, cut them out of acetate. Um, yes. And use your acetate, use your alcohol markers on top of there as well. It's a really good idea, lovely. Um, he has one occasionally, doesn't he? So, <laughs> <laughs> um, so, really, really fantastic. And, you know, actually, your drinks cans as well, like um, like yes. Leanne did with yes, the gin. Yes, you could, yes. You could do that with your beer cans too. Oh, that'd be amazing. Yeah, there idea. you go. You could do that as well. Um, you've got your cocktails with, I mean, look at the detail in this. I'm going to turn it over on the back so you can see the individual stamps cocktails of course the little umbrella you've got your raspberry your strawberry your little mint leaf there as well the olives the ice cube the cherry the lemon and that could also be a lime it could also be a pink grapefruit or an orange i mean this is the lovely thing every and you've even got oh my gosh you've got your little twizzle stick ah or is that a straw it's it could a straw. be both it could be both there we go yes. you've got a straw you've got a twizzle stick you can put the umbrella in the straw Oh my goodness, everything has been thought about. What a fantastic collection. And there's more. Um, so that is your cocktails. Then you've got your gin, um, which we've just seen being demonstrated as well. You've got ice cubes, you've got the gin bottle. Again, these lovely detailed stamps, which just give you that gorgeous element. Um, you've got open the gin when life gives you lemons. Um, you've got the gin there as well. Keep your gin up, let the drinking be gin. You know, just so many lovely plays on words and fabulous so all of that's there for you as well and I will just show you this again you know we were just saying about cutting from the drinks I love that absolutely fantastic that's a great wedding present yes oh It'd definitely or birthday present or any present um, and you've got the whiskey as well um, maturing well um, really really fantastic and do you know what Mark I've just got to show your card again is that okay yeah sure this is so clever um, oh ha ha Dan just said he's only wearing a shirt he's not got a card again <laughs> Oh dear. One good idea and one good joke every day. <laughs> there we go. Look at that. Is that not just so clever? The older you get, the more I like you. That's fantastic, isn't it? Really superb. Such a clever card. Did you say this is on your YouTube channel? 
Um, um, I don't think that actually one is. Um, oh. I think it was, um, it was, I created that as a mistake. It was a mistake. Oh. It was going to be something completely different. That's some, that's some mistake, <laughs> isn't it? It's brilliant. Thank you. There we go. Bit of serendipity. Love that. OK, we're now over allocated. So please keep checking out. And um, I'm so sorry because you're waiting so patiently. That's okay. We're, we no, really want time. to see your demo, but we're just going to do a quick recap on the family mm -hmm. sentiments yeah, as sure. well because these have been flying out the door. These sold out completely last time they were on air. Um, we have brought a bigger stock today, and a third of that larger stock has now gone. Oh, wow. And we've got a lot still in baskets needing to be checked out as well. Brand new crafters joining us. Welcome to Hobby Maker. Listen, do you know it's really easy to message in? We're live and we're interactive from 1 o'clock till 8 p.m. every single day here on Hobby Maker. Mark's our expert here from Visible Image as well. This is, you know, Mark and Helen create this wonderful collection together. If you've got any questions that you'd like to ask Mark, please do message in. And if you've got any questions at all about joining us at Hobby Maker or about Hobby Maker itself, feel free to message into the studio as well. It's studio at hobbymaker.co.uk. We'll get your messages and we'll do our best to answer them mm -hmm. um, as best we can for you as well. But welcome to the show. Welcome to the family. You know, it's fantastic to have you here. Um, all of these gorgeous sentiments, these beautiful stamps, Come and grab them. I love the bookmark idea with this. Well, I yes. Think it's really good. Um, right. I'm okay. very eager to see this. This is So wine. we're going to talk about wine, aren't we? Um, oh, yes. Now, there's a few things. Obviously, because we've got this wine splash in the glass and we've got mm. a separate glass, is how do you combine them together? Okay. So I want to show you how I personally do it. Um, you can probably do it maybe a different, slightly different way, but this is probably the basic technique of how, how you do okay, it. Okay, perfect. Um, I won't emboss them because I've already got one embossed and... You know, maybe we'll do another embossing session another time. So I'll just Can't show you emboss. exactly how to do it. Boss. <laughs> <laughs> right. So the first thing you want to do is you'll get your wine glass and you will choose some ink. Now, you could use a nice grey ink if you don't want to use black. Um, I've got the black here, so we'll use that so you can see it on camera. Lovely. So ink up your glass or glass. And you will just place your... I'm going old school, not no, um, no stamping platform here now. We're just doing an old school block. So obviously, if you're doing it with a block, obviously, you always keep one hand on the block. Okay. Give it a couple of seconds for that ink to transfer from the stamp to the card. Then we'll take it off. Look at that. So we have a lovely glass. Now, we want to create that lovely splash. Now, I've already done the hard work, so all you've got to do is basically line that splash up with the glass. So I'm going to get myself a different colour ink, so a nice colour red, or it could be, it could be a wine colour, maybe you want a, a nice kind of like a, a golden colour. So I'm going to just ink that up. And then all we need to do is, we need, just need to line up your glass. Now I may have to put my head in the way just for a second, just for, so I can see where Let I'm going with it. Thank right. you. So I'm just going to rotate it until your stays in the glass there. And then we'll just drop it down, just maybe a little bit more again, and then we'll stamp away. Sorry, everybody. It's the great thing about those blocks, though, isn't it? Because you yes. can see. Yes. So, I mean, through. I'm thinking I've got 99.99% .99 of it in. Now and again, you miss stamp, but it's not. When you're going to cut, you've got the dies there to go with it. So, when you cut it out, you're not even going to notice it, honestly. Yeah. So, you just take that off. All good. I mean, if you miss the glass at home, you just and I didn't it miss it there. We got it. We got it there. So that is how you get that. Beautiful. Now, obviously, you don't want that glass to be vertical straight up there. You want it rotate at an angle, like you're you're splashing that glass or giving it a cheer to somebody. So that that's what you wonderful. would do. So you would cut that out. Now, I would use my die cut machine, and I would cut out the glass shape. You don't cut out this piece, and I'll explain why in the next section. Oh. Okay. So the next thing you want to do is. If I move on to my card. So what I've done is I've already stamped my splashes first. Mm -hmm. And I've actually also clear embossed them. <gasps> Look at that. That's so they're nice cool. and shiny. Mm. Okay. Mm -hmm. So the next thing you want to do, as I keep it there for now, we'll come back to exactly what I'm going to do next. First thing I'm going to do, oh, I need to pinch that lava stencil. Uh, there you ah, go. Ah, lava. Yes. Well, I'll let you do that. Thank you. There you go. This is actually mine. This isn't yours. This oh, is mine. <laughs> no, this is mine. You guys didn't have one, so you've had to pinch mine. We've had to pinch yours. There we go. <laughs> so that's fine. <laughs> right, so I'm going to use this lava stencil. I'm just going to move my stamping platform out of the way of a second. Um, we're just going to put this lava stencil over the top. Um, and we're, we're doing well for time, aren't we? We've got great, plenty of time. So have, yeah. I'm just going to line this up and 
Now, this is a great stencil. This is called lava because it reminded me of um, those lava lamps and the 60s oh, lava lamps. Yes, yeah. But I this... always wanted a lava lamp. <laughs> never got one. No, nor did I. I think there was like there were safety issues in the 70s with them, wasn't there? Oh, was there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. I'd probably set houses on fire and all kinds of things <laughs> happening. So better, better off not having them. Right, so, but I like this because it could be, if you want it to be, it could be cowhide. Ah, oh, yeah. Camouflage. That's what, do you know, can I just show you, Rem? Because um, I yes. do love this. I absolutely love this. Um, just, we're just going to have a little momentary interlude because yes. we're going to bring the um, fabulous lava stencil, 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 stencil live <laughs> and we're still going to go to 3 99 um, It's the most limited of all our stencils. Wow. Love that with the snail. That's like seriously slug trails, isn't it? It's fabulous, <laughs> isn't it? I yes. know, it's cool. It could be ectoplasm as well oh, for ghosts. Oh, yeah, well. that's a good idea, isn't it? Yeah, you could do it in like neon. Perfect for Halloween as well, that would, wouldn't it? Yeah. Yes. Oh, it could, absolutely. That's giving me ideas now. Oh, there we go. Do you know what? I forgot, that's actually a card I, I made. I did actually make that, I think. It's fabulous. I know, you've not signed yeah. it though, Mark. I don't, I never yeah. signed my own work. Oh, and look, you had it with your alien as well. <laughs> Last time we were Ah, there, yes. Bam, bam. There we go. So I'm going in with festive berries, and I'm just going in lightly. We don't need to be over, overly heavy on this here. Mm. We're just going to create a slight background. And this is like, I would say this is like a wild party. This is, this is something that's seriously going on. Yeah. Whether, whether it's <laughs> in your house or somebody else's. Yes, uh, is it. There's a lot of wine spillage in yes. this uh, there. <laughs> yeah, and, and it's just great. It's just great to create that kind of background. Sometimes you don't want too much white space. I do love white space because those clean and simple cards are great. Yeah, they but are. Sometimes, cool. sometimes you do like to. Just, oops, we just slid there, but that's fine. Just yeah. go lift it up. We're not happy, and we maybe just slide it back there. I should have taken my card itself down, but it's fine. It's all there good. we go. That's the nice thing with backgrounds, actually, isn't it? It doesn't matter if they're no. not. You know. No, it's not, it hasn't got to be perfect because no. it's not the focus of... There you go, it's done again. I'm stopping now. It's having I'm a done. wild party, yeah. Mark. It's just, you know... It knows... It knows it's had too much had, wine. It's had something. <laughs> <laughs> right, so yeah. I'm going to take that off that now. And I think great. that's pretty good. That's good. We'll, we'll carry on with that. Now, the next thing I want to do... So I've got sticky tape to stick to me. There's ectoplasm, could be. Just blow off that excess. Now, I'm going to just stick this to my card blank and then we'll move on to why those splashes are there. So I'm going to just tape this down. Oh, I missed oh it. Oh my gosh. I know. Right, this is just brilliant. What's that? Is this a double sided tape gun? Oh, this is, yes. This is oh this is mine, goodness. I know. It's a it's heavy it's a heavy duty one. It's like, you know, it's the big so gun. The big guns are out. <laughs> <laughs> the big guns are out. Can we please bring one of those to Hobby Maker if we haven't already? Do you know what? I it's great. Because there's like fifty odd meters on a on a reel. Mm. It's like I use it all the time. Yeah, it's really good. Would you like one? Message in. Yeah. So I'm just going to... Great. Right, so we've we, we got this far. Now, mm -hmm. let's get to the glasses, shall we? So, what I did earlier on mm -hmm. was I stamped the glasses, I clear embossed them, uh, but obviously I stamped the, the, um, the splashes in as well, and then I cut them out with the, the die cut machine using the, uh, using the dies. Mm. So now, all we need to do is we can easily just line these up with where we cut it off. Oh, my gosh like that and that, that is how really and once it's raised as well it's going to look three-dimensional so we'll, we'll stick those down next now of course you could easily if you want to do if you know you could um, put glossy accents on these as well sometimes i do it sometimes i don't it depends on what i want to do really mm, that is just brilliant again very easy so that's the easy way to to line up your splashes that's fabulous such good tips you're getting on the show. <laughs> Love right, it. so let me just put my fingers and we'll just line up there. And that's a good thing about the, the glossy accents. We just line up till it meets. And we just take Gosh, that. It just really gives it that quality, that three dimensional yeah. quality again, doesn't it? Just take off that excess there. Genius. And then we'll do the same with the other one. And I've also got a bottle, of course. Because what's wine without some extra... Well, indeed. Another bottle there, ready for the next time. Laura, have you got popping candy in the gallery? Was that popping candy there? No. No, of course. That was, that was really... It must have been, like, crackling on my, on my talk back. Right, so we just line that up. 
So now it's starting to come together. That now, the bottle I have in clear and both, I put glossy accents on that one. Gosh, look at that. So that so will be the bottle. Again, I, you know, 3D glue gel, lifesaver, yeah, yeah. So we'll put this bottle here. I think that's looking good. Um, and then also we have the wine. So the sentiment that I'm using is wine. Mm -hmm. That fits. <laughs> it's very, very descriptive. Yeah, it is. <laughs> That's perfect for there. See, and I would frame that and put that on the wall in the kitchen. You well. You know, that's the thing. You, you, they're just, yeah, um, for making and selling and for gifting as well. You know, you can really think beyond cards with this collection, yes. can't you? And I think we'll just have the wine cork, something like that, there as well. Every Obviously, card you make every, is a work of art. And you know, I do try and have the, all the elements that you need in a, in the set yeah. as well. So that is our basic card. I did do something inside as well because. So we have wine on the outside. I love and that you do this. Those, see, do you see how good that looks yeah. there like that now? Again, so you pop that in a box frame? Very anyway. subtle, yeah. A very subtle background as well, but it just works. It does. Gorgeous. Really so we have wine on the outside and then on the inside I created... <gasps> what did we have? Oh, look at that. Because being an adult is hard. Now, <laughs> these... Um, ink these wine rings they're in the set as well and the inks the splats as well or the wine splats so they're all in the set oh it's so clever I, I love this collection it's just fantastic we have right um how many do we have left Laura okay um we have six left there are 20 of you with this in your basket I'm just going to say, I'm just going to say exactly what Laura just said to me in my ear, um, in that we were going to try to find more bundle because they're going to sell out. Oh. Um, the, the stock on the singles, the stock on the individuals is too limited for us to be able to do that. So uh. we can't make more bundles. This is what we have. And we have tried. Laura's had the conversation with Liam upstairs. You know, we'll always try, um, but we cannot make more bundles. So... We will put all the individuals on the web, so you're welcome to go and get individuals. But for the big bundle where you're making the biggest saving, £34.99 to get the whole collection home, um, it's just fantastic. We've got five left now. So um, look how many people that's, are there. I can't believe it. It's, it's amazing. So thank you, everybody. You know, again, we try and bring you something amazing that you love, that everybody else loves as well. Um, and I try to give you lovely demonstrations as well that give you ideas that you want to do with it. You've absolutely nailed it because you have. I mean, we love your demonstrations, love that we see inside the card as well. It's just always that extra touch, always yeah. that extra element. It's like, it's like having two cards in one, you know, two demonstrations in one. I do try and finish it off for you so that yeah. it just gives you those ideas. That's it. It's perfect. And that's what it's all about, isn't it? About ideas, about inspiration and about making you big, big savings with the collections that you adore. That's what's happening right now on Hobby Maker. So please do make sure you check out. Sorry to those of you who will miss out. As we said, remember, you can go onto the web. Oh, this is lovely, isn't it? Wow. Tell us about who's made this one. That's fabulous. Where is that? Oh, it's on the back here. Oh, my gosh. Look at... Oh, hold on. We've got to have a little pan across here. <laughs> Can we show? Yeah, we're going to have to duck down. They're everywhere. These are fantastic. Do you know what? Oh, yeah, we're going to start there. Let's grab that one, shall we? Oh, here we go. Oh, and then across cool we go. That? Duck, Mark. Duck, that's it. Duck. <laughs> Look at this all the way across. And we've got right the way through maturing well. Cheers. These are just, I mean, you can do all of this. It's so fabulous. Really, really good. Love all the different colours on this one as well. The rainbow of wine here. That's gorgeous. And then it continues. I need to move out of the way now because it comes over here as well. Maturing well when life gives you lemons. Um, you've got your fabulous gin and then time for cocktails. I mean, what a beautiful array of cards that you can be... Oi! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Oh, no. I ruined everything at the end. Of um, just have fun with this collection. Um, do you know what? We've got the Family Sentiments, which are massively popular once again, back in stock today. First time. It's taken two months to bring these back, OK? Um, and that's down to, I mean, the quality that yeah. you use. Tell us about that, because obviously Helen's put a lot of thought into the mm -hmm. wording here, into the sentiments, and, and just that really emotive... And Yes, I mean, you, you, you know yourself, you, you read them out and they're, they're going to hit that heartstring. Yeah, they really do. You know, there's six different ones there. One of them will go, oh, yeah. yes, got to have it. Yeah. And at the end of the day, 
you know, it's like buying, I always say the same thing. Back to the Future. If you're going to, why have what buy just to have watched the first one and not the other two? You need to watch. <laughs> so I would have if you why have one when you could have all of them. Dan's not watched any of them. <laughs> Seriously. Direct to Dan. Oh my gosh, Laura, have you not watched them either? He, she's watched the first one, but she's not watched the others. Come on, what, Levi's shaking point? his head as well. Have you not seen them? You've seen them. Hey, oh, good. Well you're done. shaking. <laughs> uh, you're shaking your head in disapproval of Dan and Laura. See. Yeah, great films, great films. Um, check them out. Listen, again, loads of you have already checked out. Well done. Loads of you, brand new customers as well, joining us today at Hobby Malcolm. Welcome yeah. to each and every one of you. It's fabulous to have you here. Um, and if you haven't yet checked out, just do make sure Deborah, Lorraine, Kath, Sandra, Michelle, Jackie, Beverly. Um, now, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to show you our website because um, we've got a lot of limited stock on here now, okay? And we don't want you to miss out. So those stencils, which are 3 99 each okay here's all your individual um stamp and die collections you've got your dies you've got your stamps they're all there as individuals um go and grab them here's the stencils these are really limited now wow. okay um so we've got the lava we've got the echoes and we've got that beautiful stars um there as well the star seeing stencil stars. um seeing stars thank you my darling really lovely 3.99 each which is just phenomenal and of course the big bundle um which is there for you big big saving to be had there as well so do make sure you're checking out and of course you've got your gorgeous sentiments here as well for just 19.99 for all six of them which is superb yeah. um you're back on later aren't you i am with something completely different <gasps> yes that's going to be another sellout i think i predict um you want to watch that seven o'clock yeah <laughs> definitely seven o'clock mark will be back with visible image and more fabulous demonstrations and more wonderful wonderful products for you right now we're going to skip back over to the other side of the studio and um, where debbie fisher is back with us with more from crafters companion so don't go anywhere because there's more to come Shopping with Hobbymaker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.hobbymaker.co.uk where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your craft room essentials to paper, tools, cutting machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Hobbymaker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Hobbymaker. Alternatively, you can call our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Hobbymaker. Here at Hobbymaker, we only charge one PMP throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and checkout and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the Combine Order button. Shopping made easy at Hobbymaker. Our UK-based call centre is always on hand to assist you 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Every day our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and we feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to crafting or a seasoned pro, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 1pm to 8pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. proud to work alongside some of the biggest brands in the industry. Keep watching for these brands and many more here on Hobbymaker.
Oh my goodness me, what a day we've been having here at Hobby Maker. Thanks for all your messages. Thanks for being part of the show today. And if you're just joining us, oh my goodness, you are in for a real treat because there is so much more still to come. We're here with wonderful Debbie Fisher. How about uh, gorgeous? Hello, you? back again. I've had my hour. You had uh, your breather. Well, literally, <laughs> I just unset and reset back up. So uh, it's been so busy today. So uh, I'm glad you're loving all the dyes. Uh, and we've got some no another nice set of dyes oh, here. Yes. Well, certainly very, have very pretty ones this, this is really pretty yes. and I, I mean do you know I, I watched this when it yeah. launched the yes, other day I, I was watching from the green room yes. and I was just like oh this is really these really are lovely because what these are they offer us a smaller die but a really sort of pretty die that when you cut it into something it has that liftable elements about it which are so absolutely gorgeous yeah. and it means you could get really creative so if you've got ink pads if you've got paints whatever yeah. you've got mediums you can then cut it into them which is going to be amazing nice. it's just gorgeous and um, we're going to bring the graphics in for you okay um and this is the value 102 pounds 87 uh, debbie's going to talk you through show you the board show you exactly what we're getting all of this by the way i mean it's there's such a vast amount that you're getting here all of the dies, the tape runners as well, the cardstock, the papers. I mean, it is an absolutely jam-packed collection. It's phenomenal. And if you add all of this up together, £102.87 is what it should be. That is not what you're going to be paying here today oh, on yeah. Hobby Maker. Um, so do make sure you're dining through early. Remember, every single one of you um, will get the best deal. You will get the best saving no matter when you come through. Now, you're going to get six different die sets in here. Um, you've got your all-purpose cardstock, isn't it? Yes, you um, have, Debbie. Yeah, which is amazing. 60 sheets of that. Um, you're going to be getting this fabulous rose gold 12 by 12 um, paper pad. I mean, that's £20 just all by itself. That's a luxury it? card. You've got pearlised papers and you've got glitter cardstock in there, 12 by 12. And that doesn't shed, does it? The no, non-shed, 250 Perfect. GSM. Yeah, great yeah. for your die cuts. Really, really fantastic. Um, you've got your tape runners in here as well. Is it two tape runners you're getting? Um, you're getting the straight and you're getting the dotty, okay? Um, and, of course, you're getting your pokey tools is there. You're getting your low-tack tape. Um, you're getting your beautiful shine spray. You've got so much in here that, genuinely, it's just absolutely phenomenal. Jam-packed. And you've got everything you need as well to get started, really, with all these dyes. We will have the Gemini on the show for you. That's coming up. So if you are looking to get your Gemini 2 today, that's, that's coming up for you. But listen, let's get a clock on screen. This is a big saving you're going to be making today. And you're going to absolutely love um, working with it. Do, shall I just show a couple of the examples, yeah, Debbie, so you can see yeah, through? Yeah, the samples really um, show how beautiful they, they look. Do. I mean, look at it. It's almost, it's so pretty. They're so delicate, but they can also be quite bold and vibrant if you want them to. Absolutely. Um, uh, they're great panel dies as well. So even though we've got them in one die, you could use these multiple times on oh, a project. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Look at this as well. Oh, hold on a minute. Butterfingers. There we are. It's an easel. Oh, it's an easel. Card. There we yeah. are. I'm looking at it upside down. There we go. Um, with your beautiful dragonflies as well. Isn't that gorgeous? And you get that lovely... Oh, wow. Look at that moment. price. My word. 69.99. And, Debbie... Oh, it's on a three-way split no. pay. Um, that's wow. Phenomenal. That's 23, amazing. That is, isn't it? Yeah, I love a split pay. Oh, <laughs> very, very good. £23.33, and, £33, and you're going to get all of this home straight away. Um, think about the making of Sally going to be able to do with this, the bookmarks you can make, the beautiful gift cards you can make as well. Um, really, and actually really beautiful artwork as well for the walls. There's so know? much you can do with this. And the great thing about them is the um, they may be sort of simple, but the placement of them is just going to make your creations look incredible. Oh. So this is the basis of the die. So you literally die cut this die into anything and it cuts them in, but it just allows you to pop the smaller pieces is out now we've just done this on oh. your black and white cardstock but even your butterflies here look the wings <gasps> actually come up there you can so, put little messages underneath you the wings, could do that you? i little... love that yes absolutely love the heart design and you've got three different die cuts of hearts in this one that you can bring out to move around so i think that's a really beautiful oh, one so to have lovely. absolutely love it we've just done these in black just to show you the concept then we've got the star one the star one is brilliant because i mean obviously stars represent so 
so many things, whether you've passed your driving test, your uh, graduation, you've got exams coming up. Uh, Dragonfly is always oh. a great one to have Gorgeous. as well. And then there's another floral one in that collection as well. So Can I show you this to go with that floral one? Because that is, I mean, it? it's so beautiful. And again, when you make a card of this collection, it just looks so professional. Look at that absolutely divine and you know you can use different colors mm -hmm. you can use different papers absolutely. you can use oh i'll show you the butterflies as well with this gorgeous gatefold card how stunning is this so you can really go bright and bold you can go really subtle um or of course you could go completely monochrome that's the lovely thing about it you've just got so many different styles that you can work with um it is completely and utterly uh, gorgeous really really lovely come on in now you've got um free number there for you to be dialing through of course Oh, 800 1433 10% of the stock has already gone. So, I mean, this is really popular. We're literally six minutes into the show and 10% is already sold out. So, massive congratulations to each of you there. Um, if you haven't yet popped it in your basket, come on through. Um, it's just fantastic. And remember, with this today, 69.99, both of your tape pens, yes. the dotty mm. and the straight. Yep, the amazing ones. Which colour shimmer spray are you going to be? Um, it's the one that's in the bundle. So, it's the Firelight Sparkle. That's, that is gorgeous. It is color, isn't really it? gorgeous. Yeah, really gorgeous. Fabulous. Color. Absolutely stunning. You're getting your rose gold um, pad there as well, 250 GSM. And that is really fabulous. That's like raspberry ripple. I know, sort of, it's so ooh, nice. So juicy. Nice. Um, just to give you a little bit of a heads up as well, if you love the shimmer sprays, who doesn't? Yeah, exactly. We do have a really fabulous bundle coming your way in this hour as well, which is really really cheeky deal coming your way on that as well um but my goodness me come on in now let's see what you're going to do absolutely Debbie, let's start with that shimmer spray because it's super easy to use um and there's different sort of uh, ways to use a shimmer spray uh, i'm hoping to get a couple of demos in to show you two different ways so we're just going to spritz this one um now i'm just going to use what i would recommend is cutting up an old box okay. because your shimmer spray is sort of squirt in all sorts of directions okay so just like so if i just show that card there and I'm just going to spray away. You can see, oh, oh, mine's, oh my. <laughs> mine's come out quite blotchy there. So all that means, the mica in here, can you see, I've just literally put it on there and you get that um, gold shimmer through Oh, there. yeah. Um, so what's happened there is it just needs to be, I need to rinse that through. Okay. So that's all you're going to do. So that happens with my hairspray too. Uh, happens yeah, with Yeah, absolutely. So I'm going to put a bit more on there and mm -hmm. you'll see that beautiful gold. And then I'm going to enhance it actually with um, the gold dust as well. So the gold dust is beautiful. So just pop that on there as well. Mm. Now, once you've done that, I better clean up. I'm going to get told off. Look, I've got shimmer spray everywhere. Literally. <laughs> oh, it's fun, fun though, isn't it? There yeah. we go. Look, all done. All done. We're all cleared up. Now, what I would do with that is use your heat tool and start to dry that. You can sort of move it around if you want. You can bring in your paintbrush and you can literally paint with it as well. So oh, it is absolutely nice. amazing. Um, but I have got one that's dry. When it's dry, I've got a couple here, which I just cut. So you'll see all different Ooh. ones that you can get. The shimmer that comes out oh my in gosh. there. I know. Isn't it amazing? Yeah. You get that just intense shimmer on there which is amazing and you can wow. see you get sort of different looks each time that you have it and when it starts to dry when you dry it you get almost like these sort of pooled areas yeah and then the gold really shines through on there so oh, thanks for showing us it dry because it looks completely, looks completely different, different. It? yeah it's completely yeah. different and i'll keep that one till later on because we've got some embossing folders later when that's dry we can then emboss that oh, as well wow so oh, i'm lovely. just going to pop that underneath uh, make sure we clean up that mess there otherwise and so don't let it dry and that's why I say get yourself a box cut out the top and just spray into the box and could you use like a shoe box or something yeah uh, absolutely yeah. shoe box is fine so uh, anything like that um right so once we've got one of those choose which one you want to use let's choose the the one that is um a little bit more um sort of mottled effect there and then we're going to bring in our dye so I'm going to use the butterfly one so that's all you need to do and the reason I've got one already done because I wanted to make sure we had it completely dry before we put it through our die cutting machine because we've got lots of intricate little pieces in this die cut, you want to make sure that your cardstock's really dry. Okay. Which is why I've done that one. So we're literally going to place that onto the side. I'm leaving a little, in fact, I'm going to do it the other way because uh, I'll show you why in a little while. Um, but we're just going to have a border, sort of a similar border going around here. And I'm going to put a piece of ribbon this side, which is why I'm just leaving it a little bit onto there and then we're just going to take some tape and tape that down i'm not sure how 
good that will stick down to be honest but we'll try it i've yeah. got one if it doesn't work <laughs> so let's get our gemini cutting plates and run that one through so simple as that it is just a case of putting your card whatever medium you could use your pattern we had some paper pads earlier in the show um in the one o'clock show you could oh, use yeah. your pattern papers and put them through you don't have to make a, a, a wet background or inky background or painted background you can literally use them on whatever you want to your pattern papers are going to look amazing mm -hmm. and then the only thing i would say to highlight them is to use a darker cardstock behind okay so let's pop those to the side and take that one off so you can see that has die cut beautifully. I'm just going to be really careful taking that off. All these pieces here now will lift up and mm. you can see how well that's die cut. So just on the top there, bring in all those pieces up. Can't get over that shimmer from the yeah, spray. It's beautiful, it's beautiful, isn't it? Mm. Now, because you're losing a little bit of your detail there, that's why you want to bring in a darker cardstock. So I'm okay. just making sure I lift these to start with. Uh -huh. Then let's bring in our darker cardstock and then you'll see a massive difference. Now. <gasps> so now we've got that intense shimmer, but we've got that beautiful design going oh, through there, so which looks amazing. Look how good, gold is yeah. so shimmery, isn't it? Um, now I'm going to use uh, my tacky glue. So I'll put it into a little bottle so um, we can then just put a little piece around uh, these pieces. Because what you don't want to do, you don't want to, to glue down your wings. Uh, so course. we're just going to go around where we're not gluing the wings. So I'm just taking the little glue around in our precision bottles. You, you'll be able to find them on the web. Um, and it's just going round there. And that's why I wanted to make sure that we push them up first so mm. they wouldn't attach to the glue. Ah, okay. So just going round there and then we'll just go around the edges. So it's just tacky glue. Now tacky glue is really good for um, anything that's got a shine on it because it's uh, water-based glue. If you put a solvent base, which is our all-purpose glue yeah. onto this, it could take your shine off. Oh, because really? It's, because it's a solvent glue. Oh. So this is a water, when you've got a water-based glue, you've got no problem then. With, I wouldn't um, have thought of that. That's yeah, cool. so that's why I always, and I always think if you don't know, use tacky glue and you can't go wrong. Yeah. So what I want to do is just try, I'm just touching that so it all take, um, takes, takes down, glues down, and then just making sure that we keep those lifted. Now, a little tip actually, Rosie, is yeah. if you want those wings to stay, stay upwards, yeah. use your um, Kalau 3D glue gel. I'm gonna see if I've got some here, I've got oh, some here. Oh. If you use this one and pop it under your wings, I won't do it till I put my card together. If you put it under there, it dries clear, but it will keep them oh. up. Oh, that's so when really you put it tip. in an envelope, I mean, obviously if you want to post it, then you want to keep it flat and it will flatten okay. down you could tell someone to uh, to pop those little pieces back up now what i am going to do is i've got just a little ribbon to put at the side so we're just going to pop that in and tape it below so let me just grab some oh here we go i'll tape pen so that side so i'm just going to pop some down in fact i'm going to make sure we put some all over here and then we might as well put this to the base of our card. Remember, if you're looking at that tape pan with admiration and thinking, oh, I wish I had one of those, you're going to get one of this bundle. In fact, you're going to get two. You're going to get the dotty and the straight tape pen uh, today, which is brilliant. Yeah, you'll get both of them. The dotty tape pen is amazing. Yeah. It's like, I just think, one of the best inventions that we've had in a long time. It's it so good for your intricate so dyes. So good for intricate dyes, yeah, absolutely. So I've just got some pink cards start. We're just going to mat and layer that over the top there, like so. And then we've just got our card blank to pop that onto. And then all I've got extra on there is uh, a sentiment, which I've put somewhere. And we'll stick those to the front. So let's pop that one on like that. So all we're doing is framing our entire card, putting that little bow into place on there. And then all I've got is uh, from Sarah's birthday box. I, this is one of my most used sentiments. I use it all the time. So we're just going to use this um, 
not, When's Sarah's birthday? The is it, will there be another birthday box on its way? Oh, I don't know. This was, um, she did this for our, um, I say birthday, but it was called Sarah's birthday box. Oh, it was, it was for our, birthday. It was crafter's birthday. Okay. Ah. It, was, it was a couple of years ago. I have a uh, wall with magnets and with magnet sheets on, which I keep all my best love dies on. Ah. And then I can just turn around when I'm crafting and think, oh, I use that. So, and that, so I tend to, terrible for using the same ones, but I love this little die set. And it's just a happy birthday, keeping it nice and simple. And there's our Love first that. card. That is so gorgeous. Look at that. And it just, you know, when a die can do so much in such a short space of time, it's such an instant, beautiful, beautiful yes, reaction, absolutely. isn't it? It's lovely. Yes. Really, really wonderful. Um, you're going to have a go with this. And of course, you've got five other designs in that style to use as well. So it's just absolutely gorgeous. So much you can be doing with this. Um, now, if you would like the die set on their own, um, we do have a brilliant deal there for you with just the six dies. Remember in this bundle, 69.99, the one we just brought on screen, that's got all of your extras as well. It's got the cardstock there. It's got the fabulous 12 by 12 inch pad. It's got the low tech tape. It's got the pokey tools. It's got the shimmer spray. Um, it's got the pokey tools. I mean, it's got it all. It's got everything. So that is superb. But if you just want all six of your dies, that's what we're putting on screen for you right now. We've got a fabulous saving, really, really brilliant. £44.99. Um, hold on a minute. That means everything else that you've got in this collection, you're getting... That's, that's bonkers. It's very good. Bearing in bad the paper pads on its own is £20. That yeah. means basically you're getting everything else for a fiver or something. Wow. Isn't it? It's ridiculous. Um, but listen, if you do just want the dice on their own, here it is, £44.99. Thanks, Dan. Um, really really brilliant saving but I mean that's on a deal in itself um, but my goodness obviously you're making the biggest saving if you go for um, the big bundle that we started the show with now we've got another bundle for you um, you've all been watching eagerly that gorgeous deep seashell pink and this is the one that we've just seen um, Debbie using we've got a bundle for you where you're going to get all of these colours okay this is incredible you're getting um, oh look at this colour celestial map how gorgeous is that? Ooh, let's go. look at this. It's like blue and green. That, I think, is my absolute favourite. It's gorgeous. <laughs> yes, get, get the box to spray these into. A very good suggestion from Debbie. Um, you've also got the golden sunflower, okay? Um, and you've got the gold dust as well. So you can see the difference. This one's more like a sort of vintage gold. And then the sunflower is that bright yellow. Um, you've got the white there as well. You've got the golden heather. Um, you've got the sunset bronze, beautiful summer meadow. Um, oh, royal velvet's rather special. They, these are all gorgeous. Gorgeous. And then that deep seashell pink as well. All of this, okay, so these are your fabulous shimmer sprays. A little goes a long way, right, Debbie? I mean, these are really oh, high pigment, too. Uh, they're really high pigment, yeah. yeah. And the most amazing gold pigment in all of them. So yeah. they will go a long way, yes. Yeah, they last ages, don't they? Yeah, they Just will. Fabulous. Yeah. I'm going to use them in the next demo and show you how to paint with them. And if oh, you do that, they're going to last you for I don't know how long. Mm. Nice. Fantastic. So what you've got here, have I got too many out here? Ah, the celestial map. Here we go. So you're going to get eight colours, okay? Fig. Oh, hold on a minute. The gold or the sunflower? I do apologise. The sunflower. You oh, get the, the sunflower. Gold you dust. don't get. You yes. do get the gold dust. There we go. Whoopsie. Sorry. Here we are. So you're getting seven colours here. Absolutely fantastic. If you add all this together, it's forty-one pounds and ninety-three pence. Okay. Um, but not today. We are going to give you an unbelievable saving here today. Paint with them. Spray with them. Create your backgrounds. And look at your saving today. Twenty-eight ninety-nine. That is phenomenal that's that's just brilliant isn't it really fantastic saving for you there today um what does that work out at that's like four pounds and 20 each or something four pounds and 15 Which pence is so each. good yeah yeah 415 there we go um four pound 15 each Your phenomenal very saving today rosie well do you know that it's two <laughs> mathematical equations i'm rubbish at maths normally so it's a total <laughs> fluke thing, but you know i'll take it i'll take it for today um seven fabulous shimmer sprays all for 28.99 really really fantastic saving and some gorgeous colors as well debbie the yeah really vibrant. lovely colors yeah they're absolutely beautiful and i think because mm. you can do so much with them yeah uh, you're going to love using them absolutely well can we see how to paint with them yes then? let's have a 
it look? Yeah. So I thought let's do something different and die cut these into a box. Oh, so nice. I love making boxes. So what I've done here, if I give you the measurements, I've done this 11 inches by eight and a quarter. Uh, and then I've scored in on my box lid side at two and three quarters all the way round. So what you're going to do then is cut your corners. So here where you, I'm going to put my glasses on so I can see what I'm doing. And then you're going to just cut into the edges. So as you go up, just like this, you're going to take out. Oh, in fact, I'm not going to take the edges out. I'm going to show you why in a second. Ooh, so we're just going to get more and more intriguing. <laughs> <isn't it? laughs> so I like to just turn my box lid around like this. So we're going to just take those pieces and then the next one. So that's given us all of those. Then I'm going to take that amazing floral cluster, which is beautiful. So so, and we're literally just going to pop that into there. So I've worked out that that works beautifully with our actual die. So let's use our low tech tape and tape that down. Now, because I'm taping onto um, my box lid, if your low tech tape gets a bit sticky uh, in your Gemini machine, just put it onto your skin because the oils in your skin will just take ah. off a little bit of the tack and then that way it won't become so sticky. Oh, that's a good tip. So we're going to pop that on there. Now, obviously, although these um, borders will, the dies will work in your Gemini's a, a machine as small as a mini um, if you want to do a concept like this you'll need a bigger um, die cutting machine okay so let's pop that through so it literally is one pass through the machine um, oh I did want to take the uh, I wanted to take some pressure off and I'll show you why in a second because these dies uh, they cut so well that you probably don't need all your shims ah, but okay. actually oh it's okay so sometimes what it might do Rosie it might stretch the fibers of your card ah, okay. so it makes it then warp a little bit so uh, it's still really sticky look it's really stuck into there but it's fine because the edge pieces is what's going to be taped down they're uh, stuck down to make the lid so let's just take that one off and I've got one already so not going to worry about that yeah. so once once you've done that, the reason now what I've also used is um, the some white cardstock. But if you take these and literally decant some of it, Ooh. so literally just put some onto here. You can yeah. see how little you can just about see that on there. Yeah, you don't need a lot. And then let's take some green. So taking all the colours that we've got there. So just putting some of that green on there. I'm not spraying it purely because if you spray it, you'll get a lot of waste. Uh, of so just use it like this and then that way you don't get so much waste. Mm. So just pop that on there. So what we are going to do is take a paintbrush. So I've got our smallest paintbrush. This is our number six. Actually, okay. I don't think it is a smaller one. I think we do a smaller one than that. Uh, I don't need, I do need water to wash it with, which I haven't got. But all I'm going to do is different. literally go, sh because it is like paint, mm. and we're just going to paint directly onto those petals. So straight down like so. Now you could put some cardstock underneath, but actually if you're using just a small paintbrush to paint with, this is just a really nice relaxing way mm. of getting a really different look. So we're going to continue around here. Now I do have a bit of a confession because my finished one is done with our watercoloured um, ink pad. Oh, okay. Uh, not ink pad, watercolour palette. Ah. And do you remember we had this shimmer? The shimmer one, yes. Because originally when this show was on, they were what were going to be on the show. Ah. So I'd already prepped my demo. Well, that's those. okay because do you know what? I love that because it, everyone has different preference with yes. how they like to work yeah, with yeah. things. So. But then when no. they added the shimmer paints, I thought, actually, we could do the same. Mm. So although my finished sample is with one, I've got a finished one with the um, with the with these ones as well. Oh, so then gorgeous. I'm just going to go in with the green. Now, because your leaves, can you see on the leaves here, they're not, they've, not, they've got the die cut. So all mm. you're going to do with those is literally colour ah. around, just a colour around onto so there. So you're still That's getting really nice. that leaf shape, but you're actually just making sure oh there you thank go gorge you levi's so just going to get you some water amazing you thank are. you levi 
So just going to go round. Doesn't have to be. You can be quite fussy with this. It doesn't have to be perfect. Nice and that's all you're going to do. So doing that with the uh, paint, this is how that one looks when it's all done. Oh, you see the that. shimmer that's on beautiful. there using those exact colours that I've used there. Um, the purple one there, which is the golden heather, and then just doing your leaves. So that's how it would look with that one. Then what you're going to do is let me just take that piece away. When you're going to cut the other one into the opposite side and paint that as well. So if I bring in my finished one, mm. oh, and let me just show you this first. When you are doing this, this one is fine because that is going to tape to that one underneath, which is fine. But this one, if I do that, it's going to hide my inside ah, detail. So with okay. this one, all you want to do is just trim so you've got a small tab just down because then you've still got enough room to adhere that on the bottom Perfect. but it's much neater and then the other ones it's giving you more rigidity on that side so it works really better okay so let's pop those out the way much better not really better it's not good grammar is it <laughs> and then this one so this is the one i've done with our paints which actually is not too dissimilar so actually i actually think this one looks nicer because it's brighter this one's a more muted effect so um, these were our sort of paint palettes um, but that one looks just as pretty so you can it do does. it with your inks as well so that's Beautiful. what you're going to get when you've had it and then i just had some linen cardstock which i know we have on the shows today the linen cardstock i just just made the same box but I did it on the box base side to create the box mm. and then I've just got some pretty papers and a sentiment to stick on the top just to create our beautiful box but it's a it's a nice way of being creative with the dies yeah. and using them in a totally different way oh definitely so I love this pop them onto the top there so just some coordinating papers let's use this one and stick that and I've used that um, linen cardstock on the base the same as my mats and layers ah, okay. just to tie that one in and then we're just going to stick this all into place and again it's these are dies where you can use anything from your stash so whatever papers you've got whatever sentiments you've got are all going to look beautiful so let's pop that in there and then finish our box so just using, and again, I'm using my tape pen, you can see for everything, because it's a great one to use, especially on construction, because it's super strong. Yeah, and I'm doing this before I put my box together, then I haven't got to push down on anything. Mm. Um, so again, I've just got, for an amazing, which was one of our fancy sentiments, and then we've got friend. It's so beautiful, Debbie. It's gorgeous. And there we go, we're just gonna pop that on there and then place our box together. So I've got this small rim now, because it's only a small tab, I'm gonna actually go in with my dotty tape pen, just so I make sure we only get where we need it. The same on this side. <laughs> so cool. It's just another, and you think you can do this with every single one of the dies that you've yeah. got in this collection. Yeah, and I you think can do that's the stars, what, the dragon dies. Absolutely, so you awesome. could make this for whatever sort of um, project that you want it to be, or whatever box you want it to Gosh, I mean, imagine to. if you make, um, because you've got those little, the tiny little holes in there as well. If you made something like bath bombs or your own soap oh, and things I like love that, that. Yeah, you know, you'd get really that fragrance nice coming through as well, couldn't you? Absolutely, very nice. And then we've just got that small tab on the end. So we're just gonna make sure that that's stuck down. And then always go in with your um, scoring tool afterwards because your scoring tool is gonna make sure that all your glue is burnished down well. Because if you make sure it's uh, stuck fast, it's not gonna go anywhere. So last one there, and then all we're going to do is go in with the... You could put a lantern, yes! Yeah, tea lights, yeah, tea lights and lanterns as well, Laura's just suggesting. And actually, I was just it. looking at it that way, you could have a tall box. This could be the size oh, yeah. of your box the other way round if yeah. you did a tall one. Because, yeah, it doesn't matter which way round your dies go. Then pop that on top, and that's our box all finished. Wow. There we go. That is absolutely beautiful. I think... 
Got to give that one. Let's give that a clap. Everyone's clapping yet. Yeah, there we go. Um, that's beautiful. Isn't that amazing? And you can you can do all of these projects. You can make the cards. You can make the boxes. You can make the gift bags. You can really do such beautiful things with this collection. Um, the deals are the oh no the bomb they've gone. I'm just gonna no it's okay. Your code is just to let you know it2063. Sorry, I didn't read that out before. They go it2063 and um, 69.99 and it's on a split pay for you as well. Three way split pay too. So you get it all home for £23.33, pence, which is phenomenal. Um, now, we have um, a really fantastic deal on the Gemini for you. Um, and we've still got it. What's that, darling? Really? Still under £200. Yeah, I love machine. that that, that we've been brilliant. keeping at that price. Yeah, we haven't put it up, so yeah. I think that is so good. It's yeah. superb. Um, this is just brilliant. So with a four-way split pay as well, you're only paying £50 to get it home. Maybe you've been watching now for a while at Hobby Maker and just maybe you've done your research, you've been looking out there, seeing what kind of die-cutting machines there are and you've heard all the evidence, you've heard lots of people telling you about the Gemini 2. It's here for you today at a really superb deal. Get it home for £49. Um, your code is QW2058. Um, but Debbie, just in a little bit. Oh, there you are. There you go. We know how much you love it, Debbie. Um, I, I mean, you were like ages ago now. <laughs> it was only, I can't remember when our Gemini machine was it last was birthday? It? Yeah, I, I, I think so. Only October. I can't remember now. Um, but yeah, as you can see on there, I mean, it is, uh, oh, last May. Wow. Last May. Wow. Oh, so my gosh. it is nearly a year that it's wow. been out now. So for anybody that's got the older Gemini machine, um, it it's just about all the updates that it's been in because we okay. can't put more pressure in this machine but it is the most incredible machine that you can buy I think on the market it has unbelievable pressure its performance is second to none um, and you can see there the full length means that you can put any of your plates through mm -hmm. which I absolutely love so if you've got the Ge Gemini Junior you can put those through um, it's quieter it's faster our plates now are absolutely brilliant you've got easy glide feet on there so it makes it really easy to put along you can also buy the turntable if you want additional elements on there okay. uh, built-in storage so we've just upgraded we put it in that lovely raspberry color that for me is a game changer being able yeah. to watch yeah, I watch hobby maker all the time on my tablet ah. let's slide it on the top literally you can charge it at the same time it's just a great all-round machine to have That's and it looks amazing it does it looks really <laughs> sleek it looks really modern it just looks really wonderful doesn't it really fantastic and you know what you get this dime machine you're not gonna need to get another one ever it's no, the future Oh, really, it, it? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. It's so good. Yeah, it's so just good. absolutely brilliant. Um, can I ask as well? Here's a so you know our little pin badges that we did for our birthday. Was that twenty percent off? So, so the little code on the back. If you've got our hobby maker pin badge, the little code oh. um, for my birthday. You can, this is one of those deals you really want to use it. Remember, you can use it on your whole day's shopping as well. Um, so you get, you'd get £199.99, is that £40 you'd get back? Uh, no, hold on. Yeah, no, it, yeah it would, wouldn't it? Um, but is it, do you still, can you do that on your split pay? Is oh. it? Can you use it? Ah, I thought you couldn't. Oh, you can. You can. I that's thought you couldn't, you but could. you can. That's amazing. Another £40 off. That's And if you take all your plates that you get in the machine, yes. you're probably not paying £100 for your machine today if you've got that's that discount code. That's extraordinary, isn't it? It's Ooh. absolutely brilliant. Um, really, really good chance to come on in um, and get the saving here today. 0800 001 4433. If you've already started your order with us today, remember it's still only 3 95 for your P&P. Even with the size of this machine, um, it's still only uh, 3 95 for your post and packaging. And of course, you're going to be able to use this with all of your um, your slim dies. Absolutely brilliant. All of that storage as well. Come on in and grab it when you can. Um, now, I've got a little bit of a surprise for you. This is going to go wild. We've, um, hello. Mm -hmm. ah. um, get yourselves ready. You give the best hugs, Rosie. I she love gives, a hug. She gives proper good hugs. I do yes. love a hug. Mm -hmm. I'm a, yeah, my, my friend Claire doesn't like hugging, but I always say, can I give you an awkward hug? And oh, I like, know. <laughs> yeah, I've got a friend that doesn't like hugging as well, and I have to sometimes sit and work her space. I know yeah, I'm a bit of a hugger. Yeah, I'm a hugger. Well. You give great hugs. <laughs> um, right, listen, you're going to be hugging yourself when you save, your, you save all the yes, deals here. Absolutely. We've got 25 minutes of half price Yay. deals 50 percent off mm -hmm. from everything that we bring you over the next 25 minutes okay um we're going to start with the gilding flakes kit 
This is amazing. Talk us through. It's oh, so amazing. Yeah, we do lots of these kits in collections and they are amazing because what's brilliant about them, and I know people will want these, Rosie, because they'll be running out of their glue or running out yes. of the building flakes. So these are good to stock up on. So this was our Bohemian collection. I say we, it was our Sarah's collection. Um, it's a great one as well if you just want to try it. You've never tried yeah, building flakes dip your toe before. In. So, and I would also say if you're going to go for this one, even though you know it's going to be half price, go for some red liner tape as well because that's brilliant with gilding Ooh, flakes yeah which is amazing so anything that's sticky your uh, gilding flakes will go with it what's the dry ink pad then is so, that like an embossing ink or yeah so no what it's for it's for um stamping ah. so you put your liquid glue here so that yeah. liquid glue you can literally just put in dabs and put around the edges of oh, things and clever. apply your gilding wax or you could apply that to that little ink pad and then you can stamp the glue onto any stamp stamp it down it comes mm. out like it's almost um, iridescent like a blue sort of tone wow. um, and then when it goes dry mm. it goes tacky and then you put your gilding flakes on it that's so clever know, that's really incredible one, that one. Um, yes. and 14 99 um, already fantastic actually for a kit like that would you like it for half price today yes please seven pound fifty we're really limited on yeah, this it's a so great you one, that one. To be quick, it's great isn't it yeah it's really such fantastic. a good one anyone that loves their gilding flakes they're really gonna love that one yeah it's fabulous um vr 2018 phone lines are starting to go crazy everyone's put it nearly half the stock's gone already that's like 30 <laughs> seconds and it's already um almost sold out Who so doesn't this is, love a half price deal well exactly exactly um we've got so much to bring to you three quarters of the stock that's going to sell out now where would you like to go to next my darling oh should we do some venetian grace oh yes the real bridge I'm i've not really, seen this collection yeah this collection was beautiful so this is just what's left oh. it shows you that if you don't go for collections when they come out you'll just have the few pieces to pick from afterwards yeah. but actually great ones to pick from because this one is so beautiful that i mean lovely. the rialto bridge is gorgeous in its own right isn't it but when hey. you, um, Debbie, it's 5.99 is that already 50 percent wow. off Wow. Um, you might want to pick up the phone. In fact, do you know what? Just pick up the phone and just stay <laughs> there. <laughs> just stay there. Um, Two ninety nine. Wow. Yeah, that's crazy. Look at the intricacy of it. Yeah, it's so amazing. Pretty. It is very pretty. It's a really lovely dye. You're going to mm. love cutting it out. I mean, if you love um, your, uh, if you love Rome, uh, Rome V. <laughs> Venice, Rome, Venice. Oh, I could, Italy. I could Italy. Venice now, Italy. That's what I was thinking. And then I was trying to say where the Rialto Bridge was, which is in Venice, of course. I've not been, have you? I haven't been to oh, Venice. I'd love no. to go to Venice. Um, listen, come on in. And if you want demos on this, just go to Crafters Companion website. You're going to find loads of demonstrations. And of course, your Facebook group mm -hmm. as well. You'll Absolutely. get loads of hints yep. and tips. Mm -hmm. Three pounds. Yeah, it's fantastic. Amazing. Then we've got the harmonious harp as well. I'd love to play the harp. Would you? I would, yeah. Nice. I always thought as a kid it would be a lovely instrument to play. It's just really, it's just really cool. It's I mean, that's great. a really usable die, isn't it? If yeah. you love your music, if you love just like that intricate detail, yeah. it's going to be beautiful, that it's one. It's absolutely gorgeous, isn't it? Um, really, really love this. Do you know what, as well? I'm looking at it thinking if you snip the, the strings, it could almost be like an angel wing as well. Oh, I like that, really yes. Pretty. $2.99. $2.99. Oh, I'm getting squeakier as the show goes on. <laughs> um, <laughs> um, X Z 2058 is your code for that 2.99 make sure you're checking out these deals are ridiculous we've got so much to bring to you we're going to bring you the little cherub i love the cherub uh, so the cherub is based on leanne's granddaughter oh is it yeah oh, she asked the design so team when they drew sweet. it to um yeah to uh, to draw her little granddaughter ada oh. um and that's who it was based on and she does look like ada as well gorgeous yep. she's a proper little hair. angel mm -hmm. just beautiful um 2.99 once again and this is the outer and the inner isn't it it is so you've got the stamp so you've got yeah. the stamp with this oh, one and then you see. die cut it out yeah oh, so for 2.99 right. for a stamp and a die that's incredible wow 2.99 laura's yeah, mm. Laura's in there going, is this supposed to be a joke? <laughs> <laughs> um, fantastic saving there. DT 2071, really limited on this um, for Venetian Grace. So please do, again, check it out as quickly as you can. Um, right, Renaissance Frame. Yeah, um, this is 
sensational, isn't it's it? It's a big Look die. You're getting two dies mm. in here as well. So you're getting that main die and you're getting its matte layer as well. It's just oh, wow. beautiful. I mean, if ever you wanted a die just to use for your everyday crafting, this is gorgeous. Yeah, that is really incredible, isn't it? It's beautiful. And I, I was just thinking that was the half price deal already, but I don't think it is, is it? No, it's not, which is crazy. Wow. I love as well. So can I ask then? So, so that's the outer die there, isn't it? So it yep. can have that almost... So geometric frame around it, but I love it here as well. It's sort of, you then you get almost like ten Yeah, you get two dies. So, yeah, it's amazing. Yeah, for four ninety nine. That's brilliant. Do you know what? I feel like I want to get this one out. So you yeah, can, take it, it out. It is a big die. die. Yeah, show oh. how beautiful it is. So the packaging doesn't do this any uh, justice. Oh, I'm um, being really. I'm being really cack handed here, Do Debs. To, I tell you what it is, it's because the tape normally holds it, so you just have ah. to sort of, there we go. Just release it. Just being too gentle. <laughs> there we go. So uh, what you've got here, that die is your die that cuts wow. out. So that will cut Ooh. out the whole die. I mean and also this is an embossing and stenciling <gasps> die. Ooh. Yeah, we've not just got any old die here for half price. And then this one is your mm. matte and layer. So you cut that out and can put a coordinating mat behind oh it. Oh, my goodness. So mate. that is an incredible die to get for 4 dollars It's brilliant. It what do you mean by amazing. stenciling die as well? So it's embossing, it's cutting, and it's stenciling. Yes, yeah, so cut it out, mm -hmm. uh, put it through your, put it back in your Gemini, but put your rubber shim on there. Do you know your, your purple yeah. rubber shim? Put that over the top, and that will emboss all that detail through. Wow. While the die is then still in the card use your ink pads to go over the top oh my and goodness. it stencils through the die so when you take it's it so away clever. you get this in beautiful embossed detail uh, i can't believe that's 4 dollars that's ridiculous yeah um, yeah neither can everyone at home it's getting busier and busier and busier i tell you what should we bring you another gorgeous ornamental frame yeah and do the same price now oh this is three dies isn't it yeah so wow. same thing apart from this one has got your inside piece as well um so you've got three different ones here mm. and again this is your stenciling it's embossing Three piece die, it's just incredible. And for four ninety nine again, Rosie. I mean you yeah. can't go wrong. Can it's you? superb. Do you know maybe you're just maybe you've just got in to die cutting and actually with the great saving you've got on the Gemini 2 today as well, you can make your own bundle. You're kind of building your own bundle with all the yep. half price deals, get your Gemini 2 as well. And then you're away. How long you've been thinking about it and sort of watching the demos, thinking, Oh, I, I could really get into this, I really love it. Today's the day you want to do it. But half price dies, brilliant saving on the Gemini yep. 2 as well. It's just all here for you. Um, build your own bundle. Catherine, Graham, Janet, wasn't Rachel, Medina, loads of loads of you coming through there. Um, right, we've got, okay, I'm really excited about these as well. This is a big set. These gorgeous oh, majestic these mandalas. Yeah, it's these lovely. are a whole, they're a big panel of your stamp set, which are incredible. And then you're getting individual stamps with them, with your textures and your sentiments as well. They are wow. amazing. I love these. It's fantastic, isn't it? Right, this, hold on. Look at the which size. Seven ninety nine is is, is incredible. Yep. We're about to give you half price, Debbie. I mean, all I'm thinking is here, the sentiments on their own, $7.99, great, right? The mandala, absolutely $7.99 is fantastic. I'm also thinking this is clearly a really popular and really beautiful mm -hmm. stamp set. So why on earth are we doing a 50% saving, you know? Yeah. Uh, it's because, so these are not what we call our core products. So we get to the end of our lines and mm. then you get the savings. That's it. You've got to clear the vault. There won't be a lot of these left though. No, so, um, there, there aren't going to be many left. Look at everyone is coming through. <laughs> 3.99 i mean that is just yep. wonderful mm -hmm. isn't it what brilliant news for you That's get amazing. it home yeah, yeah absolutely fantastic yeah these are beautiful dies they have been our firm favorite for a long time mm. so for you to get them half price is incredible yeah sensational it's such lovely details you can color them you could be embossing them i mean they're so detailed absolutely gorgeous nearly half the stock has already gone um well i've got some great news for you um <laughs> Because There's if you more. love this style, we've got the magnificent mm. butterflies as well. Yeah, um, absolutely. This is just joyful, isn't it? Yeah, exactly the same. They are so beautiful. In fact, I'm going to open it, Rosie, oh, just yeah, so go you can it. see how big that stamp is because it really is a big stamp. Um, I know there's not many of them, but it's so gorgeous. And they stamp beautifully. Look at that. <gasps> oh, my goodness. I me. know. It's Ooh. really hard to explain when they're in the packet, but that's a large stamp. 
that. Wow. So think of all your backgrounds that you can be creating with. We've got pigment ink pads, duet ink pads, all those different things that you can create with. And then look at the sentiments that you yeah. get. Uh, and I love that distress one as well. Yeah, it's great that, those. isn't it? So if you go for both of those, to get that distress is amazing. Oh, yeah, over allocated. Yeah. It's about to sell out. Um, do you know what? Can I just rip into this one as well yes, and show absolutely. you? Because equally, you know, again, it's a really big stamp. It is a really um, big stamp. Gorgeous to colour in if you just want to colour them in. Oh. Great for the kids if you want them to have something to colour in. So you stamp them and then you can do them. But so amazing when you, you can stamp them. You did that so neatly. Different. I'm just <laughs> used to undoing the packaging. <laughs> oh, very good. Here Look we at go. that. Look at this. Mm -hmm. Seriously. It's huge. Really, yep. really glorious i mean it's so beautiful and then you could cut into it afterwards couldn't you oh and actually, absolutely cut them out yeah and what's lovely as well these can be summer they can go summery colors but actually they make really gorgeous snowflakes oh yes, well, love they? That, yes do them in some sort of frosty colors as well beautiful yeah. um oh my goodness we've got more half price deals coming your way um <gasps> i just say if you oh go, yeah if you go for the <gasps> bohemian gilding the glue yes you can apply the glue to that stamp and you can have mandalas and butterflies that are stamped oh, with your gilding that. flakes. Yes. Yeah. Genius. Go and get your gilding flakes when yes, you can. Absolutely. Um, has that already sold out, did you say, or is it? Oh, oh they have sorry, sold out. They sorry. Have. Such a tease, Debbie, honestly. <laughs> My goodness. <laughs> um, the butterflies have sold out as well. It's looking like the majestic mandalas are about to sell oh, out dear. as well. It's all going to go. Right. We've got um, your stylish trio. Um, oh, in fact, oh my goodness, we've got lots I'm of I'm really shocked there. that these, I, I'm genuinely shocked that these are on offer because these uh, sell all the time. I yeah. think it was quite our core. Um, they are incredible. You will absolutely love them. This is my favourite one. I know we've got oh, some why? other Oh, why? Tell us them. why. Because it's got the, uh, I've been using, if I show you, oh, it's that this, one. This, is this one I've been using with Sarah's um, Enchanted Ocean a lot. Mm, it's just a nice. great one to use and if you love your shimmer sprays if you love your ink pads if you love your glitter paste it's just incredible this one's lovely as well so i use that one oh a lot gosh. which is nice those three to have in a pack for 3.99 that's brilliant i mean what is that one pound 30 plus each? yeah i it's, mean for a stencil you can remarkable. emboss your stencils as well it's yeah. just yeah that's come and get crazy. your shimmer sprays as well mm -hmm. and then you're going to be good to go aren't you oh you're be totally kinds yeah of the they are beautiful gorgeous um oh i am literally today has just been the most fun, hasn't it? Isn't yeah, it, it has. Um, We've had some really good yeah. days today, which are incredible. We and have amazing crafty items. I know. These I think are this nice is my well. fave. This is um, these are lovely. Mm -hmm. Yeah, look, this is the decorative trio. Yeah. Just look. Have we got any? Um, oh, I tell you what, we could do this on the linen oh, card yes. stock. Oh yes. Oh yes. Check out these stencils. Just absolutely incredible now that one Beautiful. there rosie if you mm -hmm. do it on one side and then put it turn it around <gasps> on the other side it creates one massive mandala really mm -hmm. oh my goodness yes. so it's Beautiful. got that perfect symmetry and that's that. just one of them wow in that pack three nights i mean i'd pay 3.99 for that one quite happily to be fair and look at this yeah, as well look at all those flourishes oh, so gorgeous these are remarkable yep. take a little look at this as well That's such beautiful. a brilliant saving 3.99 for all three of these gorgeous stencils yep. you'll notice as well you've got that little hole punch there mm -hmm. so you can keep them all on your jump rings so you keep yep, them all together absolutely. can't you yeah Which you can brilliant if you're going for all of them because uh, for that price that's incredible yeah i'd get just yeah just go for all of them go do you know what just actually just Keep that phone in your hand and add everything to your order because you're going <laughs> to love all of it. It's beautiful. You think how much you're saving for half price yeah. deals today. And they're Fantastic. really good deals. Yeah. This isn't stuff we're just finding. This is great stuff that we have. It's just unfortunate it. we don't have more of them. That's it. I mean, it's not like bargain basement, sort of the things that people, you know, sometimes in, there are some stores you go in and it's half price sale and you get really lucky, you get yep. some really great deals. But then sometimes you're looking through the rails and you're like, okay, I can understand yes. why this is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. None of this makes any sense. No. No, um, it's just fantastic you know this is beautiful we are really aren't we we're yes, making a few totally. new friends here today yeah That's absolutely it. yeah um, welcome to hobby maker and this is the kind of collaboration that you can enjoy here at hobby maker you know crafters companion hobby maker together fantastic savings and the quality that we know you love as well from yes. crafters so um so come on in keep on checking out loads of notes of you coming through there too now we've got the textile trio oh yes um, another one another yeah. beautiful design another three of them i mean if you're going for all those three today that's 
nine stencils. In fact, I think, is there another one? I think there, there is. We've another. got the opulent trio coming up as yeah, well. Bringing it all ones. today. Thanks, my darling. Yeah, beautiful designs, these ones. If you <gasps> love your textures and you like to create those sort of grungy backgrounds, oh, these yeah. are going to be amazing for those. This is a bit of picnic as well. Love that. All your summer cards and your sort of afternoon there. picnics. It's gorgeous. Um, that's £1.33. Unbelievable. And then taking a look at this, these gorgeous I love that one. waves. It's lovely, isn't it? Yeah. And you could actually you could stencil one way, then stencil the other. It'd be like a woven effect, wouldn't mm, it? Definitely. It's really pretty. And it could be waves. We had something earlier. We had a card with that earlier. Do you remember the duet? Oh, yeah. Pads, but we not did, sure didn't we? Gone, and that was with that stencil. It was. I think we had one with your favourite as well. In the pack earlier. Yes, I think there yeah, was. We yeah. did. I love that That's one. Lovely. Yeah, it's like that cheesecloth, isn't it? It is. Like cheesecloth. Yeah. It yeah. could be a tennis net as well. Oh, yeah. Or for badminton yes. rackets love or something it. like yes. that. Yeah. Brilliant. Really lovely. I mean, just such brilliant savings. £1.33 a stencil. Um, it's extraordinary. And then the opulent trio as well. Yeah, this one These. is stunning. Mm. That, yeah. I mean, every time I see one, I'm like, oh, I love this one. Oh, I love this. <laughs> but they are all absolutely gorgeous. Take a look at this. You could also... You could draw into these, couldn't you? You with, can with your draw fine into liners. them, yes. And I've known some of our design team to mm. do that. So they would literally use their ink pads, go with, in with your fine liners and draw through them. Yeah, do a bit of tangling. You can emboss them. So uh, put them through with your embossing mat with your Gemini and uh, emboss that detail into them. So, uh, yeah, beautiful design. Here you go. I love that. Yeah, that, that is gorgeous, Very opulent, isn't it? Isn't it? Beautiful. And actually, the other way around... Could, it could go either way, actually, couldn't yeah, it? Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, really stunning. And then your roses. That um, is gorgeous. That's just lovely. I'll pop those the other way. There you go. Um, absolutely stunning. Really, really beautiful. I actually really like it with the stripes in the background as well. Yes. <laughs> that one was with the duets as well. I think the duets must have come out with these uh, oh, stencils. Oh, maybe. Yeah, because they all look quite familiar. So I think yeah. when we launched our duet ink pads, so if you've gone for our duet ink pads, they'll still be on the website. They will. Um, you can get these half price to go with them now absolutely it's fantastic isn't it nearly half the stock has gone we had a big stock on this and it's nearly all gone um now we've got um the quartz metal die oh, from Gemini. this one is amazing oh my goodness right laura's so just beautiful. saying um when this was on you yep. sold out of every single did, style yeah. with this yeah. um but we've got this one Wow. It doesn't need to be discounted. I mean, none of this needs to be discounted. It's just gorgeous. These are the dies that sold out so quickly. Mm. I was really gutted because we then don't get a chance to demo with them again. Oh, no. And it's really disappointing because there is so much you can do with these. Mm. Uh, and they are just amazing. So not only have you got that gorgeous frame, you've got that intricate doily die inside as well. Yeah. And you've got your corners on there and little decorative frames, which you can elongate to make an even bigger frame. These are just stunning. Yes. These could be like little brass findings as well. You know, when you yes. make the boxes yes. and things like that. Or on, yeah. or on your books, it could be the lock. It could be, Love you that. know. Do it with your mirror card. Yeah. Cut them with your mirror cards. Oh, they're so stunning. Um, even with all of that, we're still going 50% off for you. 7 49 That's, That's crazy. Just, that is phenomenal. It's yeah. really beautiful. So good. Yeah, absolutely gorgeous. Rachel's there, Samantha and Kevin, Annette, Medina, Hampshire, John, Janet there, Leicestershire as well. We've got Warwickshire coming through. A 50% off brilliant bonus to yeah. our crafters mm -hmm. show today. Absolutely. I mean, how fantastic. The phone lines have gone crazy <laughs> for this as well. Um, please do be tenacious, okay? I always say that with the phone lines because it does get really busy. Yeah. The great thing is, is the phone number is completely free. So dialing through, if you are having to wait in a little queue, you're not having to pay anything for it. So don't worry. Um, our call center are fantastic as well. So if you've got any questions, um, you can just come through to them and they'll help you out. But of course, on the web and the app, that's probably the quickest, easiest way to check out. Out. You never have to wait for a queue online. So if you go to our website, hobbymaker.co.uk, pop it in your basket and just remember to check it out. You don't have to wait till the end of the day to check it all out to get one PMP. You can check out 50 times, you can check out 100 times, you can check out as many times as you like, <laughs> and it's still only going to be 395 um, P and P, and ha over half, oh, three quarters of the stocks now. Wow, gone. I'm not surprised. Everyone would know how good these dies were. They were the dies that we use all the time, and then it was like, oh no, they're all sold out. So I'm really sure they've got this. They've obviously found this one, um, and there's not enough, I don't think, going around. But yeah, get your baskets checked out on that oh, one. Oh, definitely, it's going to sell out for sure. Loads of you coming through now. Um, we also have, oh, this is brilliant. Mm -hmm. Okay, 
Um, we've got your 3D um, topper pads. Yes, the topper pads are amazing. Now, perhaps we've got a lot of people watching today yep. who haven't yet got a die cutting machine. Yes, absolutely. And even if you have, sometimes you just want to have mm -hmm. um, a bit of speedy crafting. Yes. And this is perfect, isn't it? Oh, um, so good. Everyday celebrations or fancy florals. Let's yes. go there. Have a look. They're beautiful, these are. And actually, for new crafters and advanced crafters, they're great. They're great just to, if you're not sure what to pop onto your cards or to your boxes or your gift bags or your tags these just mm. pop out you literally just give them a little wiggle you can decoupage them up and layer them onto each other or you could just use them individually and you'll get more out of them That's they're fun. just a great one to go for so you're getting five sheets of each design as well aren't you, you? are right. yeah 15 Gorgeous. sheets in total yeah you're Ooh, getting three lovely. different uh, designs they're amazing absolutely amazing so stunning and again just really simple you could use these to decoupage onto furniture and things as well couldn't you? oh i love that idea to. yes of course little details yeah, a yeah. Varnish on top. Yeah, it looks amazing. Shall I show you how to pop them out? Is there a trick to it? Is there a knack to it? No, and not really. Debbie, just... I would just say, uh, just wiggle them. Wiggle. Yeah, like a wiggle. give them a little wiggle. Give wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle. <laughs> wiggle, wiggle. Do you remember that? Who was that who did that song? Um, the, no... Um, in the 90s, wasn't the bus, it? There you go. The Venga, Venga bus. The Venga bus. Boys, What's it? The Venga bus, bus is bumping and everybody's jumping. jumping. <laughs> <laughs> we need to go out, don't we? Um, <laughs> but look at that. You see, you can straight away pop them out and then just make a simple card, make a little bookmark, you know, combine them with some dried flowers, yeah. maybe. Absolutely. Loads of different yeah. things you can and do. so many things you can use on top of these. Your inks, you can colour onto them. Oh, you can yeah. use your um, highlight, your glossy highlight, anything like that you can put on top of these because they're coated oh, of course oh brilliant so you can mm. be stamping your sentiments yeah, on there absolutely. too oh my goodness me um so fantastic it's super super busy and um, please don't leave your basket unchecked okay go and check them out guarantee your place um we're going to bring you the everyday celebrations as well and these are great because you're kind of covering all ages as well aren't you you've got new oh hold on a minute now these are your cutesy ones so they are very cutesy. cute yeah which i think i uh, well, i really love i uh, like knife there scissors? or scissors my darling yes. thank you my love don't want to so this is it i would just rip into it which is not um it's not how it's done, is it? It's not how it's done. Not <laughs> how it's done. Let's just do that one and then we can... There we not go. very delicate, you see. Well, I never <laughs> made it as a ballet dancer. It's like an elephant. <laughs> I can't um, imagine that at all. I was very thumpy. Very, um, <laughs> right, right, very heavy-footed. Right, we've got these beautiful balloons and I love that. Look at that. It's on out to sea. Yeah, it's oh. so nice, isn't it? So, I mean, you've got sort of uh, male-inspired there and female, but you've got your sort of cute bears there as well oh, you've got yeah. some little gnomes garden gnomes in there you've got a teapot in there oh, so lots yeah. of different ones yeah just beautiful really gorgeous i love the hummingbird as well and i think it's just their simplicity mm. everyone needs a pad that they could just do a bit of quick crafting with great yeah. for the kids in the school yeah. holidays i love popping these out get some foam pads put them on top of each other they'll love them ah oh, just fantastic so much fun that you can have listen if you're just joining us maybe you've just hopped onto the channel and you thought, oh my goodness, what is going on? What is this 50% off? Thanks, Dan. Honestly, Dan just said, oh, Gracie's about to go. Thank goodness. Um, <laughs> well, um, <laughs> but um, we have got some amazing deals here for you today. Have a look on the website, okay? You've got fantastic things to look there. If you've missed out on the Crafters Show, the Gemini 2 is there for you as well. Keep checking out on your big bundle. Now, you're back in a bit. I am. I just you? another hour and then I'm back in again. So, uh, fantastic. Yes, uh, with amazing embossing folders we've only done them a couple of times so uh, i'm glad we're bringing them back to you that's fantastic and thank that you, is going to be the day rob thank you Aww. it's always lovely Mwah. thank you my darling and um, you've got dave up next with wonderful james you've got another fantastic collection coming your way so don't go anywhere because you've got three more fabulous hours here on hobby maker see you soon <laughs> Our UK-based call centre is always on hand to assist you 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Every day our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and we feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to crafting or a seasoned pro, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 1pm to 8pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Shopping with Hobbymaker couldn't be easier. 
you can shop via our website at www.hobbymaker.co.uk where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your craft room essentials to paper, tools, cutting machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Hobbymaker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Hobbymaker. Alternatively, you can call our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Hobbymaker. Not only is Hobbymaker available live from 1 until 8pm on Sky 670, Freeview Channel 73, YouTube and the Hobbymaker app, now Virgin subscribers can watch on Channel 754 which means there are more ways to watch your way with Hobbymaker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobbymaker. Never miss a show by watching on the go with our brand new Hobbymaker app. Head over to your app store now and search Hobbymaker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favourite presenters and guests. Click on the Today's button to shop all of the products that are featured in today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's best sellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click the Schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking here for our social media pages. So never miss a show by watching On The Go with our brand new Hobbymaker app. Hey everybody, good evening, it's five o'clock. Thank you, Rosie, for the last four hours. Uh, we've got a great evening lined up. We really, really have. Mark's here from Visible Image. We've got, of course, Debbie back with more Crafters Companion. And this fella, James. I'm here. Good. James Hembrose are here right. from Creative Expressions. Good to see you good again. Good to see you too. Good yeah. to see you. Now, a couple of weeks ago, um, we were really, really delighted to have the lovely Sue Wilson here. She hadn't been on television for about five years. And that collection that she brought to us that day is in this show tonight. So if you missed that, do not worry. We've got another chance to really explore and enjoy Art Deco. It's an amazing collection that absolutely flew the other day. Before we do that, though, um, everyone that was uh, involved in those shows and that bought something in those shows uh, was offered the opportunity of winning a card. And we've got three winners of a personally signed Sue Wilson card. And we're going to announce the winners right now. Congratulations to Elaine Kamsika, Janet Fisher, and Linda Jackson. Well done to you three. You've got a card in the post in the next few days from us, signed by Sue, uh, from this collection. So congratulations one and all. And now, if you're watching that and you're thinking, oh, I'd fancy a, a card, uh, well, we can give you the chance of winning one in this show, actually. We haven't done this for a little while. Davy Bead's Lucky Dip. Uh, this is the card that James has very, very kindly given me, and you could win this. This is from this collection. So you'd be making cards like this with the collection we've got for you in the show right now. Do you fancy winning this? Would you like to have that in a, in, a, in a frame on your wall or something like that? All you've got to do is send an email into a studio at hobbymaker.co.uk with your name, your address, and your customer number, if you'd be so kind. And we'll announce the winner on the wheel uh, before six o'clock this evening. So get those emails in as quickly as you can. But maybe after you've bought the collection. Yes, absolutely. Yes. <laughs> Shall we do uh, a little bit of Meet the Crew before we go into it? OK. Excellent. Let's meet the crew. Uh, now, Alex is producing tonight. There he is. He's going to be putting all your messages on the screen, <laughs> spinning the wheel for me a bit later on. He's such a, <laughs> such a reserved character. Uh, and he's going to be doing those amazing deals for you. Uh, we've got Dan on Knobs and Buttons. There he is. Partners in Crime, them both, in the gallery next door. Uh, we've got in the studio, Lauren on camera too. There she is. Who's on the floor today? Oh, it's Lauren. Oh, Levi's there. There he is. 
not to miss out, Levi. And we've got Debbie getting ready for a next show, of course, in an hour as well. And James and me, that's your crew, through till eight o'clock. OK, let's have a little look at this. This is right up my alley. This is right up my street, because this, to me, instantly took me to New York. That's where it takes me. Yeah, absolutely, definitely. Especially with the uh, the Chrysler Building style die that we've got there as well. Yeah, definitely. Now, you've got three options. You can, well, actually, got more than three options. You can either go for the big bundle of everything, which is what proved to be most popular when Sue was here a little while ago. You can go for one of the smaller bundles, which I'll explain more about in a minute, or you can go for individuals. They're all on the website, but look at this. This is the uh, I Want It All bundle, and it's basically the Art Deco collection from Sue Wilson. You've got frames, you've got tags, you've got beautiful florals, you've got the Art Deco buildings. Look at all of these you can be making some incredible, incredible cards. Look at the car and the plane with the banner as well. You've got wonderful, I always say cruise-inspired um, images because of course Sue does like to cruise <laughs> quite a bit. Uh, and that could be a ceiling rose, it could be a wonderful ornate window. It's just gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. The whole thing should be £122.89. This only came out two weeks ago, so it's a really hot off the press collection from Creative Expressions and Sue Wilson. But what can we do the deal for today? If you want to go for the I Want It All, I can tell you it will be on split pay. And we're going to go to below £100. Yeah, £122, we're going to give you about £23 off. £99.99, and on split pay, I believe we got it on three. That's right, way. on split pay again. 33 33 is all you need to pay today to get this whole collection home and think of the fun you can have with it. I mean, it is a brilliant collection, James, isn't it's it? It's so versatile. I mean, it was great to see uh, Sue's take on it and how uh, so a lot of snippability with the frames and the different ways that she was using them and the demos that I did here a couple of weeks ago as well. Put a little bit of a different twist on it this time uh, with some of the Cosmic Shimmer products that we've got as well. Um, but yeah, it's really, really versatile. Okay, let me just explain to you what you're going to get because you're going to get, you can go for this on its own, the Roaring, um, um, the Roaring, Roaring Good Time yep. is a separate uh, option for you. So the Roaring Good Time is going to give you the Roaring Good Time sentiment, which is fantastic. Love the font on that. You're going to get this lovely ornate frame. This is in the I Want It All, obviously. This is the elegant fanfare. You're going to get also the vintage car and the biplane. You're going to get these wonderful tags, the decorative tag duo in different sizes. You're going to get your florals, the floral extravaganza. And you're going to get da, 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 the Chrysler building. Isn't that just amazing? So that's in the Have a Roaring Time bundle. Yep. But that separately is available. Should we put the details up for that if you want to? OK, we'll pop that up quickly. The Roaring Time. So if you want the Roaring Time, so that, that bundle I just showed you, 66.94. We can let you have that for 56.99, and that will be on split pay as well. Probably two split pays. So that's SM2892, 56.99 on two split pays. That's if you want the bundle I just showed you. The other bundle is also available separately too. But remember, if you go for the I want it all that we had at the start of the show, you'll get the lot, all yeah. of it. This bundle is called Just Because because you got the Just Because um, sentiment. There we go. So there's Just Because. There's the lady walking the dog, probably in that uh, Central Park. By the looks yeah. Of it. You've then got this beautiful dazzling diamonds, five dies in that set. You've got this one, which is your Fantel rosette. And you've got your diamond radiance background all. So that is the Just Because collection. 55.95, we're gonna drop it down though. Here it comes, 47.99, and that's BF2827. As it's under 50 pounds, is it on split pair? Probably not, I would have thought. I don't think it is, okay. So, you've got those options. Oh, it is. It is. It's on two-way split oh, wow. pay, even though it's below 50. Okay, great. So that makes it 24.99 today, 24.99 in four weeks' time. So those are the two separate bundles. But if you go for the I want it all, you're going to get all of what I've just shown you. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. It's amazing, yeah, isn't it? That as well. Should we show some finished cards? Yeah, let's do that. Should we? I'll grab a few as well and go through some different samples, shall we? Okay, now look at this. Look at the cards you could be making to give you some inspiration. Angie Davis of the design team's done that one. <coughs> There's the dog walking. <laughs> I think that's by uh, Sheila Walsh, yeah. A fantastic colorist. Look at that. Aren't they just I think it's great when you see so many different varied versions uh, from the design team. I know last time it was great to see all of Sue's own cars and own designs and have Sue here show her herself. Uh, it's just nice to share some of the design teams as well. And it's a completely different take again, which is I really know. nice. It just shows how versatile the, uh, the range is. That's my favourite well. die in a very long time, I must admit. Yeah, the Chrysler. Yeah, yeah. Start, yeah that, that inspired building really is fantastic. There's a couple of different ones here. Just nice to see some really different um, styles and really tiny small cars. That's by Rachel from the design team. Uh, this one's by uh, Christine Smith. So thank you to all of the design team for all of their hard work. 
This one's a great one with the car again and the flowers. We've got the uh, embossing folders that we've got on today's show as well. So just those on their own in the background form a fantastic finish to the cards and just taking one of the dies on its own and creating a real nice centerpiece as well. There's the, uh, the lady taking the dog for the walk. Yep, walking and the whip. One of the other embossing folders there we've got on today's show and same folder in a completely different style. So it's really, really stunning there, just those ones. And just a few more. more of the dies here as well, just setting the tone. There's so many ways of using these dies. Look at this one, really, really different way of using them. Look at these. Now, last time we had this collection on, we actually had more people wanting the collection than we actually had stock. So it's great that we've been able to bring it back for you today. If you love Art Deco, if it's the fashion, if it's the era, if it's the architecture that inspires you, I think Sue, with her designing of this, has captured that era absolutely magnificently. And I know um, Art Deco is very much a, a favorite of many of yours over the years. OV2846, now just to warn you, or not to warn you, but to let you know that if you do want to purchase, the easiest way to do it is on our website always, or tap the app. You can, of course, phone the free phone number as well, 0800 001 4433. Um, the call center, if you've never shopped with us before, will give you an account easily, simple and free. And split pay is fee free, interest free as well. So if you want split pay, it's there for everyone. It doesn't go to a finance house or anything like that. It's a, a company thing that we say you give us a third of it today. Creative Expressions will send out this brilliant brand new release from, I say it's brand new, it's two weeks old, from Sue, and you'll get it in the next few days. So 33 33 to pay today, plus your PMP, and 33 33 in four weeks and eight weeks. That's it. Then paid for, interest free, fee free. Brilliant. And the embossing folders, embossing we're going to show you those as well. Now, these embossing folders, um, these are fantastic too. Now, we've actually got, where are they? I think it's just down on oh, the there. there. There we go. We've got four. Now these are gonna match and coordinate with the collection. Maybe you bought the bundle last time, but you didn't go for the embossing folders. They are all incredible Art Deco images, which are gonna work with the die sets beautifully. And you can go for the set of four. Recommended retail price on these, 31.96. We're not doing them like that today. We're giving you a very special, that's my favorite one, the Diamond Art, I it's do love that. great, that one. And these are 3D, aren't they? Yeah, yep, they're all 3D embossing folders as well. And the interlocking squares. So not 31 anything. You get all four 3D embossing folders, giving you the Art Deco backgrounds that complement those dies brilliantly. What do you reckon the price is gonna be for these? KJ2835, you can have the whole lot for 24.99, about that. So maybe you bought the dies last time, a couple of weeks ago when Sue was here, treat yourself to the embossing fa uh, folders. And we've also got lots of other wonderful Cosmic Shimmer products in the show from Creative Expressions that will work well with these dies as well that you maybe didn't see last time. And the great thing with those folders, if you see me earlier on today, you know, I really like folders that are really gonna work hard for you. And all of those designs, although they're fantastic Art Deco designs, the, the diamond and the other ones, so, so generic and universal for so many different designs around the year as well. Absolutely. Really nice. And um, before we get into demo, I've got the boards here just to show you. This is all the dies. Do you want to do that? Yeah, yeah, right? I can go through those. So yeah, absolutely. these are the boards that show you all the dies you're going to get in the I Want It All bundle so or this. the smaller Roaring collection. Absolutely everything here. So we've got the, um, the mini expressions that uh, Sue's done there in that fantastic Art Deco font. So you can see there the... Um, embossed and de-embossed detail there in the lady's dress and the, the dog, so that's the elegant stroll. Yep. We've well, got the travelling style, I love these, we'll be playing with these uh, in the second demo, the car and the plane, little biplane that we've got there. You can personalise that banner with someone's name Absolutely. if you want to. Yeah. yeah, there's your favourite, yeah. it's great isn't it? I love that. It is. It's like be... it's a premiere of a show or something. It's like with the, the search lights, lights isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's love fantastic. It. And then we've got, I think it's really different, this floral take on uh, Art Deco. And you can use these for little corner pieces as well, um, as well as using them for uh, banners in a big way. This one we saw an awful lot when I was here a couple of weeks ago, I used this one, showing you how you can turn that into a square, as well as a rectangle, even a larger rectangle, mm -hmm. snipping into it. We're gonna be playing with this one in the first demo. Um, this is a great one, this rosette. You can use that in different ways. Again, two die sets in that. And also this one with the, uh, the little sweetie die that uh, we've got, like the, uh, the tag duo in a four die set there. I didn't so think of it as a sweetie, but it could be, like, couldn't it? A bit like yeah. a sweetie, that one. Yeah. yeah. And then dazzling diamonds. Um, loads of different combinations here with five dies that you can do. And this isn't by all means all of them, but all the different ways in which you can cut those out for your mats and layers, which, again, Sue showed us how we could do that. And also our radiant background there, diamond radiant. 
which again, loads of different combinations. And I'm gonna be playing with that one in this demo as well. Now the options dies. as to how to use these dies are absolutely endless. Art Deco never dies, it never goes out of fashion, never goes out of popularity. So from a card making point of view, you know your cards are gonna be popular. But it's just, I think Sue has just done such a great job in capturing the elegance, uh, the opulence mm. of that era as well, whether it's fashion, whether it's architecture, whatever. 99.99, but you don't have to pay that in full if you don't want to, just give us the first split payment of of three, 3333, 33, and that whole collection is on its way. And of course, as we go through the demos, we will do a little shopping list of what James has been using in the demos as well. So, right, over shall, to we, you, shall we have a play? Yeah. So, uh, so, we're going to use quite a few different combinations here of, of dies. So, we've got the uh, Fan Tell Rosette, the um, diamond radiant background, and also the uh, decorative tag duo, as well as that amazing Art Deco embossing folder the Rhapsody that we've got there as well. So, we've got all different combinations, but we're going to be using different parts of them to put together what we want for all the different elements that we've got here. And just to let you know, if your budget doesn't stretch to the full collection or you just want an individual die or something, they're all going to be on the website. So have a little look now. Uh, Alex has put them on, or is just putting them on now for you. So, so they you should can, be there. Uh, yeah. That's great. Cherry pick. So let's have a little look at this one first. So I'm just going to um, remind some of you that maybe didn't see them before just how Sue likes to work her die. So we've got two dies in this set. Um, a lot of them have an awful lot more as well, but just these two two die sets alone allow you to do clever things like this. So you can cut out that background die shape that we've got there and you can combine the two or use this one on its own to create that design that we've got there. Wow. So when you cut those out, you can start to get really clever with all your mats and layers. And also not just what is, if you like, the pieces that you want to keep, but also the little bits and pieces that pop out, if you like, your wastage. Mm. Uh, and this design is going to use an awful lot of that. We're going to be using all the bits and pieces that we'd normally cut out, uh, cut away. Mm -hmm. We're actually going to be bringing those back in and doing a bit of paper placing. And that would work land Landscape as well as portrait. It, it? would, absolutely. Yeah. Um, so we're going to be using that in a couple of different ways. So I'm going to show you what, what we're going to do just with this one die, mm -hmm. and then we'll start to form together the design bit by bit and uh, get to the card to give away. Excellent. So let's start off with this one, and I'm going to come in with some glue here and just turn around and glue that one on top of there. And don't forget, if you want to be in with the chance of winning the card from James and Sue, all you've got to do is just email in studio at hobbymaker.co.uk is the email address and your name, address and customer number and you could win it by the end of the show. Yeah, if you've got any questions, feel free to yeah. test me. <laughs> <laughs> That's what he's here for. That's what I'm here for. There we go. I'm just going to pop a little bit of glue down around the edges here. just And because we're actually only going to be using a couple of elements from this for the finished card. So I'm not too worried about this center section. I'm just going to put some glue in there just to hold it in position. Mm -hmm. So let's pop that down there. Certainly don't need a lot, but it's just these end pieces that I'm worried about here. And the play of colour you can enjoy when you're doing Art Deco. There's no rules really, is there? There isn't. And it's, I was looking at this before I started uh, designing out and laying the cards. It's all very much sort of real, actually quite bright, vibrant colours. So you think golds and silvers, but also having a real s sort of splash of one colour or two yep. colours. Yep. So that's what I've tried to do here. So I'm bringing this really nice um, teal colour card. I think it's cornflower blue that we've got there. Um, that I'm going to use. And I'm just going to look to actually place these pieces back in mm -hmm. into these areas here. And so paper piecing is so satisfying. It's like it completing a jigsaw every time you do it. So I've got our little... Um, pick up tool. Pick up tool there. That we can just pop those pieces in uh, one at a time. So oh, get it around the right way, James. And we do have um, pick up tools on the website as well. Uh, often we talk about them for picking up pearls and gemstones, but it's perfect for paper piecing as well. We were asked that yes. on a show the other day. Yeah, definitely. And we're just going to do the other side as well, and then I'll show you where this is then going to go when it is all dry. Mm -hmm. Pop that one in there, and that one in there. Art Deco was such I a favourite era for so many people for totally different well. reasons. There we go. So we've got that finished piece there. Yep. Um, when that's all completely dry, I'm going to end up with something that looks like that. And what I'm actually going to do is just go in there. I'm going to snick away just these end pieces, which we know from listening to Sue last time. This is all very much what it's all about. It's taking, snicking away and using different parts of the die to do right. she different about things. That. She really does when she yeah. designs the dies. And obviously that isn't wastage by any means. That's for another proje uh, project. But for the moment, we just want those two pieces for this card design. Mm -hmm. Now, I mean, Sue always wants her dice to do at least three or four different things. Definitely. She, she always yeah. wants to make sure you're going to get loads of loads of value out of all of your designs, uh, of all of the dies that she designs, to make sure you can do lots of different things with them. 
And it really is the very, very much the case with this uh, Art Deco collection. So what I've got here is I've got the other uh, die that I've shown you at the beginning of the hour, mm -hmm. which is our little sweetie die, mm -hmm. which is the tag duo. Again, it comes in two parts, so you can use uh, both of these on their own and also together to create things like that background yep. and also that inner piece there that I'm going to be using. So I'm going to use those two together to create uh, something similar to that, but with a slightly different take that we're okay. going to do on that. And then we'll start to bring the pieces together there. So we've got a, a piece of double-sided adhesive sheet on here, which is one of my favorite. I absolutely love these. You'll, you'll start to learn that I use these an awful, awful lot for different things. And we have got the adhesive sheets in the show that we'll give you details of fairly soon, so. And I'm going to place the outline die carefully, he says, down over the top of my adhesive sheet like that, and then take that piece that I removed and just use that to tap that down into position. Now all will come clear why I've done that in two seconds but before I go uh, one stage further I'm just going to take a couple pieces of these and mm -hmm. just place them because the, the great thing with this as a uh, double-sided adhesive sheet is you have got the ability just to pop these in without having to use the glue. Exactly. You can just turn around and use these and the double-sided these of sheet will just pop those down into position. And you get five A4 sheets in a pack. Details coming soon. There we go. So you can start to build it up like that. Now what we're going to do is take it a little stage further and I've put down some very, very tiny little pieces in here. That, so all these little cutaway pieces, I've actually placed them back into the die just like that. And if you go over the whole area when you've done it, you're going to end up with something that looks a little bit like that. So I just oh, wanted wow. to speed the process up. Now the adhesive sheets Alex has put on the screen for you. There we are, look. So if you want those, EI 2869 £5.75 for five A4 sheets. Okay, so remembering that's all still sticky there, um, shall we talk velvet dust? Oh, this because I'm is gonna one have of the, a, I'm gonna this have is a one of the new inventions dust. that everyone yeah. loves. Velvet <laughs> dust. It's like when you use it, it feels like you're touching um, touching velvet, basically. It does. Yeah. I didn't think I was going to get to play with this today. I honestly, uh, it was only hours, literally, uh, of whether we would have this in stock. Uh, it just sold out, didn't it? It completely sold out. It oversold. Um, yeah, and it was only just. I've not been able to get any more. These were the only two pots I had left over from a couple of weeks ago. Okay. And I've well, had to work these demos to it's make it work. Really Restocked today. Mm. You get the white and you get the black, and it's in stock. It's on the website, okay? LM2834 if you want the set of two velvet dusts, which sold out before. This is the price for them. It is like you're touching a velvet cushion when you actually touch it. £8.99. If you missed out last time, or maybe you phoned the call centre and they said, sorry, it's not available, we've got quite a healthy stock available for you, and this is going to be used in the demo. So there it is, LM2834. Lots of you coming straight in for this. It's unlike any other product I've ever, ever seen before. But if you're not really a Glitter fan, but you like the, the feel of velvet to the touch, then this is going to be right up your street. Yeah, it's really, really different. So it's, it's a very like, like a fine glitter in the sense of the particle, but it's not glistening. It's something very, very different. I've got a couple of sample boards there that uh, Dave's got in front of him. And you can see on black and white card, you get a really different effect. So if you didn't see me play with this last time, um, it's got a ever such a, a slight shimmer to it, but it's more subtle, it isn't really it? hasn't. It's very, very, very subtle. It's lovely to the touch. Um, the white uh, on dark card gives you this fantastic sort of muted silver, sort of like a matte silver, as well as a really bright white. But the best way of describing it, it's almost like a velvet um, curtain where it soaks up the light, so you get yeah. a real black, black. Sounds odd, but that's the best way of kind of describing it. And this is going to work so well with the uh, the Art Deco theme of the design. It's dyes. just an Art Deco type of product, isn't it? Exactly. It really is. And I know we had lots of fun with it last time. I mean, slightly different way of using it this so time. So that's what it's like on black card. That's what it's like on white card. Yeah. That's the white on black card and then the white on white card. Yeah. But it's absolutely lovely. You've just got to touch it. And if you want to stock up and order it, lots of you coming in for this right now. It's eight ninety nine. It's been out of stock for a couple of weeks. It's back today. I haven't been able to get hold of any more myself. Literally, that was what I had when Sue was here last time. So yeah, really. So let me show you a different way of using it. So um, last time, um, I, you would have seen me with my famous little boxes coming out, popping the product in there, and going over the top with the um, with the velvet dust. We're still going to use the velvet dust, but I've been having a play a couple of weeks on now. I've discovered a few different ways of using it. And what I've got in here, and we've got all of this um, in the bundles that mm -hmm. Dave will tell you about in a little, a little bit. I know there's not a lot there, there's plenty, is there's actually a bit of a mix of velvet dust and silk glitter. Now, what I wanted to do here, you know, uh, sort of Art Deco ladies, when you think the dresses they wore, they sort of almost have a bit of a shimmer, almost like yep. sequins, yep. but not that often. They're kind of dotted around the fabric. That's kind of what I was going for with this. Okay. So 
this is getting sort of a little bit uh, like a chemistry kit again. Okay. And it's good fun, this. Mix your so I'm just going to take a little bit of the velvet dust and pop it into my pot there, like so. Pop the lid on that because that literally is like gold dust. <laughs> I can't get any more. <laughs> and then I'm going to take a pinch of the gold and it literally is a pinch. And we got this silk glitter in, the, uh, in one of the bundles. Now, when you mix that together, this is the smoothest glitter I've ever, ever touched in my life. It's just, when you roll it in your fingers, it just rolls like tiny little beads. It does, yeah. Now, I know it's not going to be very easy to see, but what I've got here is a couple of swatches, one done in gold, one done in silver, and it will show you the difference oh, there. Wow. Now, it's subtle. If we bring in the, the black that I've got, yep. you can start to see the difference between a, tr a true black and then that silver and that gold. It's just a very, very subtle spread out glitter. So if you don't, you're not a glittery, glittery person, I can't, I'm kind of not. I, this is why I love this product. Mm. It gives you the ability to add that subtle, very much an art decorative well, if I style. angle it to Levi on camera too, yeah. you might be able to That's see it a little bit better. Play with. There's the gold in there, look. Oh, brilliant. That's cool. Perfect. Hey, good shot, Levi. I'll leave you Amazing. The, the silver one as well. That's brilliant. So that's the, um, that's the gold, wonderfully smooth glitter mm. mixed with the velvet dust. And this is the silver. And we've got those as uh, a set coming up in a second if you fancy getting hold of the glitter. Look at that. It's like a starry night sky, isn't it? It is. There's so many uses for that I've thought of already. Um, I think the gold is... So I've just mixed uh, just enough to have what I need because obviously I don't want to mix any more than I need because I've mm -hmm. got that if you like contaminated, but it's what I want. I want that gold in yep. there. So I'm going to go in with my little um, my little cutaway that I've got here with my double-sided adhesive sheet on. And somewhere I should have, he says, hopefully, some sponges. If not, I will use the one in the box. And I'm going to pop that over the top and just sprinkle the mix that we've got of the black and the gold. Mm -hmm using the velvet dust and the silk glitter. Now, it isn't a, a case of mixing two glitters. This really isn't a glitter. As you saw me last time, we'd have known. It's totally, totally different. But the size of the particles and the uh, smoothness of it works together so, so well. It's so clean to work with. And again, this is why you need your double-sided sheets, because yep. it just sticks to it perfectly. Look at that. It just looks <gasps> completely different to what we were doing last time. Oh, man, look. But it's so easy. Look at that. Isn't that amazing? Because that's mixing the velvet dust and also, what was the glitter called? That was the Sahara Gold Polished Silk Glitter. Yep. And it's not jagged or abrasive like most glitters can be. It's as smooth as smooth can it be. It does look like those, I know I'm saying it myself, but I just, when I, as soon as I did it, I thought that is exactly what I wanted. It's just like those Art Deco ladies' yeah. dresses and the wallpapers and the wall finishes that you see in the hotels. Oh, I love it. So I thought this is perfect to go with Art Deco. So we've got that. And what I'm actually going to do is just, I'm going to trim that in half and I can do that. Uh, let's just use my scissors. Just up, down, through the center like so, like mm -hmm. that. Yeah. And then we've got our two halves that we're going to bring into play for the piece that we're going to work with. Right. And then we've got another little finished piece here, which is another double-sided adhesive sheet yeah. on black card with that um, diamond finish that we had in the, the center. So this is just the center part of the die that I've got here. Yeah. So just to show you the one that we're playing with, it's that one there. But like all of Sue's dies, it's only the center piece I'm actually using right. just, to, just to play with and cut it out. So we're going to pop the cut away that we've done over the top of the black. And with the potential, like there's so many Carefully. different ways of using the dies, the potential is absolutely enormous, huge. Lo I mean, any one of these elements would, would make a card in their own yes. right, but this is really kind of just to show you having a play, demonstration purposes of just what we can do. Um, because we like this combination, I'm going to use it on here. <laughs> Why not? Because it works so, so well. And let's go over there. You can see a little goes a very, very long way, actually, mm -hmm. because it is so, so fine. It just covers the whole area very, very quickly. And most and of easy. it goes back into the bucket. It does, yeah. I mean, that is my top tip with any of this. It just uh, uh, it really does get the most out of your product when you work like this. So there we go. There's that piece finished off there. It starts to form up a bit of a, a topper. And then we can bring in our sentiment from Sue. Mm -hmm. I've got one here with some foam tape that I've done earlier, and I'm just going to pop a little bit of glue on the back here. So this is our Roaring Good Time, and I've just matte and layered it using uh, Sue's dye just to cut it out. The black cardstock to add a shadow and a really nice striking colour. So using that same cornflower blue that I used at the beginning, I've got a little bit 
of that in the font so the colour follows through. And Alex, if you just got in, has put the main collection, everything there. I want it all bundled from the Art Deco collection from Sue on the screen. You've got a 20, just over £22 saving, 99 99 and it's on three interest-free, fee-free split pays as well. 33 33 is all you have to pay today, plus your one PMP for the whole day. That's great that we got the uh, split pay again. All yeah, right, love brilliant. it. So there's our top. I'm going to pop that to one side. Another piece I'm going to bring in. So this is another part of the frame from that diamond. So this is the outer, but on a separate uh, piece altogether. Again, double-sided sheet. Mm -hmm. You can see I love my double-sided sheets on all these oh, yeah. things. <laughs> there aren't many shows I do with you. We don't well, I use don't them, use them. I know, you're, you're learning what I go to. But it's so versatile with what you can do, because not only am I, in a way, kind of every time I do it, I'm, I'm cheating. See, I'm not having to glue this down, because it just sticks down on its own. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Uh, but it also gives me all that area in the middle to then play with. I'm all for an easy life. And it just makes the whole thing, yeah, dead easy then and yep. clean and tidy. So I'm going to go in here with uh, a slightly different product that I've got from one of my collections um, that I've put together. And I'm going to use some of our mineral mica. And this is another product that I sort of picked out. I thought that is absolutely perfect. Mm -hmm. um, so this is in the silver set. We were saying before, I think sooner or later we should have a Cosmic Shimmer Hour of just some of the amazing products. That They're always, so there's so much you can you can do with them. That's yeah. the thing. There's yeah. so many versatile ways. I'm going to just pop my a little and bit more. such great quali uh, so quality too. It comes in a massive pot, this does. You can see here, huge pot. And this is the Silver Grand Perla. And again, this is one of these products which will look a different colour if it is on white or if it's on black. Mm -hmm. It will actually kind of colour change slightly because of what's underneath it. So I'm just going to go around there with the excess. We'll brush that off. And again, it's finished a totally different texture and a different finish again to that velvet dust. So it's, and it's not a glitter either. But it's not a glitter, but it's got that little bit of Art Deco shimmer, if you yes. like, I think. I think you're right. Kind of all come to, I'll let you have a little. Okay, we'll hold that up. This is, the, uh, this is the mica, the silver mica. Look at that. Isn't that amazing? And it's completely smooth as well. There's no kind of roughness to it or anything like that. So that's coming up in the silver set, which is on the screen now, but we'll show it to you exactly what's in there in a second. So I'll, I'll leave you with that one. I've got okay. one here I've done earlier with a bit of tape on the back, ready for in a moment. I'm just gonna start to build this up. So we're gonna go onto the back of this and we're gonna start to add in these bits that we made right at the top of the hour with some glue, just to create a bit of a design around the edge. So I'm gonna go around here with this like so. Mm -hmm. You can see how using Sue's dies in various different ways, you can start to create a really nice Art Deco design. Yeah. And this so is where just using one or two dies on their own, you can, but using them together and it totally different level it comes to there. I mean, you don't have to use any of Sue's dies in the same way more than once no. if you don't want to. No. I think that's the nice thing with this collection is you can get it home and you can use it in so many different ways. And also um, it works for ladies, guys, older, yeah. younger, everyone. So I'm just going along the edges here that we, of the tops that we cut in half just to turn around and then mold them around this outer edge. And I just think it creates a really nice Art Deco inspired frame just with those two Cosmic Shimmer products. And I feel like we should be having some Charleston music in the background. Start, like that. Well, I'll let you do some dancing behind me if you oh, like no. to. You can, oh, yeah. no. <laughs> can you imagine? <laughs> I think we'll leave that to you. How to lose audience in the <laughs> There we go. So that's just gone around and just really glued those little wings that I've made up around there. And if it starts that's to come together, amazing. it's a really nice centre. Uh, something you see in a hotel lobby almost, isn't yeah, it? it is. that era? Yeah, Then we've got our topper that we did with the diamond topper with the words on. That's going to sit lovely in the middle there because it came from that same die set. So we know it, it all fits in there to stack up with a little bit of foam tape. And I'm sure Sue's and designing got... eye made sure that these elements fitted the, the size, the size of, the frame. of the frame. Yeah, yeah. And that's where we, we, we learned that from last time where she's so, so clever with that. So let's have a look at the embossing folder just to finish this whole card off really quickly. So I've got an embossing folder here. Let's have a little look. I'm going to use... Do, 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 do. Now the embossing folders, all four of them are traditional Art Deco images. And we've got a great deal on those as well. I'll show them to you while James is looking for yeah. whatever. There we've got the fans. <laughs> So that's a classic Art Deco image, 3D. You've then got this one here, which is the Art Deco Rhapsody, more angular, almost like a bandstand sort of feel to that one. This one is the Diamond Art. Now that gives you the effect of like a diamond quilt. Really, really beautiful. And then the last one there is the interlocking squares. So all four of these 
should be 31.96 but today you can get all four of them for 24 pounds and 99 pence and it complements this collection and they stand alone on their own as well mm. so Right, so what I've got here is a piece of that same colour cardstock that I am going to turn around and just give a light spray. And what we're going to do is emboss this, um, but because it's a continued pattern, a little bit like I did last time, a couple of the other designs, I can move it across and extend the design on oh, so the cardstock. So you can make, it bigger, so I can make it bigger than the folder. Yeah, absolutely. So we're just going to go over there and pass it through the machine once to start with, and then I can extend it as well. Lovely. Through like that. Nice and easy. There we go. And then we're going to go and have a go at lining up that design now. So I'm just going to shift that across just slightly. Do the fans kind of lock in? And they will lock in. Because it's a 3D designed folder, it makes it even that little bit easier. And I right. can kind of use the pattern from above as well. And just to shift that around and get it to line up. So excuse my head. I'm just going to go and have a look from over the top. Mm -hmm. There we go. So I'm going to go in with it just like that. Perfect. And not forgetting the fact that we've got a top to put onto this, so I don't have to be too exact no. like I have been in the past. And I'm just going to make sure that the top plate staggers over the top of the embossing folder because I know I'm embossed down to about there, mm -hmm. and then that stops that sharp edge appearing on the design. So well, those of you coming through for the embossing folders, Kay in South Yorkshire, Susan in Norfolk, Jane in the Channel Islands, just three of you coming through uh, of many for these embossing folders, and you get all four for 24 dollars which is a really good deal. Okay, so then we've got our design that's been extended right the way across, fuller width of the embossing amazing? folder. Can't see a join at all. Perfect. So you can't see that. We're going to bring in some of our enchanted gold metallic gilding polish that I've put together and put inside one of the uh, bundles. So this is the enchanted gold. So it looks like a really nice posh sort of white gold, almost mm -hmm. like a white gold. But the great thing with this, it's one of these interference products that on black and white card, it looks completely different. Right. So if I just put, because that's a slightly different top, if I show you what that looks on black card, it looks like a real, real strong striking gold. But you'll mm -hmm. see when I go over the top of a lighter color, even white card stock, it would look like in the pot. Sure. But I'm going to use it over the top of here. And I'm just going to drag it over the top ever so lightly. <sighs> And it looks a different colour again. It does. Completely different, but it works in with the colour of the cardstock. But what a difference it makes. And it brings out all that design that's in that 3D embossing folder just by straking that across so there. you're using the smallest amount, the tiniest oh, amount. It, yeah, you, you don't want too much. If you use too much, it'll actually kind of interfere with the design. So I just want to go in over the top and just scrape the smallest amount over the top of that design like so. That we've done. There we go. So there we go, we've got oh, that finished off like that, which looks a lovely Sorry, background coming together. You can have up. a little look at that. Look at that. Look at that, what a product. That's incredible. Details of that coming in a minute. Love it. I love the fact that, you know, James gets to put this show together because he knows what products he wants from Cosmic Shimmer from Creative Expressions to work with the dyes, work with the embossing folders. The gold set's coming on the screen. I'll show you what's in the gold set in a sec, though. Mm. Uh, another double-sided <laughs> adhesive sheet. Yeah. Um, they are great. They, they, they really are my go-to product. I think we all have them as designers, and I think this is probably mine. I've come to. They just make the life so much easier. Yeah, they do, mate. Especially, you know, again, I wanted to have an edge to this, so why not use it to stick down a 3D embossing folder? Because they're not necessarily the easiest things to glue down anyway, no. because of the dimension on them. So with an adhesive sheet, I can't go wrong. I know all around the edges, stuck down really well. It's not going to lift off. But more importantly, I've now got this little edge that's just slightly larger than the piece of embossing folder I did. Yep. Uh, which I can now go in with some of our velvet dust again. Excellent. I like it so much. I'm going to go back in there and just add a little bit to show you how you can use it, not just to make toppers, but also use it to make uh, really nice borders as well. And black on black will be really subtle, but you'll see the difference to have that texture. Yeah, and I think that's the nice thing. You're absolutely spot on. You've got the black card there, but it is a very, very different effect. So we're going to go around two of the sides to start with with the velvet dust and brush off the excess there. And this is the velvet dust you mix with the This is smooth the velvet glitter. dust with the smooth glitter that I've got yep. here, yeah. So rather than just using the uh, the black, I thought we'd, we'd stick with the same theme that we've got running right the way through. So that's mm -hmm. two of the sides done. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go across the bottom now. The You're going to have so much fun with all these products. You They're really brilliant. Are. The velvet dust has been so, so popular 
It really has in the short time. It's, well, it only launched a couple of weeks ago. Mm. And it did sell out first time it was on air. Yeah. We've got it back today. First time it's been back since then, so. There we go. So got a really nice, elegant border around the edge of that, which I can bring everything together. There you go. Look at that for an edge. Isn't that beautiful? So all of the adhesive has completely been covered with the velvet dust, but that was mixed with a little bit of the gold smooth glitter, which we'll show you again at the end of the demo. So not long to wait. And then we can put our topper on that we did right at the top there. We can pop that one in the middle and I'm gonna go just like that with some foam tape behind. And then we are all done and then that's ready to give away. Okay, so that's what we're giving away at the end of the show. You've got about 10 minutes left to get your emails in before we actually close it and put everybody on the wheel. Uh, studio at hobbymaker.co.uk if you fancy winning that from James today. Have a roaring good time. It could be on its way to you in the next few days. Right, now what did James use in that demonstration? Well, we did kind of flash a few things up as we were going. Obviously, his hero product, his go-to product <laughs> is the pack of five A4 adhesive sheets. They make life so much easier, especially with your glitters and your velvet dusts, all those sort of products. So if you want those, they're only 575 and the beauty of shopping with us is it's one PMP per day. So these little extras that you might think, oh, I need that. If you've already paid your PMP once today, this afternoon anyway, uh, you can shop PMP free for the rest of the evening. Five pounds seventy-five for five A4 sheets. That's a must-have. Well, then we have, remember, the velvet dust. Now this was new when Sue was here a couple of weeks ago and it flew and it sold out. We've got it back today. So if you missed out then or you bought it and you love it and you're running out now maybe, uh, because this is quite addictive to use and it is literally like velvet to the touch. There it is on black, there it is on white, uh, and there it is the white one on black cardstock and on white cardstock. So you're gonna get 50 mil, uh, 25, in, uh, 25 mil in each one, I think, is that right? Yeah, 25 million each one, so 50 mil in total, 25 of the white, 25 of the black uh, velvet dust. There you go. One of the latest products from Cosmic Shimmer. Now, these silver and gold trios we talked about, let me bring in the silver one first of all. The silver trio that James has brilliantly put together for us today includes your metallic gilding polish in silver. Also, the polished silk glitter, it is like little spheres. It's not jagged and rough like most glitters can be. It's as smooth as smooth can be. So you get a pot of that. And you're also gonna get that um, beautiful mineral mica that we used in that demonstration. So have a little look at that. All three together, if you fancy those in the silver, we can put that up on the screen. That is 17 pounds and 50 pence if you want that. And the product code for that, if you want it, I'll read it out to you, is WN. 2868, WN2868, if you want to go for your mineral mica, your silk glitter, your polished silk glitter, and also your gilding polish as well. And I think we've lost our graphics at the moment, apologies. If you go to the website or call the call center, uh, they'll be able to help you. Can I just quickly though, show you the gold? Cause I know you've been waiting to see the gold. There won't be any details on the screen yet, but I just want to give you the option of, so you know what you're gonna get. Chocolate gold gilding flakes is the first product in these three. There is your chocolate and gold gilding flakes. There is your Sahara gold polishing silk glitter. That's what I was mixing in. And then the enchanted gold metallic polish is that one just there. So that's what we used in the demo on the, uh, on the turquoise that's a few right. minutes ago. So if you fancy that, that's the gold set of three. Also, that's at a great price as well. And if you fancy that, again, just call the call center or have a little look on our website, uh, hobbymaker.co.uk or call the call center on our free phone number. All right, James, back Should to you. Should we have a look at the demo? Yeah, yeah, we'll get the graphics back on as soon as we can. Apologies. Perfect. That's okay. So what I've got here is one of the other embossing folders and I've done exactly the same technique where we did uh, half and then moved it across to extend the design. And this is one of those really, really popular, I think really versatile. It's like a waffle. Universal. Though, it? It's like a waffle. It is like a waffle. Yeah, it's brilliant. And we're gonna do that same technique, but we're gonna use the silver that Dave was just showing you. So you can see how those two bundles that I put together for you is all I've used on both of these demonstrations, and it works really, really well for your gold and your silver. So just dragging that over the top <laughs> of that amazing. embossing folder. And I'll tell you what, we just do half, so you can kind of see, if you like, the before and after. You look how different that is. It just almost looks absolutely striking there. It's amazing. Whereas, you can imagine doing that whole area. Well, I'll show you. So when you've done the whole area, 
you're going to get that sort of design there. It looks absolutely striking what you can do compared, or you could even do the similar effect on the back and have a totally different design yeah. again. So I think that embossing folder is absolutely stunning. It's Grab those four ones. embossing folders if you can. Incredible. You're going to go uh, use timing time again without a doubt. So just to mount that onto some uh, card here, I'm actually not going to use an adhesive sheet that I will be using and a lot of adhesive sheets in a minute. So I'm just going to pop some glue around this one and build up the car and put this on the back like so. And of course that is your Cosmic Shimmer Glue which is a, another Hero product. It's a real, real go-to product for all of us. Dries very, very completely clear, it really does so. You can kind of use it and not have to panic too much and it just grabs and holds straight away. I think that was really the first glue I ever got to know when I started doing crafting TV. Me too actually, going back way years. before I, yeah. Uh, it's, it's one of those hero products that just works. I mean, yeah, that's what you want. Reference. Yeah, absolutely. So, um, <laughs> double-sided adhesive sheet, there we go. I'm going to use it here now at this stage. And we'll jump through a couple of stages here just to show you how I've put this together. Because what I've actually done is I've got a piece of adhesive sheet um, here, which double-sided ones, which I'm going to, low, uh, going to place onto this black cardstock. Mm -hmm. But what I'm doing is I'm going to place it in such a way so I've got a bit of black cardstock still showing around the edge. So it just gives me a bit of a border to okay. it. And just a reminder, we've got an issue with our graphics at the moment. Don't worry, if you do want anything and you're not sure what item numbers are, it's all on the website. Or if you want to call the call centre, if it's something that you know what, what you want, they'll sort it for you. Just give them a call and they'll sort that for you, no trouble at all. Brilliant. So I've got that fantastic striking Chrysler Building inspired die there, which yep. I'm going to go over the top using that other side of the double adhesive sheet that I've now peeled off. I'm going to place this over there. Again, got a very, very, very small border of adhesive sheet showing around the edge, but that's just going to apply and stick down over the top of there like so. I mean, it makes me think of New York, but to be fair, it could make you think of quite a few places. It could, yeah. It's quite, quite a universal Detroit, design. Philadelphia, maybe. So once I've done that, I'm going to then start to paper place in some bits and pieces that I've got here. And I'm going to show you what I've actually done, because what I've got here, jumped ahead a few stages, and I have got, just pop that one to one side, a few of that same design cut out. So when you cut out this top piece, you want to keep all of your fall away pieces, because oh. you're going to place those all back in now, Okay. Um, because what that top piece is actually is another double-sided adhesive sheet. So I've actually stuck an adhesive sheet on the top of another one. Right, okay. Okay, it will all make sense as I put this together quite quickly now. So what I've got here is all, all these bits and pieces. I'm just going to place a few in because I'm mindful of time, so I don't want to put loads of time on this because you've seen me do the paper placing before, but I'm going to place all these pieces back in mm -hmm. to this same design. But all of these pieces, each individual piece, is actually a double-sided adhesive sheet. Right. So what that means is we can start to place these back in, but also start to peel away all the different pieces at different times right. to turn around and make a completely different picture using lots of different Cosmic Shimmer products. So all these little bits and pieces here, they all go in as well. Mm -hmm. So this is where it becomes a jigsaw puzzle. <laughs> And you've got so James, to find always, all the pieces kind of, in here. Yeah, you know, brings demonstrations that make you think, things that I would never have thought of doing, which is fantastic. Dif just different ways of working, different yeah. ways of using the products, different ways of using the collection. So I would go through that whole design. I'm not going to do the whole thing right now. I'm just going to pick out another colour here. So this is the, uh, the blue denim cardstock. So I did recut it in this blue, and I'm mm -hmm. going to put this back into these pieces here. And then what I will show you is where this goes when you've put all of the pieces back in. I find this, this is quite therapeutic to do these sorts of things. I quite like sitting down and die cutting them out. And then this is the sort of thing you can have all your pieces together and you put know them back it's perfectly going to fit as well, yeah. which is nice. It's dead easy just to build them in. So just putting all the pieces and pieces back in like that. So I've got both a combination of colour and double sided adhesive sheet right the way across the whole design. Yep. So when you've done that whole area, let me just move these pieces to one side. I will show you what that then looks if we jump forward a couple of stages because we don't want to spend too long putting all those pieces in. Well, what I've got here, I've very carefully done as one I've done earlier, is a combination of all of those bits and pieces stuck down. You're one of the off. most organised crafters I've ever met. <laughs> <laughs> said that last, I'll take it as a compliment. Yeah, it's <laughs> So there we go, we've got that, all of those bits and pieces placed back in. Okay. With just a couple left for me to put down, which I'm gonna do with these here. That is so striking. 
and it really looks stunning already, doesn't it? But wait till, here we go, this is where the jigsaw puzzle, it shouldn't be that difficult, James, there's only two pieces, come on. 50-50 <laughs> chance, there we go. So that's where you end up when you've put them all together like that. Then what I'm gonna do is a combination of peeling off different bits and pieces and uh, putting them in different boxes. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna start off with the gilding flakes because okay. I've got underneath here all these tacky areas still in place. Right. So this is our chocolate gold gilding flakes. So That's in the gold set, remember? It is, three yeah. Products. yeah. So all of these uh, products are used right the way across this one card to really kind of give you a, a great idea of how they can work together and how they look as well. So. There you go, yeah, absolutely. So I love this colour, the golds, the chocolates in this, yeah, absolutely beautiful. stunning, this one is. And again, so, so perfect for the era, isn't it, as well? It is, yeah, it is. It's a real Art Deco finish. So pop those in there. Now remember, all the products in the show, sorry about our graphics, we're working on it to get that back for you. If you go to our website, which is hobbymaker.co.uk, you'll see everything in the show, all the prices, all the item numbers. You can order on the website, or if you'd rather call the call centre, you can do that, and they've got everything at their fingertips as well. There it all is, look, all the products. Those trios in the silver and the gold, uh, the wordies that we've got available, they're there as well. The glue, the embossing folders, all the bundles, all the deals, they're all on the website, hobbymaker.co.uk, or tap the app. Brilliant. So there we go. We, so what we've done is we've gone in with our first layer, if you like, which is our gold, chocolate gold gilding flakes. And we've just picked out some of the design, but yep. we're gonna go a couple of stages further as well. Oh, look, so amazing. it starts to go, come together really nicely. Let me get my little picky tool and we'll pick out a few of these bits. So what should we do next? Let's do, let's do the uh, Gran Perla design, which is all of the um, bits and pieces here from the design here. So this is Grand Perla, or will be the uh, Grand Perla micas that we've got. You saw me used earlier. So what I've done is all these little pieces that I put back in, mm -hmm. they were cut from the original um, design. So I've not had to cut loads of duplicates, I've just cut one, right. and I've just placed them back in. But because they are double-sided adhesive sheet that I've put on there, it means that I can peel them off individually. And this is definitely one of those product projects which Re, you know, it takes a little bit more time. The results are stunning. Mm -hmm. You could easily do this with just maybe one level. You could just stop at the at the gilding flakes if you wanted to and put in different colored card stocks. And yeah. it's because you use a double-sided sheet. You can do these sheets, you can do this. Yeah, yeah. It kind of, as I got carried away, I started the process. And I thought, I know you what You get I carried away, it's I great. <laughs> 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 so I've got the Grand Perla Mineral Mica here that we used uh, on the last card. I'm going to go in here with the product that's going to go over the top of that black and you'll see it have a very different look to what I did before. I think we did it on a light coloured cardstock. So mm -hmm. this is going to have a more black and silver tone to it rather than the tone we had before. And then we're going to go in with another product which I'm going to... Ooh, don't, don't forget card the card! There. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. And I'm going to go in now with, let's have a look, the white I think. So I'm going to put a white velvet dust, which we haven't used just yet, but I'm going to use it on here. So I'm going to treat this a bit like the searchlights. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to turn around and pick out all of these bits and pieces here with the windows as well. Loads of you are wanting to win the card that uh, James made in the first demonstration. We will spin that wheel before the end of the show, I promise you. The wheel isn't broken. The graphics might be at the moment, but the wheel is there. there <laughs> it's still there. You're all being added, don't worry. So this is the white velvet dust that we're going to go in over the top of this light coloured cardstock. Um, I would normally pick out all of these windows, but for time I'm mindful where we are. So I'm just going to stop at those few, but okay. all of these would be cut out as well. I've also obviously got a, a one I've done earlier, which I'll be able to share with you in a minute. So but I just want to show you the finished process. So this is now going over the top with the, the velvet white dust. velvet dust. I think the, the thing you've got to remember with all these products, we're going over the top with one, two, three, four different, but they're not mixing. No, they're not. And they're really fine. It and doesn't matter. Because of the double sided adhesive yeah. sheets. So now we've got that fantastic texture on there. It you know, looks you've stunning, got to touch doesn't it? When you've done it. <laughs> and now I'm going to go over the top with some of the black velvet dust, is going to be my next. So just the true black. And this is where, and this is the lovely bit I like, because this is the big area now. So I would normally peel off all the windows as well. And I'll show you what it looks like on a finished piece. But this whole die I originally done was a double-sided adhesive sheet. 
Right. So I've peeled that off. So I've got that whole black design there is now ready to take some black velvet dust or midnight black velvet dust. So this is going to look striking. So if you remember what that looks like now with yep. that black cardstock and how really black this looks when I finish it off because it's going to look completely different. And the thing to note here is I'm going over the top of the dark product over the top of all that light product and it will not mix. It won't stick down. It won't get in the way. I'm just going to brush off the excess using our applicators. And there's no gaps. There's it no, fills every, it, it every bit fills of the sticky sheet perfectly. It all up. And you've got an amazing time. I know there's a little, few stages there. And so it's kind of demonstration purposes. It gets me an opportunity to show you all the different products in one go. But just what you can do with a very humble adhesive sheet and a piece of card, really. And it is the perfect dye that. to do all those techniques. Absolutely perfect. So I'll just tilt, tilt it towards the camera so you can have a little look at that. It is glorious. Brilliant demonstrations, brilliant products. Remember, Creative Expressions is the umbrella company. Cosmic Shimmer is the, uh, the kind of glitter side of it and the gilding flake side of it, um, the, the glue as well. But isn't that just magnificent? I mean, it looks of that era, all the colors that James has used there, the blues, the whites, the golds, and the silvers, absolutely magnificent. So all of those products are on the website right now. I'm pleased to tell you that the actual dust, the velvet dust is back in stock today after selling out a couple of weeks ago, and it's going very, very fast. We've got white and silver, uh, sorry, no, white and black together, beg your pardon, white and black together, uh, and they are available, and they're 25 mil pots each. So a little bit goes a long, long way. They're only 8.99 for both. So four pound 50 each. <coughs> Excuse me, the code is LM2834. So LM2834 if you want the velvet dust in the white and the black. And then the I Want It All collection, <coughs> which is here. All of the dyes, and this is the most popular because, of course, you're going to get absolutely the whole lot. This is the entire collection designed by Sue. It's only been out about two weeks. Uh, you've got, of course, the Chrysler building that was in that demonstration. All the other dyes you can see there as well. All the tags, you've got the verses there. <coughs> Excuse me, you've got the lady walking the dog. It's all there. And just looking at some of those finished cards, it gives you the inspiration as to how dramatic and how beautiful your, uh, your cards can be. Okay, Shall and there pop, it is. I'll pop some of the details, <coughs> little bits, bits and pieces, just to finish it off. So there's the piece that Dave was just showing you. I've matted it onto that uh, embossed background that we had there. And then I've brought in the little plane and also the car to play that is in that die set from uh, Sue. <coughs> And I've just gone over the top with some uh, of the silver um, metallic gilding polishes. Yep. And again, just on black card, just dragging that over the surface. And I didn't even have to go back into the pot. I knew there'd be enough on that sponge. You use such a little amount. It just brings out all of that detail. Do you have to wash the, the sponges dark. out? Does it go crispy if you're gonna, or anything like that? This is almost sort of semi-airtight. I wouldn't say it's airtight, like but it does keep it in there for a couple of days. Right. The only thing to do is just to give it a little spritz of, of water from your little sprayer. If you're not going to use them, on the inside, pop the lid on and then you can pop it on your shelf and forget about it until you're ready to use it again. Okay. It just keeps it ready to go. But it gives you those fantastic, it brings out all that detail in the die. So I'm just gonna pop these onto the card here. Mm -hmm. and I love the way this car kind of is almost coming around the corner. It's got that sort of perspective design going about it. Going to a movie premiere by the looks it of is, it. It is, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. So I'm just gonna pop a little bit of glue on the bottom there, pop that around the corner so it's like it's shooting around the edge of the card. Mm -hmm. We will pop our plane up the top, which I've done exactly the same with in the same design. There we go. And then I've gone back in with one of those uh, sweetie dies that I did at the top of the hour on the other card design. Same technique. Mm -hmm. I used the double-sided sheet, went over the top with the uh, black outline, but I then used the velvet dust, but this time the white velvet dust, to turn around and create a nice topper which we're going to do and pop that there like so. And then to finish the card off, it was just a case of putting the sentiment in the position there. And if I bring in the finished one, you can see it all done there and all finished off. Brilliant, brilliant oh. demos as ever from James. Thank you ever so much. Uh, where's that card that we're giving away? Have you got that? I've oh. got that down here, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, right. I've got that here, it's here. Yeah. So this is the okay. card we're giving away that James did. If you fancy winning this, well, it's too late now to enter, but thank you if you sent your emails in. Uh, have a roaring good time, could be coming your way. That was the first demo in the show, which you can, of course, watch back if you've just got in and put the TV on. One person 
who sent us their email is going to win this card. So let's get the wheel on the screen. We put all your names <laughs> on. Apologies for the details on the screen, by the way. Uh, the, um, the graphics are broken at the moment. We're trying to fix them right now. If you want to just call the call center, please do feel free. Tap the app or just go to the website, which is hobbymaker.co.uk. And there you can see all the details, all the item numbers, all the prices. You can order that way as well. OK, we've got a full wheel. It is overflowing. There's a lot of names there. Lot of names there. <laughs> Wanted to win this. OK, give it a spin, Alex. <clears throat> Where it lands, we don't know. Who's going to be the winner of this from James? Ali Cherry. Nice one, Ali. Don't know where you are, but we've got your name and address, okay. so we'll pop that in the post in the next few days. Congratulations. You have got that to put on your wall with pride. Thank you, Ali, and thank you, James. Thank Remember, you. the Art Deco collection is only two weeks old, so it's hot off the press from the brilliant Sue Wilson. Um, just quickly, before we go, I've got a few more cards just to show you, uh, to give you some ideas as to what you can do with That's this. Great inspiration there. Paper piecing. Look at yeah. this one. Totally different take on the same die. There we go. Again, using some of the Cosmic Shimmer brilliant products. In the background there, the lady walking the whippet, as we said. <laughs> and, and again, just using the just because. Just with the gilding flakes. With the gilding, gilding flakes. flakes. Looks great. Simple, but very effective. Yeah. Brilliant, aren't they? Absolutely stunning design collection. Just a few and more. Certainly that velvet dust, I know it's not going to hang around for long, so uh, I would definitely look to grab the velvet dust while you can, because I think that's going to be a bit of a uh, sellout product every time it appears at the moment. Absolutely. And then you've got that same beautiful 3d embossing folder that we used in there like that quilt that embossing folder is stunning isn't it yeah with a gilding really with the gilding yeah. pa uh, polish over the top as well love, love what sue's done with that and there look at that have a roaring good time i think that's nice just to show just using two colored cardstock same technique that i just done but obviously a lot simpler a lot quicker but still stunningly effective absolutely yeah, really well really still to come we've got mark from of course visible image coming up at seven o'clock tonight amazing um stamp and die sets and debbie's here from crafters companion in a couple of seconds time with more 3d embossing folders an amazing deal with cardstock thrown in uh, a, a great deal which i'll explain in a couple of minutes thank you james good to see thank you you, you too thank Thanks. you for watching stay thank tuned you. still lots to come this evening yeah. Are you having trouble finding the perfect gift? Then why not treat them to the new gift card from Hobbymaker at hobbymaker.co.uk. Simply scroll down to the bottom where it says gift cards, click and you'll be taken to the right place. Decide between posting the card or delivery by email and then decide how much you want to add. You choose the value. So what do you get the crafter that's got everything? Why not treat yourself or them to the Hobbymaker gift card? Shopping with Hobbymaker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.hobbymaker.co.uk where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your craft room essentials to paper, tools, cutting machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Hobbymaker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Hobbymaker. Alternatively, you can call our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Hobbymaker. Every day our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and we feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to crafting or a seasoned pro, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 1pm to 8pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Never miss a show by watching On The Go with our brand new Hobbymaker app. Head over to your app store now and search Hobbymaker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favourite presenters and guests. Click on the Today's button to shop all of the products that are featured in today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's best sellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click the Schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. 
You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking here for our social media pages. So never miss a show by watching On The Go with our brand new Hobby Maker app. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobby Maker. Introducing the Gemini 2. Our brand new electronic die cutting and embossing machine has all the power and precision of the original Gemini, but with updated functions and innovative new features. Faster and quieter than ever before, the Gemini 2 does all the hard work for you. Cut out the most intricate designs in seconds and all at the touch of a button. Technology to apply higher pressure than many other machines offers perfectly crisp and clear results every time. The Gemini 2 has the power to take creative projects of all shapes and sizes in its stride. It will cut through a range of materials, from card and paper to cork, thin metal, leather and multiple layers of fabric. So you can save time on your paper craft, sewing and multimedia projects. A new and improved optical sensor runs the full length of its 9-inch platform, offering edge-to-edge -edge precision with cutting plates of any size. Pause, rewind and resume functions take the guesswork out of crafting. Smooth gliding feet make light work of moving and manoeuvring your Gemini 2. And a turntable offers 360 degrees of crafting freedom. Neat storage compartments hold craft tools so they're always at your fingertips right when you need them. A built-in media stand and three USB charging points invite you to craft along with your favourite tutorials and workshops on your tablet or phone. Easy to use and with everything you need to get started right out of the box, the Gemini 2 is for beginners and experienced makers alike. From scrapbooking and home decor to handmade cards, quilting and everything in between, bring your creativity to life with the Gemini 2. Hey everybody, thank you to James from Creative Expressions for the last hour. We're Hobby Maker and it is, of course, just after six o'clock and we've got another cracking hour. Tonight's shows are unbelievably brilliant. They really, really are. And if you missed any of the last show or missed any of the item numbers, remember, our graphics are fixed, which is the good news. But if you missed anything from James's show, just go to our website, hobbymaker.co.uk or call the call centre and you say what you want and the call centre guys will sort that out for you. All right, now, what would you expect to pay for four 3D embossing folders. Maybe, I don't know, 35, 40 pounds maybe? Ten, if you could get them 10 pound each for 3D embossing folder, not bad. Sometimes on sale you might get them for 7.99 if you're lucky, something like that. Well, the deal we've got for you today is absolutely insane. And when this came on last time, it absolutely flew and we've got it back for you today. Um, now, let me explain what the deal is. You don't just get four embossing folders. Bear in mind you are gonna get those. You're also going to get up the top here 60 sheets of multi-purpose cardstock. So that's suitable for everything, everything crafty. 60 sheets of white multi-purpose cardstock up the top there you're going to get, okay? Next to that, you've then got 30 sheets of luxury teal mirror, satin and glitter card. And it's non-shed glitter card. So you've got 30 sheets of that in that beautiful blue. Going across, you've got one of the amazing gilding waxes in the middle just here. So this one is, the one you're gonna get is, oh, which one is it? Is it Empire Gold? It's the Renaissance Gold. Oh, Renaissance Gold, yep. Renaissance Gold. Thank you, Debbie. Thanks. Renaissance Gold, so that rich, opulent gold. There you go, you're gonna get that. And then over here, you're also gonna get, this is the icing on the cake for me. You get the 12 by 12 mirrored pad. Now this is from the Floral Elegance range, 24 sheets. Now if I grab this and just bring it down to the counter so you can see, you've got to see this. Seeing the cover doesn't do it justice, but when you open it up and you have a little flick through, look at this, look at this. How amazing is this? Look at these colours. 12 by 12, totally flawless mirrored card. 24 sheets in there and satin finish in there as well. How amazing is that? Now, if you were to buy all of that, 
separately, the 60 sheets of multi-purpose card, the 30 sheets of luxury teal card, the gilding wax, and this pad that I've just shown you, your bill would be 52 pounds and 96 pence for all of those products, okay? That's what you'd be paying, 52.96 for the top row. It should be 87.90 for all of it with the four embossing folders. And I know Debbie's got the board, she's gonna show you the boards in a second. But I just wanted to get across the fact that if you buy this today, let's get that price down if we can, because bearing in mind 52.96 is what the card stock is worth. 51.96, beg your pardon, so nearly 52 pounds. 51.96 is what the card stock would be with the gilding wax. Let's do it. Let's show you what you can have the four embossing folders and all of those extras for, 59.99. So in other words, for seven pounds, you're going to get not one, not two, not three, but four 3D embossing folders that you can use with that cardstock. Seven pounds is all those embossing folders are costing you. Debbie, that's a deal. It's a deal. And they're 3D embossing folders, which are incredible. And they're textured embossing folders, which are incredible. You're right about that pad, Dave. It's one of my absolute favourites. I think to get that satin in it, to get the shiny in it, to get it in 12 by 12, in those gorgeous colours are absolutely amazing. I love that. Yeah, I've got some boards here. So we've got the seamless scallops in there. Um, it's such a beautiful um, uh, embossing folder, this one. In fact, they're all lovely. So you're going to have these gorgeous designs in there uh, we've then got the classic diamonds so another really lovely one um, love this one as well the geometric swells um, another beautiful one and then you've got your geometric diamonds as well so all four of those uh, for seven pounds I know that's amazing I mean imagine that floral elegance foil card 12 by 12 pack Imagine that embossed with those em embossing folders. It will look amazing. Imagine yeah. your vellums embossed with those embossing folders. Imagine all of your general cardstock embossed with those embossing folders. They're costing you seven pounds. If you were paying for the cardstock, that would be what you'd be paying for the uh, embossing folders. So the deal today is amazing. And to make it even sweeter, because it's over 50 pounds, we can give you split pay as well. So you can get all four embossing folders and all that cardstock for just 29.99 today. And if you've bought something already, you've paid your 3.95 PMP. That's a delivered price, 29.99 for you. If it's the first thing you bought today, there is that one PMP per day of three pound 95, and then you pay the second 29.99 in four weeks' time. But what a deal! What an opportunity! Even if you could get a 3D embossing uh, folder for a fiver, you know, four of those would be 20 quid. You're not even paying that. You're paying seven pounds for four embossing folders if you paid what the cardstock is absolutely worth. So it's a great, great opportunity. Maybe it was the embossing folders you were out looking out for and you weren't thinking about the cardstock. Everybody needs it. I mean, this is 60 sheets of multi-purpose, uh, top quality cardstock there. And that's normally, I think, 13 pounds, 12 pounds, 13 pounds. You've got next to that, the 30 sheets of the teal luxury card with the satin, the mirror, and the non-shed glitter. And then you've got the gilding polish, which is great for anything embossed, obviously. And over there, you get the icing on the cake, the floral elegance 12 by 12 foiled pad. All of that for just 29.99, your first split pay of two. RK. 2089. RK 2089. You can buy the embossing folders individually, but with a deal like that, why would you buy them on their own? But you can buy them on their own. If you definitely don't want the card stock, that's fine. You can buy them individually if you want to. They're on the website for you. How much are they each, actually? 599 each, good deal. So if there's one embossing folder that takes your fancy, that's all you want to spend, then £5.99 pence for each of them. All four available individually, but the best deal, without a doubt, Debbie, is to go for Oh, absolutely. Collection. And cardstock is your core, isn't it, to any crafter's yeah. stash because it's the stuff that we need all the time. It's our consumables, so it's absolutely amazing. Um, I thought I'd just quickly show, Dave, some of those things that we've got on the show. So I'm put, I've just got a piece of the mirror card that I'm putting through one of the folders, which is the geometric swirls. And then I've actually got a piece of acetate because I thought I'd show you how cool these look embossed onto acetate. And we've got some... Um, it's back in stock. We haven't had it for a long time, Dave. All the it's construction. five construction weight acetate. Okay. So I'm just going to emboss these two pieces and show you how amazing they are. Now that's now a good point because you do get a carrier sheet on the acetate. Don't think it's milky yes. or cloudy when it comes. That's it, exactly. Because, yeah. Basically, <laughs> peel off the carrier sheet. It's nice and shiny and clear. Yep, absolutely. Then emboss it. 
and emboss it totally. Now, because it's a 3D embossing folder, all we're going to use is our plastic shim, our magnetic, and then our top plate. It's the only time we tell you to not put one of our hardest plates, which is the cutting plate, on the top and bottom. And then we're just going to run them through. So you add that into your uh, onto your Gemini plates, uh, and then your top folder on. Now, I've got my Gemini um, A4 machine, but I'm using my Gemini Junior plates, uh, so it makes it even quicker to go through. Excellent. So and that's we have the got the Gemini one. 2 in the show as well. Yes. Available. And then we're going to put the acetate. Now, now acetate is quite a strong, because it's a construction acetate, it's quite weighty. So I'm going to see how it goes. You might actually need to put an extra shim in, maybe just a piece of card. Uh, you can see the machine changes its tone mm -hmm. uh, because it's a lot thicker medium to go through. But I think it will work really well. So let's bring those ones out and just show you some of these. Oh, yes. Oh, oh my word, I can see from here. Look at that. <laughs> oh, my goodness. How amazing is that? Wow. <laughs> so this is the A5 construction weight acetate. Will it emboss? Of course. That proves it. It does absolutely proves it. If I, if I had to put it under that one just so we can then see it on the top. There we go. That's a double whammy there because we've just done that one. So you can see that there, which is... Now, we've got a three-pack of the A5 acetate, but I don't think I've ever seen a demonstration with acetate like that embossed before. Why haven't we done that before? I know. When you said... And actually, Dave, I wouldn't have done it. I'm going to give Dave the credit because he said, oh, well, the acetate embossed. And I was like, actually, yeah, I think it will emboss. It does. Um, but actually, emboss is better than I thought it would emboss because... I thought because it's a, a thicker material and plastic, it would be quite hard to go through. I don't know why I didn't trust that. We emboss leather and mouth yeah. board and everything, but actually to get acetate like that, can you imagine this as your window and then having your shaker cards Amazing. behind it? That would be incredible. I mean, it looks, it looks like crystal glass, doesn't it? It does actually. It looks like gemstones, faceted. Yeah. Okay, let's Amazing. get the price down on the acetate if you want it. How many sheets do you get in total? Let's get three packs. You get 75 wow. sheets. There's 25 sheets of A5 in each pack. 75 sheets and it's 1550. You're all going for your embossing folders now, aren't you, at home, thinking, oh, I can emboss that, I can emboss this. So go for these embossing folders in the deal today. Add the acetate in, the heavy duty construction weight acetate, 75 sheets for £15.50 uh, VI2084. Back in stock today. It's not always available. So grab it while we've got it. Back to Debs. Right, yes. So what I want to do now is bring in something else that's on the show, um, is our ink pads. Now these are, you know how I love pigment ink pads. These are our gold ones. They are so incredibly pretty uh, and so beautiful. So I thought, actually, let's do a bit of a technique. So I've just got some washi tape. I'm sure you'll find it on the Hobby Maker website. Mm -hmm. um, but it's just washi tape that I'm using. I'm not using our low tack tape because that could be quite sticky and it could take your backing off sometimes of your cards. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to go from the point here and I'm going to go just three squares down. So literally, so only so I know that I'm getting a similar line each side. It doesn't have to be perfect. It's just a case of popping that there. And then I'm going to do the same here, three down from, the, uh, from this side, sorry. So three squares just down to that bottom like so. But just move that across. There we go. Perfect. So that's just giving us a little um, design. And this is a really cool idea. Uh, right, so let me grab my... Um, so I'm just thinking, Dave, I was just thinking earlier that there should have been six in Boston. There are folders. six. There My are mistake. six. I, I, did I say four? <laughs> I think I said four. Apparently I did. Apologies. I was, I was frantically changing my boards thinking, oh, there's not, we've my not mistake. got six. There are six. <laughs> there are six embossing power, yeah, in, embossing folders. So basically just over a pound each because you're only paying seven quid for the embossing folders when you take into account the value of the car stock. Apologies. If I said four, I meant six. So you get six embossing folders uh, and that deal is is incredible, absolutely incredible. We'll give you the details for those embossing folders if you want it, with, remember, the multi-purpose cardstock, with the 12 by 12 Ford cardstock, with the gilding wax, and also your teal luxury card, 59.99, 52 pounds worth of cardstock, and it works out to just over a pound each for the embossing folder. Well, it's even a better deal than what we had before, which is really good. So anyone that's bought it, you will get those six. And I've got the uh, extra boards here, which I took out because I thought, oh, maybe we'd sold out of the two and I didn't know. Um, but this one, 
uh, I think could possibly be my favourite. I love the retro circles. It's an absolutely gorgeous design, this one. So that one you're getting as well as the other four that I showed you. And also this one, which is your Contemporary Waves, uh, which is a really gorgeous design on that one. So, uh, and I'll demo that one next. So you do get right. six. <laughs> six. <Sorry. laughs> uh, right, now I'm gonna use two of these. We're gonna use our, um, let me put a glass on, I'll be able to read it, Golden Honey and Majestic Ruby. So I'm gonna start off with my, um, in fact, oh, I have got them, Dave. I'm just gonna bring in my ink daubers. Um, I'm not sure if they're still in stock but if they are you'll find them on the website so let's just use these to um, only because I've got my blending tools but I didn't want to get them over this edge so mm -hmm. just be really careful when you're putting your color down not to go over the edge well, those daubers just help you be a bit more accurate where, where you put the color yeah absolutely these are one of my favorite things i absolutely love them have we got them in stock yeah we've got them <gasps> we've got them oh i love that they're not in stock very often so honestly um go for them now the best so, so as we're going to have them and you'll be able to get them um your finger goes in then they're finger daubers but this also works as well dave let me just find you know your little spritzer yep if you put that inside, fits perfect. Oh, so if you've got any finger problems or you idea. don't like to get your, or you might have bigger fingers. Some people have thicker fingers, don't they? So, um, uh, but they're really good for putting inside. So that's a really nice little tip okay. to use that. Well, um, you're going to get the entire box, as you can see there, fully, fully loaded. Obviously, these have been used. Yours will be completely unused. You get 40 ink daubers in the tray, in the box, with the lid as well. And it's not $24.99 today. It's sixteen oh, for 40 dollars wow. and the case, which keeps them nice and good condition. That's amazing. OX2047, if you've been waiting for those, they're in stock right now. Grab them. Yeah, absolutely grab them. They are beautiful, absolutely beautiful. And they're just amazing to use with these ink pads. So all we're then going to do, I'm going to go back to the red just to add some of that red through. So I think that was the one. Oh, no, that was that one. So you'll get a nice clean set. You can see ours are really well used. I'm just going to streak that through just to blend that through a little bit more. So the idea is you use each dauber for a particular colourway, is that right? Yes, yeah. that's it. Yes, right. absolutely. Yeah. Uh, and at that price, I'd be getting a couple of packs. Use these for your um, like pigment inks. Use another one for your uh, water reactive. Um, but yeah, these sell out time and time again. So once they're gone, I can't tell you when they'll be back in. It took ages. It's a bit like the tape pens. Took ages to come yeah. in. Um, and then uh, and then they go again so quickly. Totally. Right, so once you've done this... <laughs> oh, a third of the stock has gone of the blending daubers, if you want them, be quick. OX2047. Ah, oh, well, that's good. Oh, I'm glad I bought those in because... Uh, and I'm glad we're uh, to change them. Right, so all we're going to do is take this in like this and then we've got this beautiful oh. design going through. <coughs> so it almost looks like we've split the page but created that really cool design. So you can see I've already stamped birthday. The reason being is because I do have a happy that we're going to use with it. And so that was just from our fancy fonts uh, in our stamp set. Now, once you've done that, um, if you... I haven't got my ruler on me, but my finished one I'll be able to show you. I got my ruler and just used my fine art liner and just went each side so it gives it a black uh, line. But I haven't got the ruler to be able to do that so I'm not going to worry um, because that will you, you will it'll still look amazing that's a great use for tape though to get a perfect straight line yeah really good yeah. isn't it yeah really good so let's just take I've got my card blank because we're gonna and we've got a piece of black card as well just to put underneath it and then we're just going to use our folder so I'm using that classic diamonds uh, and we're just going to put that inside now when you've got a colored piece of card Dave or maybe a mirrored piece of card and you want to make sure that you're using the right side of the folder doesn't really matter with these ones because no. um, they look good debossed and embossed because there's a, there's a pretty much the same amount. But because I want these little triangles in the middle to pop out, I need to make sure that the ones that are risen are on the back side of my card, mm -hmm. which means as I put that down, they will push up. So let's just um, place that right in the middle there. I'm going to make sure that's in there. In fact, I'm just going to move that a little bit just along there that's it like so okay. and then we're going to use exactly the same combination that we used before so let me grab my plates and we're just going to emboss that beautiful detail and just now, to let you know we do have spare plates for the gemini both yes. the smaller plates and the larger ones in the show today as well they'll be on the website if you want to have a little look 
Yeah, absolutely. Um, so once you've done that, now I haven't let my ink dry. So what it'll mean, it'll just transfer onto my folder, but just give it a wipe, it'll wash off. Yep. It's not a problem at all. But if you let it dry, but look at this. Oh. You've got this beautiful effect going through with there. That's just, so cool. Yeah, absolutely gorgeous. So you can see we've got that <laughs> nice streak on my folder. <laughs> In fact, I think if you put that on another piece of white card, I've got a bit here, Dave, let's do it. Let's just run that back through. You might let a press onto I the card. I think it will let a press onto the card. Oh, so let's, cool. let's have a look and see. I don't, I don't know if that will work. I just thought as the ink was there, we might as well use it. Give it a go. Give it a try. <laughs> right. If I bring this one in just because it's dry and you can see that's where I've actually put uh, the black lines on there as well. And it's already dry. Um, let's, oh, it did. It. So you know what I should have done? I should have spritzed it. If I'd spritzed it, then it would have transferred a bit more because the ink's still on there. It did work, see. yeah. But it did work. If I'd spritzed that, it would have been even better. Now, I've just got to say hi. To, we had a, a bit of a gremlin earlier on with our graphics and my screen went off as well, but we've got it back now. I can see all of you that are ordering. So for those of you that are going for the uh, six embossing folders, not four, six, and all that cardstock, Lily in West Midlands has checked out. Jean in Berkshire, John in Hampshire, Judith in North Yorkshire. Hi, Dorothy, Mandy. Christine, Graham, Gemma, thank you, Levi, for getting that ready for me and getting it sorted. Uh, yeah, RK2089 is a product code if you want to take advantage of this amazing deal that we've been able to bring back. 30% uh, of the right. stock gone. Amazing. No surprise. Yes, absolutely. I think when people realise the sort of deal they're getting, um, we all love a bargain, don't we? We do. Oh, yes. And freebies, I think, more than anything else. Well, we've all been there where we've maybe bought something and then thought afterwards, oh, I wish I hadn't done that. That was a bit too much money. <laughs> but when you get a deal like this, you think, I'm so glad I bought that. And yeah, take absolutely. Of it. Definitely. So I've just mat and layered onto some black cardstock onto our card blank. Um, and then I've just put this one onto foam pads already. So we're just going to take the backings off. Uh, to finish that card and we're going to keep this nice and simple so there we go we've got our happy birthday just on there like so and we're going to keep that really nice and simple but just a, a little bit of an effective way that you can um, put your inks on there but look at the shimmer on there you just get this amazing gold shimmer on there so uh, great ink pads um i didn't see what the price was on those ink pads are they good we, we haven't i don't think we put them up on the screen yet oh we haven't even put them up <laughs> they, now you are going to get how much should they be 47.92s worth of shimmer ink pads and they've dropped to 34 oh, pounds amazing. and 99 pence now you're going to get in total how many ink pads do you get you get two four six eight you get eight ink pads but look if you imagine how beautiful centura pearl cardstock is with that shimmer and that shine that's what this ink is going to give you when you're stamping when you're putting this ink down onto cardstock i mean if i just get a couple of sheets here let me just show you this is this is one of my favorite colors this is um queen bee they call this now, if I just put a little bit of this onto this cardstock, look at this colour. But look, if I hold that up to the light, can you see the shimmer and the shine that you get from that? That pearl essence. You're literally transferring and making any cardstock into almost like a Centura pearl. Absolutely, you've got that pearl essence yes. In each pad. So let me show you the colours you're going to get quickly because the, the D on this is amazing as well. You've got your queen bee, which is that lovely yellowy color. You've got your secret garden, which is a lovely lime green. You've got your gilded sky, a lovely blue. You've got your golden honey, which is a lovely orange gold color. You've then got your flame pink as well. And now all of these are pearlescent. You're then gonna get your cosmic purple, cosmic, your majestic ruby, your peach terracotta, and your Midnight Shore. Let me just put Midnight Shore on this cardstock as well. Oh, my word. Oh, man. This is incredible. <laughs> look, 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 look. We've lost you now, Dave. You have. <laughs> look at that. When that dries, obviously it's still wet at the moment, but you've got that gold running through that green. So every one of these ink pads is going to give you that gold pearlescent hue. I've never seen ink pads like this before until today. Yeah, until I know. You brought them They're out. amazing, aren't they? Absolutely. All eight of them, and we've dropped the price to $34.99. What does that work out per pound? I can't do the maths on that. $34.99 divided by eight. It's under a five or a pad. £4.37 for a shimmer ink pad in all those amazing colours. You can stamp with them. You can use them in all sorts of ways. 
34.99. Are they water-based as well, Debbie, those? Uh, yes, so they're, well, they're, they're not water-based, so they're pigment-based, uh, but you can blend and watercolour with them like oh. watercolours because of the pigment in them. It's such a rich uh, pigment. In Fantastic. Them. So if you want that combination today, and they're in the new design of ink pad case, so they're like a comma, which means you've got a tip for, you know, very precise application of the ink, and you've got the larger area for uh, wider and bigger surface areas. So all those together for 34 99 and remember delivered without any PMP if you've already bought something today from us anyone from midnight to midnight it's just one PMP per day of three pounds and 95 pence but the main collection let me just remind you of the deal now the deal for the embossing folders you're going to get six six 3d embossing folders that I know Debbie's already gone through but the deal is exceptional because you don't only get the embossing folders you get 60 sheets of multi-purpose cardstock which you can use for all sorts of things anything you get 30 sheets of luxury teal cardstock, which I think you can just see at the top there. You've got your satin finish, you've got your mirrored finish, and you've got your non-shed glitter. So 10 sheets of each in that. You've got your gilding wax in the middle, which is almost hidden, but it's there. And there, that's normally 14, 15 pounds, isn't it, for the gilding I wax? I think they're 12, 12. I want to say 12 99 or 11 99, like 99 yep. Yeah. Okay, and then you get your amazing 12 by 12 floral, um, Beautiful mirrored pad, which is stunning. 24 sheets in that. And it's uh, Debbie's favourite as well, as yeah, well as absolutely. mine. So all of that combined, if you were to buy all that cardstock with the, uh, the golding polish, you'd be looking at 51 96 so for another seven pounds, you're getting six 3D embossing folders by going for this deal. And you don't have to pay for it in one go. You can give us the first split payment today of two, which is 29.99, and that will be on its way. The whole bundle will be on its way to you, plus your PMP unless you've paid it already. And then the final payment gets taken off your card that you used today in four weeks' time. What a deal that is to get four, uh, six embossing folders. Where does four keep coming into my mind from? Six embossing folders <laughs> for just seven pounds. It's crazy, absolutely crazy, and an amazing deal. And of course, all the other goodies that are in the show, check out the website, hobbybaker.co.uk, and you will see it there. All right, Debbie? Yes, right. The next demo, I want to really show how these are 3D embossing folders. So the first thing I want to do is to do some letter pressing. Uh, now, you can do that with your pigment ink pads, but I want to use a silver one, so I'm using our Midas one. I'm also using another pigment ink pad, which is our Midnight, so uh, they're, they're amazing. So these ones... I'm going to use to put on the top. So I want to find where the deepest part is, which is these middle sections. And that's where I want to put my ink. So I'm holding my folder down because mm -hmm. if you lift your folder up, it'll start going up and down and you'll get more on the bottom. And all I actually want is the silver to take in that middle section. So we're making sure that we go over that. It doesn't matter if it goes anywhere else, but we want to keep a really light hand because we just want it. You can sort of see it in the light there. Mm -hmm. um, we just want to keep it onto those middle sections. So just hold your folder down. In fact, Dave, if you've got a brayer, that would be ideal to oh, put perfect. on folders. Yep. So um, yeah, we do a brayer as well. So it's just making sure that we tap all that on, making sure we've got that all covered. So you can sort of see where you've got it. Um, and let's pop that into place. So I think that's pretty much covered that. And then I'm going to use some blue cardstock. Oh. Yes. So because this is a really cool way of being able to show how you get that 3D results. So this is only the first ink pad we're going to use. And you can see straight away, you can see all that silver coming through. So let's use our folder combination again, our plastic shim, magnetic, and then your top plate on top of that. Mm -hmm. And then run that through. So nice and easy. That's going to emboss that beautiful uh, silver gilding wax, a uh, silver um, ink pad through there. If you wanted to use a light finger, you could always do that afterwards with your gilding wax that you get in that collection. So once we've got that one, we've got that beautiful embossing and then you can see that we've oh. got that silver on the inside. But what I wanted to do is still keep that blue in the background. So once you've done that, bring then in um, this ink pad, which is your darker blue. And then we're literally going to go straight onto the top with this one. Because if you just go onto the top, it will catch the other line so you can really see. But it keeps that third embossed at the bottom. Brilliant. 
So it's a really nice technique to use. We forget, we think of 3D folders as sort of just doing that 3D effect, but mm -hmm. actually really notice is when you want a third color, you just do it onto uh, a darker cardstock and then have a darker ink pad that's coordinating with that. And also these embossing folders, they're very generic. You know, yep. you can use them for all sorts of backgrounds again and again and again. It's not like a special theme to each one, is yep. there really? Yeah, absolutely. So now we've got a dark blue, we've got a sky blue, and we've got that beautiful silver that really enhances in that. Isn't that cool? That's amazing. Beautiful. So what we're going to do now, oh, and I meant to do it beforehand, but it doesn't matter. I've already got one. So I should have done this first, and you'll see why in a minute. Um, I want to also create some texture with this heart, but I wanted to emboss it at the side. But if you do, you want to do this first because, of, of, well, I could wash my folder, but if I put this on now, it's going to actually put my ink onto this piece. Mm -hmm. So I've got a piece that I've already done. So if I bring this one in, you can see I've just done white card just to give it a contrast and then that will somewhere slot back in so you just find where that is and you can um, you can actually match up those swirls I've got that the right way I'm pretty sure they are just there Think yeah it's like you're matching up wallpaper patterns isn't it really it is like yeah absolutely <coughs> I thought I had um, oh there you go it does it matches up just there like so there we go so let's pop this into a card so I've got a coordinating card color so let's pop these ones in and let's just add all these into place. So I'm just going to stick these down now, Dave. So I'm just using ta my tape pen, but you could use your wet glue if you wanted to. Even more of you coming through for this deal where you're getting, basically, if you were paying for the cardstock and the gilding wax, you'd be looking at just six or seven pounds for six 3D embossing folders. Lynn in Nottinghamshire wants that deal. So does Mandy in Wiltshire. Brand new crafter. Hi to you. Graham in Greater London. Gemma in Derbyshire. All with it in their baskets. Check your baskets out. That seals the deal for you at Hobby Maker. RK2089. Amazing. I think, yeah, when you get such a good deal, and especially when it's uh, items, especially like your um, paper pads, it's what you use all the time, isn't it? So we're just going to pop that right into the middle there. And then we're going to add that one <coughs> into place. So just turning that round, making sure we've got all of that there. And then we'll just add that one into our design. Can't quite match that up. It's probably because I did it on a different one before, but I'm not going to worry too much. Oh, there we go. It's there. It's clicked in. Yep, there yep. we go. Look, you can see that whole design now is in there so and in fact i think because i've put inks down there it's not going to stick too well so i'm just gonna yeah you can see that's coming off because it's a wet ink because your um pigment ink pad is a wet ink right that so just takes a little bit longer to dry so what you want to do is just add some tacky glue and then that will um, allow it to stick a little bit better and then all I've got is I've done in the coordinating card in the green around the side, I've just cut out one of my dies, which says friend. So we're just going to place that through the centre. And then I've just got a happy birthday. So let's just pop that into place as well. Perfect. And I'm going to again use my, in fact, I might just use some uh, foam pads to put that on. There we go. Mm -hmm. More and more and more of you coming through for the 3D embossing folder bundle with the bonus of that amazing deal with the cardstock. Yeah, too it's good very to miss good, out isn't on. it? Yeah, yeah, it is too good to miss out on. I think especially when you can, uh, even if you don't need it now, you're going to be able to put that away, aren't you? Well, the cardstock, I mean, the multi-purpose you'll use every day. Um, the teal mirrored luxury cardstock, really handy to have. That luxury floral 12 by 12 pad is just some of the best mirror card I've seen. And the gilding polish, that will last you probably years. Cause it will last you a long time, yeah. yeah, absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. So we're just going to pop that on there and we're just going to add this onto our folder. So we've got our happy birthday friend. And then I've just got a little, um, and in fact, I think just so it'll stick on, we're going to put a little foam pad on the back of my ribbon. Add that into place. And there we go, our Incredible. nice simple card. There it is. Quite an easy design to do. Debbie, could you pass me that acetate that you oh, lost? Oh, yes. Is that all right? Absolutely. Okay, now, 
Remember, today we've got not only that amazing deal on the embossing folders, but we've also got back in stock the heavy duty construction weight acetate. I mean, acetate varies in its thickness. Very often it'd be quite thin, which is fine. But if you want you know, a really strong, sturdy acetate that you can actually score and you can even make into a card blank, you could use it in windows and apertures. Every single sheet comes with a carrier sheet on it to protect it so it won't get scratched. So do make sure you remove that. I just wanted to see what Debbie did because I didn't know, I asked Debbie earlier and before we did the show, whether the heavy duty embossing, uh, whether the heavy duty acetate would emboss with a 3D embossing folder. And Debbie thought, well, yeah, why not? Let's give it a go. If you want to emboss the heavy duty acetate, this is a sort of effect that you can create. Now that's a game changer as far as I'm concerned. So we've actually got three packs of 25 acetate in this size for 1550s. It's only just over five pounds per pack. Um, and you could be doing things like that. And of course using this in all sorts of ways. So 1550, if you want your acetate, 75 sheets, 25 sheets in each pack. It's available today and it's VI2084 and it's going incredibly quickly. But just again, I wanted to see it with my own eyes. I mean, acetate, when you hold it up as a plain sheet, you can't really see much going on there. But as soon as you emboss it, it becomes almost like a gemstone. The facets really kind of pick it up beautifully well. I mean, think about that as an aperture uh, on a Christmas card, maybe with some little fairy lights behind it or something like that. It looks on amazing, a shaker card. doesn't it? It does look amazing. In fact, if you pass me another sheet, Dave, we'll try it on another embossing folder. There you go. Lovely. Actually, we could do all six. <laughs> yeah. Dave just loves this effect. I do. Um, I love it's it. so cool, actually. Yeah, I hadn't realised how good it would emboss. So, uh, yeah, let's try another piece now. Um, so, I'm going to use that seamless scallop, so one we haven't used. Well, by the way, the Gemini machine, um, the Gemini 2, is in stock at the new low price. I say new low price, it's been that price for a little while, uh, but we've kept it down. We haven't put it back up to where it should be, 229.99. It's still 199.99, and that comes with all the plates and a little starter die bundle as well. So if you want the new and improved Gemini 2 with the USB ports in the back, uh, quieter, quicker, still the same pressure. <laughs> oh, has it worked again? It's worked again, yes, this is amazing. I mean, I'm gonna pass it to Dave because I think Dave will be able to show it off better on the front camera. Look. Love that. I'm gonna just be embossing all of them. Hey, look at this that. This is one of your 3D embossing folders, but look how that heavyweight acetate <laughs> embosses. Amazing. That actually makes it, because of the colors in the studio and the lights bouncing, it almost looks like it's got reflective lights in it. It does actually. It's amazing. It is incredible. So a new way of using your heavy duty acetate. There you go. Get that deal with the embossing folders. Use your other embossing folders you've got at home as well on the acetate. It's a game changer. Love it, love it, love it. And of course, if you've got anything like um, uh, alcohol pens or anything like that, you can actually color the rainbows in different colors if you wanted to, or just leave it plain. I think it works like that, a treat. It really does. Okay, so details on the screen then for the 3D embossing folders, all six of them and you get all that cardstock. The cardstock alone and the gilding polish is worth over 51 pounds, 51.96. For seven pound more, you get six 3D embossing folders that would do that to heavy duty acetate, which is a game changer, love it. Um, we've also got, what else was it gonna show you? Um, oh yes, the blending tools, blending tools, and then also the plates, yeah, okay. Now the blending tools, we've got these in from Spectrum Wire. So these are, this, that's the tool itself, a rectangular one. And you've got, of course, two of your replacement pads on there. You've then also got some more interchangeable pads. You've got two, four, six, eight, there's 10. So you get 12 different blending pads with the tool. And then you're also gonna get your sponges, which are brilliant for blending. And you're also gonna get your blending messy mat. So you get that as well. So that's a lovely surface for doing your blending, for doing all sorts of fantastic crafting work. And it rolls up so it's totally portable if you're crafting on the move. And also you can use it with your heat gun. It's heat resistant as well. The whole lot should be £22.96. So if you're treating yourself to the embossing, uh, sorry, the ink pads in the show, treat yourself to these as well at the same time. Today, it's yours for $17.99. All of those embossing pads, the new tool, the messy mat, and the blending sponges as well, $17.99 in the show today, XB2094. Now we've only got a few of the replacement plates available in the show. We'll try and get more back in the future. If you've got a Gemini 2, 
There's one thing that is certain that you will at some point need to change your cutting plates because they are a consumable. They will gradually um, need changing with time. These new ones though, Debbie, are designed to last a lot longer than the old ones, aren't they? Yeah, they are. In fact, the white plates will last three times longer than their original plates and the plastic shim now lasts 10 times more than the original plates. So they're definitely worth getting it. And just yeah. a quick, just because I know a lot of people ask, will they still work in the original Gemini? And yes, they will. Yes, they will. So you're going to get two of the cutting plates which are the white ones. You're going to get your uh, metal shim, you're going to get your embossing rubberized mat, and you're going to get your plastic shim as well. So all the plates that you need that you originally get with the machine, this is a replacement set. Now, and you're also going to get the neoprene sleeve to put them in as well to keep them in good condition. But it's nothing nicer than having a spare set when you need them. There's nothing worse than realizing that you need to change your plates and then finding out that they're out of stock and they won't be in for a week or two or a month or two or whatever. So if you fancy getting an extra set today, maybe you've had your machine for a while, you think it's about time I change them. Um, they should be $79.93. And of course, you can use the neoprene case for whatever else you want to use it for. You don't have to keep your plates in there if you don't want to. $54.95 today and it is on split pay but we've only got literally single figure stock available at the moment this is what I mean they come in and they go out and then there's a little bit of a drought of them for a while and that's when you need them isn't it when they're not in stock it's always it's, it's that law that we always comment on VO 2038 5495 on split pay it's 2747 today and that will give you a, a brand new one of each of the plates that you need for your Gemini 2. That's amazing. That is good. Yeah it's so it? amazing I'm actually thinking the cost of the plates to the Gemini machine as well if you can go yeah. for a Gemini machine and then extra plates as well. Yeah. And isn't there a 20% code floating about when you've got your PIM badge? Might I be. know people have been using that a lot as well. Mm. Um, but also, as Debbie said, these plates will work in the previous Gemini machine as well. So if you've got one of those and you don't want to necessarily upgrade to the Gemini 2, but you're thinking, I could do with having some you know, stronger plates that are going to last me longer, these will work in the older machines as well. Uh, VO2038 is your item number. But the next few people through will be lucky. We've only got literally a handful. And uh, good luck. I hope you get them. Yeah, definitely. Definitely. Uh, right, I thought we'd go back to that seamless scallops and uh, emboss something else because we've been doing like mirror cardstock, we've done our acetate, uh, we've done our cardstock where you've inked on top, we've done our coloured cardstock and now I've got some um, of our paper pads from one of our, this was your colour your world um, and I actually got inspired because of the front cover because I thought oh I've got some uh, paper pads of that so I use it but you could use anything you've got in your stash. So we're literally just going to place that inside the folder and we're going to run that one through um, but before we do that actually I'm going to take now I'm taking one of our duet ink pads they are on the website we had them on the earlier show you could also use your pigment ink pads for this as well mm -hmm. um, I just didn't have the color that I'd used at home with me oh wrong one so that's the wrong way so this is the great thing it doesn't matter in fact I'm going to I'm going to do both Dave so we can do both we're just going to color that one over the top and then we're going to do the one we want and you'll see why because this one here actually is going to put the ink inside the scallops although it's scallops but I want to call them the rainbows because they yeah. do look like rainbows don't they um, but this will show you um, what the deboss and emboss side looks like so we're going to just place that right in the center there bring that one over the top and then we're going to run that one through excellent and after we've done this demo, I will show you again all the six embossing folders you're going to be getting so you know exactly the designs. I know people kind of dip in and dip out at this time of the evening. So about half the stock we have available of this deal has now gone. And all you have to give us is the first half of the two split pays. If you want to pay in full because you don't like split pay or whatever, that's fine. But just $29.99. Amazing. Uh, right, so when you take that one out, so that that's one side, so if you were to just do your white card, how pretty is that? Just with that touch in the middle, you could use another ink pad over the top, which would just take another one of those layers off, so that would yep. be really clever. Oh. And then if I turn this over, you've got a really totally different now with all those colours, but now you've got those beautiful um, the sort of purple inside. Now, if you use your embossing, clear embossing powder, put over the top, heat emboss it, this this is how it comes out, which is very cool. Oh, wow. I know. How amazing is that? And it literally, can you see, look at the shine. And that's just clear embossing powder over the top, heat embossed. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and like Alex has just said, it looks enameled then, doesn't it, over the top. So beautiful way to use them. You, you wouldn't believe the sort of things that you could do with embossing folders. I, I mean, I've touched a 
tiny, tiny amount of things that you can do. Um, but we're going to turn this into a card just to show I often, how beautiful they are. I look. often say embossing folders are kind of unsung heroes. You know, yes, you, you buy totally. Them. And now that they're three-dimensional, most of them, the difference is immense. Yes. It really makes all the difference. It does make all the difference. And I think what's nice about embossing folders is you can use them just to have something in the background when you've got beautiful dies and stamps, or you can use them as your main focal point for your mm. card because they are amazing backgrounds. And they're also one of the most inexpensive crafting accessories you can buy. But there's so much you can do with them. Yes. Absolutely so much. Yeah, totally. They're just, uh, and they are our unsung heroes, I think, because they are so good uh, with what you can do with them. There are so many techniques to be able to do with embossing folders. Um, I mean, you could use these in your scrapbooking. You could put your photos in the, on the top of them um, and just make them look really cool. Now, another uh, set of embossing folders we had had some stamps with them. So I've just used the stamp from this one. So friends make the world beautiful. So we're just going to pop that on the top. Again, I'm going to put my uh, tacky glue. Uh, we're going to pop that in the center like so. And then I'm just going to bring in my 3D glue gel because that's going to be the easiest thing to apply. Just some flowers that I've got to decorate. And I've used the same um, cardstock. So just to coordinate. And we're just going to put these flowers around it to decorate. Gorgeous. Like so, and then I've just got a few little foliage pieces to add in. But I, I wanted to keep it simple because um, we want to make the embossing folder do all the work for us. Let's just do a couple more sprigs. These were just from our floral creations um, when we got that little tub to put them in. And then let's do one more, and then we'll finish there. Love it. There we go. Well, by the way, the Gemini machine is proving popular tonight as well. Lots of people decided to go for the upgrade while it's on split pay as well. There Look at we that. Go. <laughs> that is a real work of art, isn't it? And of course, what looks like rainbows, we're actually calling the scallops, seamless scallops. But yeah, it definitely has a rainbow feel to it. Um, that's amazing. And of course, when you're doing it on acetate, it looks like this. Isn't that great? I'll just move out of the way so you can see it against my... Yeah, you want, to, you want to emboss everything onto acetate. We've got that new, um, amazing, um, top quality, kind of high intensity acetate, the really strong construction weight acetate. Let me show you the embossing folders again, though, that you're going to be getting. That's what your finished card could look like, but that is the embossing folder with the scallops that you're going to be getting, worth $5.99. Remember, if you buy it in the bundle today, it's going to be about a pound, because with the cost on the value of all the cardstock, um, that's what it works out to for each of these, if you take the cost of the cardstock off. This is my my favorite one I think this one is called your geometric swirls and that's the one again that was made uh, into a fantastic acetate display a few minutes ago there's that one you're also going to get this one which is your contemporary waves so you can make it look kind of watery if you want to or just as a very very geometric beautiful diagonal pattern going across that was in uh, Debbie's um, demo a few minutes ago this one is your geometric diamonds now this is again one of those that we used with the acetate isn't that cool Heavy duty acetate embossed looks like this. And it's this embossing folder that does it. Ink it, use it like a, a letter press. However you use it, it's beautiful. So that one's included too. You're going to get this one, which is your classic diamonds. Again, that's what your card could look like. That's what the embossing folder will actually look like. One more, out of the six, you're going to get this one, which is the retro circles. Again, some ideas on the front, turn it round. That's what your retro circles embossing folder looks like. And I cannot believe that if you were, well, I can believe if you were paying $5.99 for each of those, you'd be looking at two, four, six. So that would be nearly £36. You're paying £7 for those if you buy the bundle. That's what it works out to. Remember the cardstock, the cardstock is valued at £51.96. 60 sheets of multi-purpose, 30 sheets of luxury teal. You get your... Um, Gilding polish and wax in the middle there, that's worth about 12, 13 pounds. And you get your 24 sheets of your mirrored floral 12 by 12, which I just want to grab because you've got to see it. You, you, look at, you look at the sheet on the front, you kind of think, oh, it's cardstock. It's so much more than cardstock. Look at this. 12 sheets of the high shine in all these wonderful colorways. Again, it's sometimes difficult in the, in the lights to show you, but look at that blue, isn't that amazing? So you get all of that rose gold in there as well. 
but it's such a good quality mirror card. And then you get the satin in the back of it as well. My favorite 12 by 12 pad, I think of all time, this Debbie. Uh, it's so nice, isn't it? I think because it's so got that beautiful. satin and it's got the shiny and they're just opulent. It's an opulent pad, isn't it? It looks beautiful. You're getting all of that cardstock and the embossing folders for 59.99 and even better, you only have to give us half of that today with the two split pays. So for 29.99, you're going to get nearly 52 pounds worth of cardstock and over 30 pounds worth of um, double uh, uh, 3D embossing folders. And all you've paid today is 29 pounds and 99 pence. And so many of you put it in your baskets. Claire in Nottinghamshire. Uh, hello, Leslie Crafter in Lanarkshire, Jill in County Durham, Susan in Lancashire, Lynn, Mandy Graham, Crafter. Hello to Gemma in Derbyshire. Check your baskets out because if you don't, you could miss out. The stock's going that fast with still only about five or six minutes left on the show. So many new uh, crafters today. I know, I know. Yeah, I've seen loads of new people. It's, uh, it's amazing So and so pleased. Um, I love the fact that Hobby Maker works so well with us to do those split pays because uh, that's amazing to be able to get that home uh, for that price. But let's just have a look at the boards again uh, and the folders that you're getting in that collection that you're only paying, what did you say, a pound each? Folder. Just over a pound. That's each one. Incredible. Yeah. Um, so beautiful 3D enfolders. You've got your contemporary waves. You've then got that retro circles. We haven't even used that one. That looks, that is so, so beautiful. Love that one. Uh, we've then got our gorgeous geometric diamonds. You've then got your geometric swirls. That's a really cool one. It, it's like a kaleidoscope, isn't it? Mm -hmm. You remember the um, old kaleidoscopes you used to look through in the um, oh, well, in those the poles? Those, yeah, yeah. You used to turn. It looks a little bit like that. Uh, classic diamonds. So another one there. And then the last one in that collection, which was the last one we used, was that seamless scallops, which is incredible. And if I just bring in the three cards that we've done today, because literally within the hour, we've managed to do these three, which all look so different. So it doesn't matter what you've got in your stash whether you've got ink pads we've had some shimmer sprays on earlier they're going to look great in there um, think about all your different stamps that you've got in your collections your papers that you've got uh, and you can just be really creative with them and that's just a tiny tiny little number of the sorts of things you can do for your, with your folder now one more little deal um, if I can get it in before the end of the show red liner tape okay now yesterday I did a show uh, with Anne Marie and we had a wide roll of red liner tape everybody absolutely loved it. Well, in this show with Crafters Companion, I mean, a lot of companies do red liner tape. There's nothing unusual there, but the deals differ and vary. So what I found in this show, which I wanted to get in, we've actually got two 10 meter rolls of the 12 mil width, the 12 mil width. There we go, look. So that's one of the widest in the business. So you're gonna get 20 meters of that. You're gonna get then three meters and you get two packs of that. So you're gonna get 20 meters of the three meter red liner tape for your more delicate jobs. And then we've got the six mil. So you've got everything here, three mil, six mil and 12 mil and 10 meters of each of those. So you've got 60 meters of, this is the construction red liner tape. Yeah. This is what everybody uses when they're putting frames together or you're putting boxes together. You want to have the ultimate bond, the ultimate strong connection. Then red liner tape is the way to go. And the bundle that we've got today for all six of these reels, 60 meters is exceptional. Should be £18.54 this evening. You can have the whole lot stock up Buy in bulk, save the money, <gasps> 13 That can't be right, surely. <laughs> I know. That's I, when I saw it, I thought, no, got to do that. Got to do that. That is I'm very like, good. You know, this is, one of those, well, this is one of those products everybody needs. Every crafter needs red liner tape. Yes. But if you buy it a roll at a time, that's yep. when you pay through the nose. Absolutely it is. And what you'll love, if you've not tried ours before, the three different sizes, you're, they absolutely come into their own. The three millimetre is brilliant for so many things, especially if you like quilling flowers. Um, you put it to the base of the quilling flower, quill it round, and they won't come unstuck. It's amazing. But when you've got bigger construction issues and construction products or projects, um, to have that extra 12 mil width, that isn't a size of red liner tape is, that's readily out there. It's only something that only a few companies do. So we've got 20 meters of it from Crafters Companion in there. I mean, I'd pay certainly a five or a roll for that, no trouble yes. at all. Mm -hmm. uh, so to get all six reels, for 13.99, NU 2091. Dorothy in Merseyside realizing the deal on this is amazing. You're saving a fiver, and that's more than covering your PMP for the whole day with us at Hobby Maker. Uh, and Claire in Northamptonshire is also coming in as well. Now we've got a couple of minutes left on the show. What do you want to see? Oh, the gold shimmering pads. Okay, that's what I showed you earlier on, wasn't it? With um, 
That one now is dry. Can you see the, the, the green? Look at the green and the gold. Look at that. That's, That's amazing, what you're going to get from an ink pad. Yeah. <laughs> and you get eight of them. Eight of these shimmer ink pads to make every project that you use them on into the, the kind of inky equivalent of Centura Pearl, really, isn't it? Oh, absolutely. It's exactly what they do. Yeah. Okay. And if you think of everything you can do with your heat embossing, that's what you can do with these as well. Should I do another? Let me do another swipe. Um, Majestic Ruby. Okay. Oh, look at that, that colour. Oh, that's so nice. Here's the gold that comes through with them when they dry is incredible. So I'm doing what you probably would never do, but I just want to show you. Look, now it's still wet, but can you see the gold in the Majestic Ruby? But honestly, when that dries, you really see it. It's, it's just amazing. So you've got eight different colorways, Majestic Ruby being one of them. Uh, let's go on to show you others. You've got the Midnight Stone. Uh, sorry, Midnight Shore, which is a lovely greeny gold. You can see the gold in there, in actual fact. There we go. Then you've got Peach Terracotta. It's £4.37 for each ink pad. Wow. And of course, it goes to a point which is so clever for more detailed, delicate work. You've then got your Gilded Sky, that beautiful blue gold. You can see the gold in there, actually. Then we've got the Secret Garden, which is the first one that I showed you, which is that kind of limey yellow, limey gold. Um, then you've got Queen Bee. Oh, that was the one that I did there. That's, that's the yellow one. Queen Bee. Yeah, it's beautiful. And they're really juicy too, aren't they? They're really juicy. There's so much ink in there. Flame Pink. And you've got Golden Honey. I wonder how different that is to the Queen Bee. Let me just have a little look. That's like a proper yellow, like rich honey. <laughs> yeah, it is. It is like a honey yellow. Yeah, it's gorgeous. So that one's called Golden Honey. And that's that one there. Lots of you asking to see these, so that's the queen bee, that's the golden honey. And then the last one is your cosmic purple. Let's do a little bit of that on here as well. I do love this teardrop shape because it makes them really ergonomic in the hand to hold as well. Cosmic purple is on the bottom. Now that really shows off the gold, look at that. Wow. And that's still wet, but when it dries, all you see is purple and gold all fused together, which is amazing. Yeah, so lovely. They're, they are incredible ink pads. And they're 34.99 if you want all, all eight of them. And remember, if you bought anything from us already today, you've paid your 2.95. The rest of the evening shopping until midnight tonight is free at b and uh, Debbie, thanks. Oh, you're welcome, Dave. Great to um, see you. I will be back on uh, Friday. Friday. Yes. All right, we'll see you then. Yes. Uh, coming up next, we've got Mark. We've got visible image and amazing deals on their brilliant stamps and dies as well. That's after this. Never miss a show by watching on the go with our brand new Hobbymaker app. Head over to your app store now and search Hobbymaker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favorite presenters and guests. Click on the Today's button to shop all of the products that are featured in today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's best sellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click the schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking here for our social media pages. So never miss a show by watching on the go with our brand new Hobbymaker app. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobbymaker. Are you having trouble finding the perfect gift? Then why not treat them to the new gift card from Hobbymaker at hobbymaker.co.uk. Simply scroll down to the bottom where it says gift cards, click and you'll be taken to the right place. Decide between posting the card or delivery by email and then decide how much you want to add. You choose the value. 
So what do you get the crafter that's got everything? Why not treat yourself or them to the Hobbymaker gift card? Our UK-based call centre is always on hand to assist you 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Every day our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and we feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to crafting or a seasoned pro, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 1pm to 8pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Shopping with Hobbymaker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.hobbymaker.co.uk where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your craft room essentials to paper, tools, cutting machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Hobbymaker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Hobbymaker. Alternatively, you can call our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Hobbymaker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobbymaker. Where does the time go? It's our last show of the day, live on Hobbymaker. Great to have your company and great to see Mark back. Hey, mate. Hey, all right. How are you? Yeah, great, thank you. Good to see you. Mark and Helen are here. Helen's sat over there watching the show. <laughs> Keeping her eye on Mark, probably. That's what she's doing. Uh, now, Mark and Helen and Visible Image are part of the Hobbymaker family, which is a really exciting thing for us. Uh, we're delighted. I know everybody upstairs is delighted. So we are kind of one now, aren't we? We are. Which is amazing. We are kind of conjoined. We are. <laughs> and what we can do is we can, now we are one, do amazing deals on visible image products. Not that you didn't do amazing deals before, but we can do even better deals for you. And what we've got for you today in the show, to start off with, we've got three sets of duos, dies and stamps together. You can buy them on their own if you want to, but buying them together gives you the best price, so that's probably what you'll want to do. Uh, we've got some affirmations and wonderful words, some amazing artwork, Mark. Yeah, thank you. Um, yeah, I mean, obviously in our own kind of familiar style, a little bit inky, a little bit edgy, but yeah, 100% visible image. Different and fun. Okay, now let's start. If you're a cat lover, yes, guilty. Um, what we've got to start off with you, uh, well, for you today, are the felines. Loving the felines, loving the pretty cats, in other words. Now, what you've got here is on the left of your screen, you've got the stamp set. On the right of your screen, you've got the die set to cut the characters out. And these are all individual stamps. They've got catitude. They have. They have. I mean, I personally love these. Um, and the last time they were on, they just absolutely flew out. Um, and you can see the reason why, obviously, in the samples, because they're, they're totally amazing. They're a little bit kind of um, contemporary, but I like it that the way that no matter which way you stamp the cat, they're always looking at you. They're always looking at you. They're always the boss as well. If you take a little look at some of the finished cards here, because you can colour them in however you wish to kind of replicate and, and look like your cat at home or someone else's cat if you want to. But they're cheeky. They've got a wonderful expression on all of their faces. They're whimsical and they're fun. And remember, because you're getting the die to cut them out, there's no fussy cutting needed, but you can also just use them as silhouettes. Oh, of course, yeah. And don't forget, you've got some amazing sentiments in there, there as well. You've got... I've got that loving feline. Yeah. But there, there, there are so many. Oh, I love it. How many um, sentiments? <coughs> have you? You've got a few. Uh, you've got, I've, I've got that loving feline. What else yep. have you got in there? You've got, uh, wherever I lay my cat, that's my home. Yep. I have a perfect day. Hope your feline better soon. Love it. Yeah. So it kind of it kind of ticks most of the boxes for cards that you maybe want to send people as well. Yep. And especially if they're cat lovers, that really works. Exactly. So this is just giving you some ideas as to how you can colour them, how you can kind of compile and put a card together. Now, they should be dies and stamps together, $23.98, which I think you'll agree is a really, really good price. But this is, now we are together with Visible Image at Hobbymaker, as we are one, we can do deals like 
this. How? I do not know. Boom. Oh, wow. 14 pounds. <coughs> Excuse me. 14 pounds. Oh. 99, it's taken his breath away. I nearly choked on that. <laughs> 14.99 for the stamp set. 14.99 gets you both the stamp set and the dies together. Wow. I mean, it's almost like, well, if you halved it, £7.50 for the dies, £7.50 for the stamps. Yeah. Very busy already. DKXC94 is the product code. DKXC94. And also think about the number of people that make cards for Animal Rescue. Yes. I mean, these, these took absolutely ages to get back in. Um, and, you know, I know people kept on asking, oh, when are they coming back in? When are so they're here now, so, you know, here's your chance. Here's your chance, absolutely. 14.99, be quick if you want them. These are going very, very fast. I've got a screen full. How much has gone? 20% of the stock has gone. 20% gone in literally a minute or two. That's how busy we are for those. I thought they'd fly. Now, the other set we're going to show, we've got three to show you to start off with, and we've got some others a bit later on after we've done, the, done a demo. Capturing time. Now, this is totally different to the cat one, the feline one, but it's still got that visible image appearance and kind of twist. Yeah, I mean, uh, you know, I'll, I'll show you something really cool with that later on, um, but I love a camera, and I know it may not be, um, you know, the, the day and age where people use phones, but... You know, this will look amazing, honestly. And I love the uh, the fob watch as well with the, the cogs and everything behind Absolutely. it. Um, it's great if, if people maybe want to retire. It could be, it could be a, a lot of different occasions. And you've got words like, if not now, then when, question mark. Yes. Also, capture every moment. There's separate stamps on there as well as words. But then you get the main image of the camera and also the clock face. Let me show you some of these amazing finished cards here. Look at these. Now, where are we going to go with this? It's TAXC39 for the dies and the stamps. If not now, then when? Wait for this. $9.99 for the both. Wow. Unbelievable. That, that is amazing. Absolutely amazing. I mean, you know, they're the kind of pocket money things that you're going to make some amazing cards with, honestly. Honestly, when I was looking at the show earlier, my sheet did not say 9.99. I don't know what's happened. I don't know who's authorised that, that reduction, but <laughs> you're getting a £5 price for the stamps and a £5 price for the dies. You get the dies and stamps together for 10, under £10. £9.99. pence. Grab it while we've got it. It's very, very busy, as you can imagine. T-A-X-C-39. Alex is a little bit worried that he may have taken it too low. Um, don't worry about it. <laughs> We're going to honour it. Nine ninety nine for both the dies and the stamp sets. Okay, under a ten pound note, one PMP for the whole day's orders. So if you bought something already, that's a nine ninety nine delivered price for new stamps and. Oh, actually, are they are they dies? No, there's no dies. Just the stamps. beg your pardon. They're just stamps. Beg yes. your pardon. Sorry, my mistake. So two stamps. Okay, stamps. Okay. Stamps and dies with the cats. Stamps with those. So both of those stamps nine ninety nine. Okay, so that's T A X C thirty nine. Okay, now a message from Yvette's coming through as well already. Hi, Yvette. Uh, Yvette in Greater Manchester says, love the cats, just ordered and would happily have paid £23 <laughs> for them. What a bargain. Thank you, Visible Image, Yvette in Manchester. Thank you, Yvette. Thank you, yes. Not a problem. You're getting those cats and those dies for that price that we showed you earlier on. Okay, so both of these stamp sets, my mistake, beg your pardon, £9.99 for both of those, TAXC39. Now, the next set we're going to show you this is striking silhouettes. Now, this, when I came into the studio, I just popped out to get a cup of tea, came back in, and I just looked at this. I thought, oh, my word, this is so visible image. Yeah. Um, obviously, you've got this, um, you've got great imagery, but you've also got some great sentiments that go with them. You've got this stay wild horse, like it's it's jumping out of, could be, it could be water, or, um, it, could, it could be anything. Uh, but, the, you know, the sentiments like stay wild, don't let them tame you. You've got sometimes uh, what you're... I can't, remember, I can't even read that from here. Sometimes what you're most afraid of doing is the very thing that will set you free. Absolutely. Now, they are so unusual, so different, and it gives you the effect that you would struggle to do in any other way. The stamp yeah. has been designed so that you can just enjoy playing with them. And the image kind of comes from nowhere. It kind of comes from that, that almost like visible noise in the background. Then suddenly you see the horse's head. Then yeah. suddenly you see the phoenix's head and wings. Yeah. 
wonderful, wonderful, wonderful images. Both of these together should be 25.98. So basically they are 12, nine, no, 13.99 each normally, 13.99 each. Sometimes what you're most afraid of doing is the very thing that will set you free. Stay wild, don't let them tame you. Uh, we rise by lifting others, a verse is on there as well. Okay, you can have both for 14.99. So you're only paying one pound for one of them. That's that's absolutely amazing. It's, in, it's, it's totally absurd, but brilliant. Uh, 14 99 it should be 13 99 each. You're getting both for £14.99. B-A-X-C-16. And look, if you're using the stamps with like your sticky ink and then doing some embossing powders and things yes. like that over the top, mm -hmm. how incredible does that look? I mean, you're not going to get that anywhere else. You're, you're going to, you know, you're creating actual pieces of artwork, so it looks totally amazing. Okay, well, we're busy for absolutely everything in the show. Please fill your boots, enjoy, and we'll get to the other items after we've done our first demo. But, mm -hmm. Mark, over to you. Okay, so I think we'll start with the cat. Okay. Um, I absolutely love this set, so um, I think the first thing we'll do is we'll stamp one of the cats out. So I've got a piece of card, and I'll use a good old-fashioned stamping block, um, and I've got some nice black ink. This is the Versafine uh, Black, uh, Onyx Black. Mm -hmm. So I'm just going to stamp it. Ink it up nicely, and we we'll just place it down here. And obviously, if you if you're new to stamping, um, give the ink a chance to uh, transfer from the stamp to the, the the paper or card, whatever you put it onto. Mm -hmm. And always hold the block in at least one hand. I try to not let not let go because that will stop there any smudging. Okay. So when you when you think you're you've got a great image, then you just lift it off, and Perfect. there we go. So crisp. So the next thing we want to do is I'm going to clear emboss this. So let me just get some clear embossing powder. So if you haven't got any clear embossing powder, honestly, invest in some. It'll be the best decision you've ever yeah. made. I mean, I use big tubs, so um, and I also label mine clear, so I would don't mix it up with uh, white. With the white one. Yeah. yeah, that's one of the worst things you could possibly do. It. Okay. Now, already a third of our big stock of this has gone. Dyes and stamps combined, remember, is what you're going to be getting. So half the stock now, John. Oh wow! So I'm just heating this up now, and you know when you colour these in, you can you can make them any colour you want. Whether you want to go for you know contemporary colours or traditional kind of cat colours, mm -hmm. these look absolutely amazing, and they're timeless. You know, some things may age, but these are a classic. And to be fair, if you've got any masking sheets, and if you haven't, they'll be on our website, you could really mask off each cat as you do it mm -hmm. and end up with a whole kind of colony of cats, couldn't you? You could, but don't forget, children. you can actually, you can do that, but you've also got the ability to obviously die cut them out and then just layer them up. True, yeah. So you could do it that way. Like there's, that. There's, there, yeah, that's exactly it. So you can physically die cut it out and do it, or mask, it's up to you. Now, I'm just going to use an alcohol pen, uh, just colouring this in very, just quickly to give you an idea of what it actually looks like, and then we'll move on to the creating a card. I'd love a purple cat. Um, How cool would that no, be? That would stand out in the neighbourhood. Of course, yeah. You know, <laughs> again, you can colour your cats any colour you want. If you want to be nice and bright, I do like having a bright cat, but uh, yeah. Um, my, my stepdaughter, she's uh, been after a cat for a long time, and every time she comes home from uh, uni, she's always saying, please, can we have a cat? Please, can we have a cat? <laughs> and I keep on saying no. Oh, I know, bar humbug. But um, there, there's a possibility that that may change when we move house. We'll see. OK. So, uh, yeah, <laughs> we will see. Um, oh, I'm, I'm not promising. I can't imagine my house without having a cat in it. I've had cats ever since I was like five. I, I know, I know, I know. You know, I, I can I can understand why they're so appealing because obviously, you know, they, they, they're just so cute and cuddly and, you know, they just come and sit on your lap. And, and they're independent. Yes. You know, I, I couldn't have a dog with the, the job I do and stuff. I'm away from home no. so much, but a cat, yes. So again, I've just coloured around it very simply, one single colour. You don't have to be an expert at uh, colouring. You know whether you're using expert at using alcohol pens or not, it doesn't require that for, for doing this particular job. So let me just move this out of the way. Uh, now we're going to jump onto the creating the card. I'm going to use a stencil, and this is the Stars and Stripes. Okay. Um, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to get my Distress Ink, uh, which is black soot. I'm, I, this is going to be monochromatic. Background's going to be monochromatic, but I want a nice 
bright cats in the, in the foreground. So we're just gonna go in. I'm using the stencil in a different way, not the standard stars and stripes. I'm using the stripes in the, down the center. Right. So that could be anything. That could be a fence. It could yes, be of course it could. Stairs. Yes, you know you could do it any colour you want. It's going to be look totally different. Do you want the stars and stripes stencil? Should be five ninety nine. Not today. You can get this stencil right now. Three ninety nine. What's what's go, what's going on upstairs? I know it's good though, isn't it? <laughs> three pound ninety nine for your stars and stripes stencil. And remember, the great thing about us is that you know once you bought one thing, the rest of the day's free P and P. So YK2382 if you want the stars and stripes. I think um, Liam needs to see a doctor or somebody. I think, I think he's got all the prices <laughs> We've been saying that for months. <laughs> but also the stars, you know, if you don't necessarily want to have the American flag, it's not no. appropriate for your project. The stars can be for anything. Stars yeah. in the sky, someone's done well, congratulations, whatever. So again, this is, I'm, this is exactly what I'm doing. I'm kind of using it in a non stars and stripes way. Yeah. But it'll still look amazing. So. We've done one side now. I don't want to. I want to. I want to match it up. So I'm going to put, transfer it to the other side and put some stars on this side as well. So just quickly spin it around. Okay. I might just go over that just a little bit more there. A little bit darker for my monochromatic background. Again, this is a background, so it's not too important that you get it perfect. So just lift this up. Mm -hmm. And you can see already we've got something that looks quite nice. Yes. But we'll just up that ante on onto how good that looks. And I'm just going to drop it straight over where we put the other uh, stripes. Well, um, with Laura in Arizona is watching and ordering. Yes, it's uh, the American flag, obviously, and we do deliver visible image to the USA. So if you're watching us in America and you want to get your stars and stripes or anything else from this show, you can do. Remember, your shipping and handling is capped at $12.95. No matter how many orders you make between midnight and midnight, you can order on the website. You can go to the little tab at the top of the website where it converts the website into dollars. Um, and you can order to your heart's content as many things as you like from us uh, for $12.95 capped shipping and handling. So now we have a background. So we need to populate that. So I'm going to stick this onto my card blank. So I'll just quickly peel that off to save time. Mm -hmm. It's great to off. see um, lots of you, obviously, in the UK shop with us every day, and it's great to see you and where you're from. But occasionally to see a, a USA town or city is quite I have to, I have to just glue it on. So I get my tape gun and glue it on. That's right. Okay. You could have got a bigger one. <laughs> yeah, needed a bigger boat. Okay. So let's just take that down. Okay. Oh, there we go. And we're quick. I think I've got to do that that way. Yeah, that way around. Okay. So I'm going to stick that down central. Perfect. Okay. Oh, no, it's not. So why isn't it not sticking? I don't, what's, we're, having a, we're having a bad a bad day today. I'm not sure what's Is happened. It double sided. I don't know. Have you got any double sided tape? Actually, no, just, uh, can I glue it on? Have we got any double sided? Have we got any red tape? Uh, yeah, we did some, had some in the last show. I'll get some for you. Thank Over you. Le yeah. Levi's going to get some. <laughs> I think it was a, f I think my, my, my tape is, my thing is glued to the back for some weird reason. How bizarre. I know. It doesn't normally happen like that. But al always on live TV, it's always going to happen. There we go. Cheers, Levi. Thank you. So we'll just stick it down with some red tape. Okay. How did you get it? There you go. Thank you. Okay, well, while you're getting that out, let me just remind you that remember, all the deals in the show are on the website. If you want to go to hobbymaker.co.uk, you'll see the fantastic stamp, the stamp and die deals we've got for you. We've got some um, fantastic stencils in the show on the way, more stamp deals as well. But yeah, all at ridiculous prices. Basically, we're clearing the to make way for more new visible image products in the future. So this is an opportunity as we're clearing the decks for you to grab these bargains. Um, and the uh, Love of the Feline Stamps and Dies, $14.99 for both the dies and stamps is ridiculous. It's going very quickly if you want yours. These are some of the people on the bottom there that have actually ordered these already. Lots of you uh, having your names on the screen there so you can see your own. <laughs> you got into it all right? Yeah, yeah, it's all good. good. So I'll just cut this off now. I don't, you know what? It's the first time I've ever, ever used the red tape. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh. I do like it's it. The, it's good. It's the toughest stuff. Yeah, it is good, isn't it? I'll just peel this off and stick it down then. Yeah, just peel the back off and uh, I ain't going to move anywhere. So, just peel that off. Come on. It's the first time I've come on. He says, 
How do you peel? Need a pokey tool, probably. Oh, I will not fight with this a second. The adhesive is fighting back. <laughs> it's winning. Mm. Why can't I get this off now? Um, if you push it really hard, press it hard down, and then that red should come off quite easily after that. I'm having a fight here. Right. No, don't worry. Right, we'll, uh, we'll have to... We'll just imagine it's stuck. Yeah, we'll, okay. we'll imagine it's stuck down, so it's fine, we'll carry on. Right, next thing we're going to do is we're going to populate the, the card. Mm -hmm. And I've already coloured in some cats, so we're going to lay them on top and we're going to glue They're cool cats. Down. Yeah, I thought four colours, that'd be really cool. So we're just going to get some 3D glue. Yep. And you've got tall, thin ones, short, fat ones. Yeah, what kind of cat is your cat? Or, you know, what cat mine, does mine, yours look like? Mine is a naughty torsi. <laughs> and my vet told me, when I took her to have a checkup recently, right? that all tortoise shells, or most, 99.9% .9 of tortoise shells, are female. Really? There are hardly any male tortoise shells. I, didn't, I never ever knew that. I thought she no, was joking. I didn't know that either. April the 1st, but no, she's, you know. And they've got real attitude tortoise shells. So, live TV, we're, re we're recovering from this... Um, so we're doing well, good. So we're gonna place this cat down here, I think. That looks lovely. I mean, that one's got an expression rather like mine, very superior. Um, don't all cats think they're superior? Yeah, they rule the house. <laughs> Quickly stick, oh, ooh, nearly dropped nearly. that. That was nearly, wasn't it? It was very close, that, right. Bit of fingers today. My cat's going to overlap there. Message from Mo in Essex. Hi, Mo. Hi, Gent. She says, I Hello. wasn't ordering anything this month until I saw visible image. Oops, oh. things are just feline into my basket. So <laughs> oh, well. amazing. Right. You're after a job, aren't you? She'll get it as well. Yeah, exactly. So we're just going to place that down here. Pun composer. And we are certainly getting there now. Now, I've got lovely sentiment, so yep. I will show you that now. Now, so, these are some of the sentiments that are in with the cats as well. Remember, you're going to get about one, two, three, four sentiments. I've got that love in feline. Uh, wherever I lay my cats, that's my home. Uh, hope you're feline better soon and have a perfect day. Perfect day. How many dies do you get in there, actually? One, two, three, four, five. Um, one, two, three, four, five. Five dies. Five dies? Four, five. four. Oh, is it four? One, two, three. Yeah, four dice. Four, four dice. dice. Yeah, so each, for each of the cats. Yeah. So that's my finished card. Apologies for I have not sticked down the base, but that is kind of pretty much it. Don't Again, worry. monochromatic, but the cats are the things that you want it to really stand out. And look at the print as well, that kind of old-fashioned typewriter font. Uh, yes. With a bit of white embossing powder on a black cardstock. Looks really cool. Yeah. And I did a little something inside as well, so let me just show you. Let me just open that up. Whoop. Let's show that around now. So, and we also put, oh, that way around, we've got meow with the paw print as well. So that's how Oh, that's that in, works. yeah, that's on the stand yeah. too. Yeah, yeah. You've got the word meow, and you've also got the little paw print too, all in there. Uh, those, both of them, the dies and the stamps for fourteen ninety nine is exceptional. Okay, so we've shown you the first three sets, okay? Uh, I must admit my favourite has to be the Rising of the Phoenix and um, the Stay Wild. I love those two together. Okay, now the next sets we've not moved on to yet, now, the Stamps Trio, lots of you found this on the website already. We've got Look Forward, Affirmations, and Brave and Strong. And you get all three of these stamp sets, okay? So this one, first of all, is Brave and Strong. So you've got, uh, you'll get through this storm and feel the sunshine on the other side. Sometimes it's okay not to be okay. So proud of you, my brave, strong, amazing friend. Uh, you don't have to be perfect to be beautiful. Don't look back in anger, look forward with hope are all of those. And if I turn them around so you can see, gorgeous, you've got the rays of sunshine there and you've also got the clouds as well. So that's the first one in the set of three. Next one, this one is your, what's that one called? Which one's this one? Affirmations. That's the that affirmations. Affirmations, yep. that's at the top there. Uh, I'm grateful for every day. Laughter is contagious. Stay humble, be creative. I choose to let go of past mistakes. Gratitude helps you love the life you already have. Um, be content with the here and now. 
You're strong enough. Positive thoughts create positive things. Happiness is found within and believe in your dreams. All of those, all really positive, positive messages. They're beautiful and that wonderful heart is a stamp in there as well. Then the last one is brave and strong. So this has got find courage, be brave, ha uh, have faith and stay strong. You've also got uh, close your eyes to the past, open your mind to new beginnings. You've got no matter how you feel, get up, dress up and never give up <laughs> like that. Life can be tough, but my darling, so are you. Um, and then scars are just a reminder of the battles we have won in loads of different fonts there. Yeah, it's, it's, you know, Helen comes up with the uh, lots of the words and then I just have to turn it into something that looks pretty good. <laughs> it looks really good. And the words are just so profound and brilliant and positive, yeah. which we all need at the moment, don't we? Uh, so, I mean, those are, am are amazing th trio. You know, obviously you can do so much with those. Yeah, definitely. Thirty-eight ninety-seven is the normal price. Thirty-eight pounds and ninety-seven pence. Today you can have all of those, and I dare say, unless you bought these before from Mark and Helen, you haven't got any sentiments like this in your collection. I'd be very surprised if you have. Twenty-four ninety-nine for all three sets, and you've got so many stamps in there for that price. Twenty-four pounds wow. and ninety-nine pence. You know, maybe lots of your customers or people that you make cards from can really relate to these, and, and you know, they, they mm. resonate with you. Yes. Yeah, I mean, I, I, you know, again, I, these are the kind of things that you would use time and time again. Yeah, without a shadow of a doubt. So just JQXC58, 24.99 gets you all three of those. That's the first set of three. And then the other set of three that we haven't shown you yet are these. Um, oh, I haven't shown you some finished cards. Beg your pardon, my mistake. Let me show you some finished cards with those affirmations on. There we are, look, you'll get through this storm and feel the sunshine on the other side using that cloud stamp you get with it as well. You'll get through this storm. Oh, I love that. With beads that have been threaded. Isn't that brilliant? It's a great idea. It's like looking like, yeah, because they, they actually move. Like yeah, it's like a, a well, yeah. <laughs> I love that. I've never that seen a such an, like that such an original idea. It's brilliant. That is brilliant. Well, that's just a little bit of cotton or, or yeah, twine or something yeah. like that. And some um, seed beads. Love that. Uh, it's okay to not be okay. Yep. You know, when, you know, people are going through lots of things, so, you know, Gratitude helps you to love the life you already have, ain't that yeah. the truth? Then be content with the here and now. So lots of ways you can mm. use these. Maybe just use the verse as the main focus or embellish it and decorate around it, but yeah. lovely. And then the next set of three are these, which is Hang On In There, Lost In Music and Catching Dreams. So these three are, again, I remember doing these with you before, this one, love it. So this one, has got the chandelier. Look at that beautiful, beautiful chandelier that you've got there, look. There's, the sentiments are brilliant as well, aren't they? Absolutely. You know, you light up my world, I like that one. So and you've got the chandelier, you've got, yep, you light up my world. Hang in there. Brighter Hang days are there. coming. Brighter days are coming, there we go. And if I just show them to you. There we go, look, loads of stamps on there. Yeah. And you've got that kind of distressed cut mark on there as well. Really handy, really useful. So all of those. Next one is Catching the Dreams. Now this is obviously the dream catcher. Yes. You've got Free Spirit, Dream a Little Dream, and you've got some li little distress splodges as well. Yeah. I, f I find those really hard to do. Mm. You, you can't do them, you know, um, like naturally really, because normally they'll go somewhere that where you don't want them exactly, to go. Exactly, yeah. This way you can get that random yes, effect. Totally. Exactly where you want it. Yep. And then the last one is this one, which is lost in music. We can all relate to that. Yeah. Where are the headphones on? Maybe that's your daughter or a niece or a granddaughter or best friend or whatever. Uh, again, if you struggle with um, you know, cards for younger members of the family, let's say teenagers, that sort of thing, yeah. uh, most teenage girls would appreciate a card yeah. like that. Well. Yeah, I mean, I love it. Lose yourself in the music. Yeah. Doesn't, doesn't that totally make sense? Absolutely. So you're going to get all three. All three of these, and I'll show you some finished cards quickly to give you some ideas and inspiration. So let's have a little look here. Um, this is one that I remember from, from you from a little while ago. Love that chandelier. Reminds me of like Phantom of the Opera. Yeah, isn't that brilliant? You know, a little bit of uh, obviously dis uh, sprays that have been let to drip down. Yeah. Um, it looks totally amazing. There's your dream catcher. Catch the bad ones, let the good ones pass through. Another yeah. amazing card. Yeah, there's with white embossing powder. Yeah. And this is. Oh, now is this clear embossing powder on the actual dream catcher and then die cut feathers or cut out feathers? I, th I think it is actually. I think they've cut the, I, th I think they've actually fussy cut them out and laid them up. Leanne Harris has done that. Yeah. Really good job on that one. And look, 
having fun coloring in the skin tones and the hair. Yeah. She's funky with pink hair. Lots of people have pink hair these days. Uh, Leanne's done that one as yeah. well. I mean, it's, really they're, they're, it's very easy to color that in, actually. There's not a lot of... of th you can't go wrong, really. No, the stamp's done most of yes. the work with the hair. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Thing. All you need is a nice skin tone. Yeah, pen. Uh, yeah, and you can do that very, very easily. Okay, well, it should be, for those three sets, 3897, DVXC25. You can have the lot, all three, for less than £20. Wow. <laughs> I know, less than £7 a set. Nineteen ninety nine. it's about £6.50 a set, something like that. Uh, DVXC25, you get all three, okay? So, fill your boots, enjoy. Uh, you've saved yourself an awful lot of money. You've certainly saved much, much more than the cost of your P and P. Right, Mark? Um, I thought we'd do something with Stay Wild. Okay, great. Okay, great. Um, so, the first thing I'm going to do is, I've already got um, a piece of card that I've previously sprayed you know every, you know crafters i've got loads of like excess bits and pieces all stashed away there that they've used i couldn't even remember what color i actually did it it's probably some kind of distressed blues and and greens uh teals but again you know again you just save these pieces and you'll always come back to using them at some point mm -hmm. So the first thing I'm going to do is I've got my lovely large horse and I'm using a stamping platform because this is a large image. So, you know, you want to be, you know, you know if you're going back in, having to go back in, then you're better off having a stamping platform. Fair enough. So I am using some uh, Versamark, which is a clear sticky ink. And Stay Wild, remember, is the one that's got the horse, the horses. Uh, and you'll get alongside that that fantastic Phoenix, the Phoenix Rising as well. They're, they're my, I must admit, they're my two favourite stamps in the show today. Love them. So, and we're going to use the clear ink and then we're going to emboss with white embossing powder this time. So, obviously press nice and hard to get that image to come through. Can't get over these prices, Mark. No, I know, I know. And Liam's gone home. Maybe he's gone to the doctors, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> right, so we'll take that off now. And obviously you can't see anything. No. But we'll use some embossing powder now and we should have a gorgeous image come through. Okay. So this is the um, Versamark sticky ink pad. They'll be on our website if you want one of those. Just move this out of the way. Are you enjoying being here at uh, Hobby Maker, working upstairs with the team? I just, <laughs> I just spilled that there. Well, didn't see it. No, you didn't see it. No, did anybody else, right? Okay, so. It's, it's yeah, you enjoy, you enjoy yes. being here, yeah? Yeah, love it, absolutely love it. So we've got this lovely image. Oh, look, there's the horse. So all we need to do is we'll just heat emboss I'll him put now. Back in there for you. Oh, sure. thank you. Now we've got a message actually from someone I believe in Sweden. In Sweden. Oh wow. Uh, oh wow. Okay, this is from Jeanette. Uh, Jeanette Sferich. Uh, hi Jeanette. She has fantastic stamp sets on display tonight. I cannot recommend visible image enough. Great quality stamps and dies, Jeanette from Sweden. Oh, great to hear from. You. That's amazing. Do you know, I don't know any much Swedish, but I do know a couple of Swedish words. Go on. I don't know if they're not swear words or anything <laughs> like that. Um, I know uh, Kalianka right. and uh, Moosey Pig. Moosey Pig? Yeah. Is that a Swedish character? It's, um, Moosey Pig is Mickey Mouse, I do believe. Oh, OK. And Kalianka, I think, is Donald Duck. That's what I think they are. That's what I've been told they are, anyway. So it, you if, may have been told something for a joke, and it's if I'm wrong, Jeanette, please, please correct me. <laughs> no, I'm pretty sure that that's what they are. Okay. So we've got this lovely, uh, like distressed, uh, grungy horse, mm. which is lovely. Um, the next thing we want to do is we want to get um, some uh, a nice uh, stencil that we've got here, and we're just going to stencil through. So this one is your breaking glass, yeah. Yes, and it's a things. lovely stencil. So I'm just going, just going to go in. We're going down for the breaking glass stencil. This is going to fly. Three pounds ninety nine. That look of jagged, sharp glass. No, that's that's crazy. I know it's crazy. So I'm just going freehand, holding the stencil as I'm going around the image, just to bring bring that touch of glass through. It's like the horse is uh, shattering um, mm. the air. Breaking free or Yes. Whatever, yeah. So I'm just going to go around, hold your stencil in place. 
Well, Elizabeth's in for the uh, breaking glass stencil. So is Laura in Arizona. If you are watching us in America, yes, you can order too. Cap shipping and handling of $12.95. No matter how big or small or heavy or light your package may be, that's all you pay. Uh, so lots of you are joining us from the USA. Hello to John, uh, Martin John in West Sussex. Hello to Caroline in East Lothian. Laura in Fife, Vivian in Highland. Oh, 3 wow. 99 for a stencil of cracked glass broken panes. The, and, and it was a very hard stencil to create as well, by the way, you know, to get it just right. But it does look absolutely amazing. I mean, if I hold it up so you can see. There you go. Look. That's a big stencil too. Yeah. 3 99 Don't miss out on it. It's incredible. And you could... Um, in emboss this as well. Yes, you certainly can, yes. Yeah. You run it through your embossing machine, you'll get an embossed cracked window or pane. Love it. So I think we're pretty much done there. Now it doesn't look like you can see anything, but once I do the reveal, you're gonna see that background coming through there now. Look at that. Again, look at that. very subtle, but it, it looks- It is like the horse is jumping through a cracked window, isn't it? Yeah. Doesn't that look lovely? Dramatic. So the next thing we wanna do is we'll create a card. So I have my background, and let me just stick this down. And I don't have the same problem I had earlier, because I must have done something wrong. <laughs> there we go. Sometimes if you put like double-sided sheets in, in like sunlight and stuff. Yeah, like that, I, don't, I honestly, I don't remember what happened, but it's, you know, I've got to move on, not think about it, you know. Don't lose any sleep, though. No, 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 no point. Right, so we have this gorgeous, um, image now. Now the next thing we want to do is we need a sentiment to go on there as well and I'm going to take one of the sentiments from the Brave and Strong mm -hmm. because it's a lovely sentiment and I like that this one here. I personally like find courage, be brave, have faith and stay strong. I think that's brilliant. Again Hel Helen's sat there and she's obviously uh, she's so happy that it's, it's been used and created because uh, it was her idea, her words. Mm -hmm. Um, of course, a lot of the actual words that you've got in the other stamp sets, you can kind of use them with different images. They don't have to stay yes. through to the images in that particular no. pack. Mix them up. No, and I, tr I try very hard to make sure that, you know, most of my sets will work together with each other, mm. no matter, you know, it could be five years old um, and they'll, they'll still work really well. Yeah, exactly. I kind of, I think about it when I'm creating them. And I think, personally, I don't know what you think at home, from your messages so far today, you seem to think the same as me. Visible image are incredibly distinctively different. And I love it for that, because it makes your cards different. It makes you stand out at a card fair or a craft fair with different things. So we've got a lovely image there. And I, I like that. That's what I do like. I love that. Beautiful. So, and I also did a little something on the inside as well. So just keep the camera on there for a second. So on the inside, we have the other sentiment that's in that set. Yeah, Sometimes perfect. what you're most afraid of doing is the very thing that will set you free. And obviously it's got some little horses as well. So I stamped that on the inside as well. Well, if you want that stamp set then um, that features the um, Stay Wild horse, this one here, that, that's the stamp that's just been used in the demonstration. It's absolutely gorgeous. And the, the horse's head kind of appears from nowhere and the front legs appear from nowhere as well. But then you do get the smaller horses as well, uh, which we used on the inside of that card then, but you get those two wonderful verses as well. But if you're going for that, you are gonna get as well, the same style of the Rising Phoenix. It's so dramatic and beautiful and different and quirky. We rise by lifting others. Hope is another stamp on there as well. Yeah. You get both of those today and they are just 14 99 for the two, they should be 13 99 each. So, so a really good deal. Yeah, I mean, I've got a few ideas. You don't have to stamp that in black either. No. You know, if you uh, use a, your stamping platform, maybe go in with uh, Versifying Claire orange or yellow, and then just dab the edges, and it looks like real, this realistic fire. I bet, I bet it does. Okay, now we've got a lot of stencils in the show. Uh, we've only shown you two so far, so let's show you a few more, and we'll, we'll show you some finished cards as we go as well to give you some ideas. This one's called Breakout. So breakout, not quite as dramatic as the crack window, uh, but similar sort of idea here. And using it with the, um, the camera stamp that we had in the show earlier on, that works really well as like a background to the camera. Today, yep, we're doing it again, £3.99. What about that being a futuristic clock face? Wow. That works. They're all gonna be £3.99, all the stencils. Are all the stencils on the website now? Oh, they're not. Okay, so they're going to go on one by one as we show them to you. So that one is Breakout, if you want that one. Next one is Fragments. 
So this could be the result of the crack window, fragments of glass Ooh. afterwards, maybe. Uh, a bit mosaic-y, that one? Yeah, I mean, you know, it's nice to have something a little bit different. It works for so many different occasions, whether it be, you know, you're creating something uh, contemporary, uh, oh, that's used on golf, that's a great card. Yeah. Um, it's great for birthdays as well, so exactly. it's really, really useful. And that proves you don't have to use the whole stencil, just part of it. You know, it's up to you whether you use a fraction of it or the whole thing. And again, all of these stencils, because they're made from top quality mylar, will emboss in an in in embossing machine brilliantly as well. So three ninety nine, you're saving two pound at least on each of these stencils. Next one is your this one is your baroque frame. So this one's slightly more traditional, um, and it's got the wonderful flourishes and swirls going all the way around it. And here you can see you've got almost like a little fairy tale character in the centre of it. So a little bit softer that one, a little bit more uh, maybe feminine but beautiful nonetheless, absolutely gorgeous. And again, you don't have to use the whole frame if you don't want to. Are these round about six by six or seven by They're seven? They're all six by six. Six yeah. by six. They're all six by six in size. So again, that one, 399, that one's called your Baroque, Baroque frame. Time tunnel, now this is more, this is more visible image. This is really visible image, isn't it? Yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a great, it's a great uh, stencil. So, so useful. Uh, it's not, one of my favorite ones. Do not adjust your sets. <laughs> Hours of fun. Um, well, uh, you could put one of the other cats that we got in the show in this if you wanted to. Anything in the middle of it will yeah. be the focal point, won't it? Yeah. I, again, you know, your, your eye is just drawn to the centre. And I've actually created a card with the uh, the Cheshire Cat, which is a, a, another stamp set that we've got um, on a spinner, on a on a actual CD, so that you can spin it round and it rotates. It looks amazing. Oh, I bet. Wow. Three ninety nine. If you want that one, that one's called uh, Time Tunnel for obvious reasons. Uh, we've done the breaking glass, so I'll skip over that one. Uh, we've got fibres. Oh, now this is using the Phoenix. Oh yes, because that actually looks like licking flames. Yeah. Although it's called fibres to look like fabric and things like that. Look, does that work? I'm actually. Th I think I actually made. Did I make that card? It looks like I've made that card. I don't know whether I did, but maybe I didn't. I don't remember. I take credit for it. It's fantastic. <laughs> if it hasn't got a name on it, I probably. Oh, I did make it. You did make I, it. No, I, normally, it's mine because I haven't signed it. <laughs> we rise by lifting others. That is such an uplifting card. Isn't and that, that beautiful? yeah, I mean, the, the stamp set for the price is amazing, uh, but that stencil as well. Yeah. It's great for whether you're doing waves, flames. Um, it could be that underwater. way. Underwater. It looks amazing. And tell us what sort of ink you used for that. So everyone at home will be wondering. For the background is just normal distress inks. Yep. Um, and then obviously on the foreground, it would have been versifying clairs and probably a combination of using that like a yellow and an orange. Don't quote me on exactly what the names of those colours are um, because they have funny names like sunshine or and uh, yeah. marmalade and things like that. They have sure. funny names to them. So, but they are amazing. And as I said, all you do is uh, put the Phoenix on, on your stamping platform and then stamp it once in yellow and then just go back in there using the edges of your, your ink pad to, to make those flames look. The orange. Yes. Yeah, love it. And that's, of course, using the fibres as the licking flames in the background. Really effective, that. Love that. Uh, you're loving that stencil, I've just been told. Right, next we've got uh, one more, I think. Time flies. Okay. It's time flies. So rather like the Phoenix, this is a little bit more... Um, angular rather than the phoenix kind of coming from virtually nothing and are emerging this you've got the positive and I think you've got the negative yes you have so you've got the positive and the negative so you can actually um, ink around the actual positive bit to have like a silhouette or you can ink through the actual cutout of the stencil and you've got that lovely uh, word time and the flittering birds coming off the lettering uh, letter E there as well look at this now Jane Tyrrell's done this one on the design team isn't that go absolutely gorgeous? And that's just, you know, you wouldn't think that that was just a stencil. No. Look at this. I mean, obviously... Ali Karubi has done yeah. that Yeah. I mean, obviously, you get the stencil plus the mask of the bird as well. So you can just, you know, use the bird on, in its own right. Now, remember, if you're watching us in the UK, of course, it's 1 p.m. per day of 3.95, as it always has been and always will be. Um, with the USA, if you're watching us there, uh, cap shipping and handling for you of just uh, $12.95, no matter how many things you order from midnight to midnight on shows that we can supply to the US. Not all of our shows, we can do that, but when we can, we put that little message up on the screen. Visible image is one of them, because we have the stock here, and we can, of course, ship ourselves directly to the USA. And we've already had some USA orders in the show tonight as well. Tell your friends. Uh, uh, and spread the word about visible image because is visible, visible image readily available in America or not really? Um, well, we've got a few stockists out there, okay. Um, but obviously, you know, um, 
please please order from us if you can as well. Yep. Get so yeah, makes it easier. Where, wherever you can get the problem, that'd be great. Thank you very much. We do appreciate every single order. Absolutely. Okay, so we're moving on to the next demo. This time you're going to be using <coughs> the. I'm going to use the capture every moment and fragment stencil. And the fragment stencil. Okay. I, I, for some reason earlier on, I was calling it fractured. I don't know why because fragments. Yeah, I don't know why. I'm an, I'm an idiot. It could be. <laughs> fractured. Yeah, but it's fragments. It's called fragments. So, so capture every moment is basically that fantastic camera, mm -hmm. and also you're going to get the pocket watch stamp as well. Both of those stamps for nine pounds and ninety nine pence. But again, the detail in the stamps are phenomenal. So I'm going to go in. You know, sometimes you go through a phases of monochromatic kind of backgrounds. Well. We're doing this now. We're going a bit more monochromatic on the background, just the background. Mm -hmm. But I think this will really work um, with this particular stamp set as well, um, because obviously cameras are normally kind of black, aren't they? Yeah. So I think this will work really, really well. And I wonder, I wonder how busy the camera market is these days. Do you know, I think it's still, uh, maybe not as busy, but I think, uh, you know, professionals will still go for... Traditionalists will still buy yeah, cameras, yeah, yeah, they would, yeah. Uh, I mean, obviously, they're going to get an amazing... Uh, image uh, even with your phone these days but I mean obviously for zooming in and things and, and doing special effects yeah. you want to go for a pro camera well I found a camera of mine that when I bought it a few years ago cost quite a lot of money and someone said to me it's not worth anything now <laughs> yeah well there is that you know obviously it's like technology you know uh, your iPhone uh, 3 or 4 now is probably you know, worth nothing compared to what you True. originally paid for it yeah. Um, yeah just things move on don't they yeah I remember I bought one of the last the last kind of like big uh, you know, the old cathode ray tube TVs. Oh, yeah. And I, I think I bought one of the biggest ones that they had, but, you know, nobody wants those anymore. It's all yeah. flat screen, so... They'll come back and be antiques in the future. You <laughs> yeah. So I'm not being too fussy with this, and I'm actually using... I'm using... Look, can you see that? Oh, I'm using... One of Beth's yes. blending brushes. I know. Thank you, Beth. Well, I'll say thank you. I kind of like... I, I'm using it without without permission, I think. It's probably still in the air, actually. She's yeah, off the I know. This afternoon, so. <laughs> I know. Um, by the way, Beth is really grateful, and she wanted me to thank you for making her feel so welcome and the support when you were buying Kingston Crafts over the last couple of days. She uh, messaged me on Facebook last night. She had an absolute blast. She loved being here. So all of Kingston Crafts goodies that are still available, you'll find on our website, by the way. And she brought some amazing snacks she over did. as well. <laughs> So. I, I've never liked pretzels in my life, but you know, the ones she brought, I'm hooked. I want them. Well, the crisps were something as well. Mm. Can you want to tell them what, what kind of flavour crisps they were? Crab. Yeah. I don't think you'd, you'd get but, crab, crab well, crisps I, in I, the I UK. Don't, I, don't eat, I don't eat fish. I don't eat shellfish. I, I don't, I'm not interested. And I said to her, oh, no, 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 I can't <laughs> eat that. And she said, no, it's not crab. It's, 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 what, it's the yeah. seasoning we put on crab. And it's nothing to do with that. No, I know. It's, it's strange, isn't it's it like strange? Why, why call them crab then? I don't understand the... Well, uh, they use it to season crab meat. Oh, OK. Evidently. Yeah. But, mm. but I didn't so. like them. <laughs> they, they were nice. Yeah. Um, right, so I've taken this off now and we've got this gorgeous background. Uh, the next thing I want to do is I'm going to uh, put this onto my card blank. Make sure it's not an Australian one. So that stencil, by the way, if you want it, the fragment, wasn't it? Yeah, fragments. Fragments, yeah. £3.99. All the stencils in this show, three ninety nine, two pounds off each one. So if you buy five of them, you save to tenner. So and we've got, now this looks amazing. I think it looks really nice. Now, the next thing we want to do is we need to stamp the uh, camera. Yes. So I'll get my camera out. I meant to, meant to stick it to my block, so we'll get that. Just move this to one side. Mm -hmm. And there's something really quite cool about having what presumably a lot of youngsters these days would think of as an old fashioned way of taking a picture. Yeah. Um, there's something on YouTube, I think. I'm sure I've seen it on YouTube where they've had like some um, like teenagers try to work out how to use the old uh, dial up phones. Oh, yeah. And they, they, they just <laughs> they don't have a clue. <laughs> oh, brilliant. So it's really funny that, isn't it? But do you know what though? I think I think things like this, these cameras, will come back, like CDs have and vinyl. I, I think everything's got a cycle. Yes. I like yeah, like yeah, vinyl and vinyl vinyl's got a huge comeback, isn't it? Yeah, massive. So let me just stick that down. Now I'm going to use some Versafine. Which Versafine? I've got two different Versafines on the go here. I have one that I've just recently re-inked, mm -hmm. so it's juicier. You can never have too many. 
No, no, I've got about, I normally bring about four with me, you know, like just in case uh, something doesn't, doesn't go right or you, your ink pad dries out. Nothing worse. Um, no, no, you don't want that to happen. Now, we've got a whole range of VersaFines on our website. Um, lots of suppliers to us at Hobby Maker bring us VersaFines. So have a little look. Just put VersaFine in the search box and all of the ones that we have available will pop up. Now, obviously, using the stamping platform because I'm wanting this image nice and black. So you go back in there. That's exactly what you're after. Which one are you actually using? The VersaFine? So a VersaFine Onyx Black. Onyx Black? Yes. We'll see if we can find that. Onyx Black. Yeah, we'll find it. It's a, it's a great it's a great ink because it's great for detail as well. Mm -hmm. So we just lift that off now. Oh, that's crisp. And you know, this is what you're gonna get, a, a absolutely fantastic looking camera. Now, I'm not gonna clear emboss it now because I've already got one I've already done. So we'll move on to the next stage. Okay. And I'll show you one that I've actually embossed. So I bring my card blank back in. So this is one. We got it, we found it. Here it is, it's on our website right oh, now. Oh wow. Uh, if you want it. It is £7.49, I think. Oh, well, that's great. Great price. Oh, we can put it on the screen. It's coming up now for you. So we can have a great camera. Now, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to use some 3D uh, glue. I'm going to stick this to my card blank. Oh, and it's INPQ91 if you want the Onyx Black VersaFine pad. Now, one of the, uh, I want to show you a few other things. And I don't know whether this is going to be embarrassing for Helen or not. Who knows? We'll see now. Mm -mm. <laughs> so yes, you will, I mean, maybe you want to change, turn the channel, but don't, please don't, because I've got something kind of funny to show you. So stay tuned. Um, so I'm going to place this round about here. Helen's not reacting. She's not, is she? Yeah. No, I think she knows, what, I think she knows what's coming. Anyway. I don't. <laughs> right. So and now I'll tell you what I have done as well, is if you want your camera to, I mean, obviously it looks, it looks flat, doesn't it? It's flat. Yeah. Although I've it's raised it up with bit, glue, yeah. yes. But you raise it up a bit more by stamping another one, cutting out the lens, and we're going to stick that down as well. It's going to look amazing. Okay. So and then um, you can put maybe a, a glossy accents or a, a I've already, if you look, it already has got glossy accents all over the lens. Excellent. Just on the lens, so it's going to look absolutely fantastic. And you can go in two or three times with that glossy accents, and it's going to look, you know, stunning. So this is the, nearly finished this. Mm -hmm. So just line that up. Okay, now that's starting to look like a real camera now. It looks, it looks fantastic. It does look great. Now, I'll leave, I'll leave the, the best bit to last. So just give me a second. I'm gonna stick these sentiments down because I've got them here. Are you working yourself up to a finale or something? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, everyone's like, oh, what's he doing now? What's, what's going to happen? I'll show, I will show you, honestly. I thought it was funny. You're building the tension. I know. <laughs> Is that what I'm doing? Right. So I'm going to put this, I'm going to capture every moment just there because I think that looks really nice. Uh, and we'll have a moment there. Just that there. Right. I know everyone, everyone's waiting. What's what's happening? What's he going to do? I'm not going to dance or sing or anything like that. Thank God. Right. So we'll put that there. Just clean that glue up. Mm -hmm. Okay. I do love white embossing powder on black cardstock. Yeah. Very so dramatic. We, yeah, exactly. And and I I do like having the you know, embossing, you know, the words in, in on black and white. So it looks amazing as well. So this is the finale, okay? So I've got a little bit of space up here and I wanted to fill it. So I decided I have... Do you want a drum roll? No, not really. <laughs> <laughs> I have two photographs here and I'm going to put these here. Now, who's that? Right, well, you'll never guess that that is m me and Helen. No! Yeah. Really? Yep. So let me just stick this down as well. And then you can see the finished card. I mean, I, no, Helen, Helen, obviously, obviously, well, when you see the, uh, what Helen's doing, she's obviously maybe gone to a maths class, I think, some accounting, I think she's doing some accounting. She did, was an accountant, so she was into accounting. Did you um, know each other when you were that age? No, oh, right. no. So let me just put that, I mean, she's doing counting something, I'm sure she is, look, you can see, can't you? I thought she's picking her nose for a minute. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> no, she's um, 
She's counting to two, I think. Oh, OK. <laughs> she hasn't changed. Oh. Brilliant. Maybe that's when she, that, that's her road rage. <laughs> <laughs> right. But how special would that be? Maybe some, someone's got a milestone birthday and you yeah. talk to a relative or a friend and they've got images of that person when they were three, four, five years old or whatever. How old were you there, do you reckon? About um, five, four? Probably, maybe, probably four, something like that. Right. So I think we've got a lovely finished card. That, and isn't that great? That's exactly how you could use this. Yes, absolutely. Great demo. That's great. Okay. And uh, did I do something on the inside on this one? That should go up in your lounge now. I did. Hmm? I did do something. So I took a sentiment from the um, the uh, affirmations. Affirmations, yes. Yeah. So I've got gratitude um, helps you to love the life you already have. Okay. And a lovely heart that comes in there as well. Now we've literally got a couple of minutes left. Just to remind you of the three the three first deals that we talked about. Now the cats, I've got to be I've got to be honest with you, the cats are absolutely flying out the door. You've got the stamp set and you've got the die set, okay? And I'll drop a few of the cards in. Look. You can have a lot of fun with these. You don't have to use all their bodies if you don't want to. You can just have them peeking over objects if you want to. You can cut them out using the dies and put one in front of the other and others behind each other. Make a whole kind of a whole kind of colony of cats if you want to. But they've got great, great attitude. Uh, you've got I've got that love in feline as a stamp verse. You've got have a perfect day. Hope you're feeling better soon. So both of those dies and stamps to cut them out over seventy percent gone at fourteen ninety nine. We then went to. The camera and the clock face, which we called, what do we call that one? We've got capturing, capturing time. Moment. Capturing yeah. time. So you get both of those, the camera that obviously um, Mark used in the last demonstration with the words capture every moment. And then you've got, uh, if not now, then when, as the sentiment with the uh, pocket watch or the clock. And then the other one, which I must admit is my favourite, that's two stamp sets there for the price. And then we've got the brilliant Stay Wild and the Rise of the Phoenix as well. So the horse and the phoenix. Brilliant, brilliant interpretations in these stamps. Great designs. You'll have an awful lot of fun working with those. Sure. And I must admit, my favourite card using the Phoenix was that orange one, which I've put down somewhere. Don't know where it's gone now. Oh, it's here. There you go. I mean, look yeah. at that. If you want to recreate up that, get this stamp set and go for the Fibers stencil, and you can make that card. That is just my favourite. Do you know that. what? I'll probably re recreate that card on a, on a YouTube, so please do okay. follow me on YouTube. Um, what do you search for on YouTube? Probably visible image. Okay. Is this visible image? Yeah. Yes. Search for visible image on YouTube and you'll see Mark show you how to do that card. Thanks for your company. Thank you. See you tomorrow.